<clears throat> uh, hello, chat. Welcome. Uh, I'm the Dope Master 93. Welcome to my stream. Hello. Uh, the colors do look different because I dialed an update for my capture card. So it kind of reset a little bit. I mean, how do you like the colors? Do you like them or not? Should I? I don't know. I don't know what to change, honestly. Uh... Hey. Is that better? The, the wood looks pretty good, huh? That looks better, right? How do the clothes look now? Yo, pause to shooter, the homeboy, man. Give us up to nobody. Thank you, man. I appreciate that, homie. Man, there's nobody at Thieves. What's going on? Let me go check Telegram. He's got a day started chat. It's better, but the dark. Uh, let's see here. It does look pretty dark, actually. Mm. I should help out. Should be much better. Lakers are cooking. How? What's the score right now? Why do I feel like Blackwater is safer to go to instead of Armadillo? Hey, puppers. A cute dog. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? I'm gonna fake my. I'm gonna. I'm gonna take my chances with going to Blackwater. We'll see what fate decides for us, chat. Let's see what happens, man. What could, what could happen? Oh, so what's gonna happen? You guys even get recognized? I love this song, by the way. One of my favorite songs right here. I have a glove outfit actually. Let me see. Do I have gloves for this outfit? I do.
is this? I see an opportunity, boys. I see a long arm. Howdy, howdy. Is that you, CV? Wait, she knows me? Wait, do I know who you are? We met a couple of times, yeah. What is your name? Emma. Emma? Mm hmm. Huh. I'm kind of like a. It's like a squirrel brain. I remember stupid shit all the time, so. Mm. Well. You're not remembering stupid shit because I'm I am very important, so that makes sense. <laughs> no, Where have not. we met, Emma? I'm trying to remember. Oh, let's say San Denis. Did I rob Was you? A... No, you didn't. Okay, I thought so you were I'll going get to. a chance to rob you then, is what you said. Mm, maybe. That is a very nice gun on your back, and I would like it. Mm, are you sure? I am pretty sure, Emma. So... Are you trying to take this from me? I mean, I can try to take it or you can give it to me. What do you prefer? I'd prefer to keep it. Okay. Mm. Well, then you can keep it. Alright. Where have I met you before, Emma? Uh, San Denis. San Denis. Taylor. Mm -hmm. Taylor. Oh. And back then, I was saying that I came west of New Austin. You said that you want to bring glory back to you, the west. Oh, that was a long time ago. No wonder I remember. It's yeah. like a month ago. See, that's what I said. I'm kind of a what have you been brain. doing now? Well, trying to work for the paper. I think I'm going off what you recommended me do. I see. But you're not going to come out west. I went out west today. I like it out west. I'm sorry. Mm. You know, if you didn't like it out west, I would have definitely robbed you. That would have been the final <laughs> straw that made me rob you. So, <laughs> no. at least you have that going for you. I do love it there. The paper? Really? Mm -hmm. Why the paper? Because I like writing. Mm. Get to hear about some stories, post them up, and maybe I can write some. You See. know that people are looking to push. Well, I might have a lot of stories that come your way. I'm gonna get your telegram down and maybe I'll send some things to your. Yeah. Just let me know. I'll meet Great. with you and we can talk about it. I have to leave here pretty soon. I got some law. Alright. I'll be back. Just telegram number FA344. Okay. FA344. Yeah. I think they heard my voice, so I gotta get out of here. Anyways. Alright. Take care. Take care. Yeah. They hear my voice? Julian, is that you? Julian? Yeah. Howdy, howdy. Come with me. Oh, um, they got speedy. Who's got speedy? Oh, uh, the law, but there's like eight of them in town and six of them going now east. Oh, uh, why do I care about speedy? I don't know. I was just figuring I'd let you know. Oh, I, I thought something happened. Mm, probably. I've been hearing about them shooting down people left and right, so. Come this way. I'm heavily one. I need to leave town. Law might be showing up. Come this way. Come on. Yep. Actually, before, before we leave, hold on. Before we leave. Oh, there's a, there's a fella trying to get a moonshine run too. Um. Perfect. We can do that for sure. Go go to the stable hand. Let him know your your, your um saddle looks a bit off. All right, that's fine. I, I gotta I, grab that man from town too. I'll wait right here. This guy comes up to me and tells me they got speedy. Why do I care about speedy on CD? <laughs> well, they got like, you know, Uncle or like Rebecca or Aurora or Winsmore. Julian's funny, dude. He's funny. Yeah, law info is pretty good. I didn't check my telegrams. No. I'm stuck. You fell asleep in the middle of a row. You're more important. Let's go. 
Um, a horse stuck. Trying to get off and whistle it. There we go. Oh, you're good. That was weird. Come on. Wait, the fellow won't do the moonshine run? Yes, an older fellow. So, uh, okay, walk me through. What has that happened so far today? Um, I think uh, Aurora, Jabass, and them went out to the canyon. Oh, they're out west? Um, to my knowledge, they are. I went out there and I didn't see no one. What was this? Um, let's, go, let's go to Riggs. I didn't check my telegrams. And then... Might want to be careful because there are a whole group of law that went out east. When was this? Um, literally like less than 10 minutes ago. Who's in Blackwater right now? Um, at least eight law. So Joella Speedy. And some other people. Um, Speedy's the only one who got caught, apparently. And were you, were you riding with Speedy when he got caught? Or what happened exactly? How do you know he no, got caught? I was just in town and I, I was being nosy. And then I heard them say that Speedy was down in them. Oh, shit. So I figured I sent well, Speedy is with the dead end kids, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah, they're looking at heavy time as far as I know, so he's fucked. Unless we get paid for it, I'm not going to break him out. Oh, I know. Scout and Dakota are still my friends, so... I'll oh, that's why. Them. Okay, well, if you want to help yeah. him, that's fine. If you want to break up and help him with that, I understand. Yeah, I'm not I fault you. to break him out because there's so much law over there. Here, baby. Yeah, you need a group of six at least. Uh, it's Miss Abigail Jones. Look at that. Yep, and there uh, was another man. He ride with um with Edgar Lopez. Lopez. His name was Nathaniel Green. That fellow was also in the cell. No, I was just um, catching you up with what happened after. Oh, I see. Okay, gotcha. Um, what else? Um, Buster and his crew came through trying to do moonshine runs. It was kind of like the hot time, so everybody was um doing moonshine. Yeah, we're gonna move some shine tonight too as well. Um, I saw Everett and Ronnie, but I ain't seen them since they went out to Blackwater. And roughly, when was this? Yeah, I need to check my telegram, see where everybody's at right now. I know Ron has sent a bunch of people telegrams just trying to um, get a hold of them, but apparently Jabass never got a telegram from him. Let's see if I got something from everybody else then. Why don't you finally get the feedback? Oh my god. Oh my god. Too many telegrams? That was almost a page and a half of telegrams. Zips got back, had to meet someone Gorman back in the cross and telegram when you're awake. Okay. Oh, Helen. Definitely love to meet Helen, okay? It's one way to uh, make Rebecca upset. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Let me know when you are around. They've run out of my favorite scotch. Scarlet, I'll be around all tomorrow. Let me know when. Yeah, I'm around now. Everett got Becca's gun from Zip. Oh, they got that done. Must have been uh, yesterday, last night. Oh, I missed it, huh? Look up. 
Feels good, not gonna lie. Hopefully I can run into some of you somewhere out west. Um, I know you and a bunch of your group are still wanted, as I am. Yeah, we're wanted right now. Uncle said, figure out I sent something in case no one else thought to zip today and got the gun back. Rebecca, Rebecca was gonna end it. No more war. It's done. All right. Okay. North of Big Valley, Fallow Creek, all the way. That probably is, is Telegram, Brawny, around, will be in Thieves. Canyon, where we headed. That was what? Three hours ago. This one. Okay. Thieves landing. That should be now. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. I'm out. CV, we spoke briefly in Blackwell. Let you know that if I'm successful in obtaining a position with Cindy Lee throughout the Lord of about the West, I hold an affiliate, uh, held an affinity, sorry, an affiliate, affinity for the area too, and would like to see it thrive. Emma. Okay. My love. Or out West looking for Jim Parker and trying to rob people. Lots of law around Blackwater. I'm going to deal today. Still have big policy right into Strawberry too. Be careful. Telegram and your link. Okay, so coming back to Thieves. My queen, wake. I can't spell apparently. All right, so guys, some good news. It seems like they're coming from San Diego. They're out west doing some, some um, you know, different kind of activities. So let's wait for most of them to get back to uh, thieves. But if you wanna ride off and go help out with, with whatever, I understand. I'll wait for them thieves landing though. Oh no, I ain't too worried about it. I just like to give out the information where the information's due. And I really appreciate that, Julian. Listen, yeah. did somebody approach you about um opportunity with a group in thieves? Um that Nathaniel Green did. Okay, well I'm not talking about that fell, I'm talking about the folks from Thieves, so um my uncle James Kelly. He's looking for people that can ride with him out of thieves. He's looking for a group that you can be a part of one day. He's looking for folks that ride with him. See how they do and if they fit, they'll bring them in. If they don't, you know, they don't, right? They go their separate ways. Um. So if that's something you're interested in, unless you want to be a lone wolf by yourself all the time and not have to worry about any company, I get that, you know, whenever just join, but... If you're looking for the, the benefits or the perks of being part of a, a policy one day, we're looking for folks. And uh, you've been, been a great addition to Thieves. I've been helping out a lot. And one of the few folks I actually like from Valentine. I appreciate that. So if that's something that you're interested in. It, just because um, you kind of harm the people that um, I actually... See his friends in Valentine. Oh, I see. No, okay. it's no hard feeling. No, I get that. I get that. I mean, I mean he he keeps on taking Miss Lily's guns and everything, knowing that she ain't gonna use them. Um, I mean, my and, uncle's a piece of shit. There's, there's no doubt in that, right? I mean, I'm a piece of shit sometimes. Feel the people in the cross. It's just, I'm just letting you know. I don't want you to feel like you're being excluded from anything else. That's all. I'm just laying out there for you. I got you. I just feel like he he don't got time for people that got morals. So, well, not morals, principles. Right? Yeah. Kind of go hand in hand. I mean, shit. The first person I ever killed was over vigilantism. Was it? Um, two people went in harm. Um, robbed. My friends in Valentine, I went to go talk to them. They turned at me with a shotgun. I shot. Um, and one of them died. One of them almost died. And it just so happened. And this was before Ronnie was riding with y'all. Um, but apparently one of them was Ronnie from what he was explaining to me in the speaking. God uh, damn. Yeah. Valentine. We all have the best uh, memories in Valentine. Absolute despair when I think about Valentine. There's always somebody somewhere that does something stupid. I robbed this poker table in Valentine, right? I had this guy at gunpoint. Instead of you know, surrendering and letting me rob him of, his, of his, the money he won from the poker game, he slapped the gun on my hand and ran off. Oh. And ran toward the lull and drew his weapon on me, saying he's ready for some shit. 
I never wanted to shoot somebody down more than my entire life at that moment. But I knew I, sh I shouldn't because it started you shooting out with the law. Yeah, that's a little extra. I know whenever I sit at the poker table, I tell people if you're sitting at the poker table, you better be willing to draw your weapon. If you're not, you might as well stand up right now. Yeah, I'll get there, yeah, but when you, got, when you got five people getting to jump on you, at least, you know. Yeah, that's a little bit different. Don't, don't get me wrong. I would want to be ready with my gun on my table, too, as well. That's one of the things I could never do, is rob somebody at a poker table. See, look, I don't care when it comes to that. I mean, money is money. Oh, it's sometimes, it's sometimes I... I want to make sure I do it the right way, right? I get that. Yeah. I get it. If there's money to be made, there ain't no time to spare. Mm, not wrong about that. Yeah, you fell asleep in the middle of the road, so we went to go um, ride around. But if you want to talk about um, Moonshine or anything else, this the man that you want to talk to, even though I do got a batch ready, so... Howdy, howdy, howdy. Charles Devon, nice to meet you. Oh, no, well, you good? Uh oh, you're an old fella. He might be having a headache. Hey, Julian, I'll buy that batch off you, by the way. Oh yeah. Yeah. I got a batch and a half. I'll let you know where it's I'll at. Buy everything off you. So if you wanna go get it and get it ready for me, I'll take it off you. Oh, I got a, no space. I'd rather show you, that way you already know where it's at. <laughs> oh, I see, I see what you're saying. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, all right, oh. well, why don't you show me All now? Right. Look look, look at that, time. would you look at that? So, yeah, let's go this way. I found one, of, by the way, I really appreciate you placing all those boxes around thieves. That's gonna help yeah. a lot, a lot. That's what I'm trying to do. Um, I'm trying to do as much as I can. Howdy, howdy, who's this? I think there's a local. I better be a local. I better stay away from my shine. Oh shit! So I, thought about, I thought about putting some ammunition over here too as well. Damn. Okay. Be careful because if law get on top of here, then that's all there's now. I know about it. So that's one crate, and then there's another crate right here. It's in that box. Oh, this one. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. So perfect. I got a total of uh, how much you want for that? Um, I was charging that fella 150 for his first run, and if he shows true that he can do it, then I'll drop the price to like 100. So, but for you, I'll give it to you for whatever y'all's price is. I mean, I'll do 100 if you're okay with that. Who's this? Uh, I don't know. Oh, this is, um, Nathaniel Green. Howdy. Yeah, I'm howdy. Charles Devon, nice to meet you. Okay, nice to meet you. This is one of the men that you uh, you needed to talk to, uh, Nathaniel. How can I help you? I don't quite remember. Work, money, things. Right. Well, yeah, I actually want to talk to you about something. Come this way, both of you. Uh, Isn't this a guy that is uh, trying to kill John and June? I mean, I, I gotta figure this part. I was riding through. Thanks. Yeah, if you're wanting, by the way, there's been a lot of low out today. I am definitely one. I'm looking at some fucking heavy time, but I'll let yeah, him try same. something. I want to dare him. Howdy, howdy. Howdy, pal. Can I help you? I uh, just riding through. Julian, is that you over there? Yeah. You know this doing? fellow, Julian? I do. I do. For some. Oh, I asked Julian. I, asked you I, I forgot what his name was. I'm sorry. Uh, that's all right, Julian. It's Vern. Vern. There you go. Vern. It's a nice name. Charles Devon. Hey. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Charles. He's Jesus one of the. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Damn. I take it that, that horse was, wasn't yours. No, that horse was definitely mine. What the fuck? What oh. the fuck? Yeah, you gotta treat that horse better. It's clearly, it's not like you. Jesus Christ. This is one of the fellas that likes to do shine runs and other things. Oh, this is the fella you talk about in Blackwater. Okay, all right. Uh, no, the old fellow was the one that wanted that likes to do oh, shine okay, most okay. of all. Wow. 
this fella, I kind of... I mean, I will do a moonshine run. Do I like to do them? Not so much. Mm. Well, I mean, I got one for you ready. If you're interested. Uh, maybe. I'm kind of looking at a lot of time in Cisco, so I don't know if it's worth... How much I'm looking at? at, the moment? at least 600, 700. Okay, we're on the same boat. Right now, yeah, we're on the same boat. Laws after dead end gang right now. So you might ha this might be the perfect time to do anything. It might be the perfect time to do it, or the worst time to do it. I think that old man wanted to do it though. We can let the old man do it, honestly. It'd be better that way. Uh, Phil. Yeah, I've been, so, I've been mm -hmm. chased around by like three groups of law today, so. Jesus Christ. Yeah. A lot of law around. Good. Well, right now there's four of them doing um combat training in the lumber yard. There's four of them looking over speeding. And then there's six of them that headed out east. So hopefully Fucking your hell. uncle don't uh, run into them. But I know James went out west as they were coming out east. Who's your Damn. uncle? My uncle's not around. Um, not around Thieves, but he's coming from Thieves. He's coming from San Denise. So he'll be here in a bit. You looking for him? I uh, was. Just need to have a word with him. Uh, spoke with him on Guam the other day. He's a... Uh... Friends of my brother, apparently. Hmm. And who's your brother? Uh, Benjamin. Benji. Oh, Benjamin. Well, you fell from Gorma? To... Well, you're not from, from Gorma, but... Oh, the yeah, good guy Gorma. does Gorma stuff. Yeah, the mayor, right? Yeah. Right, Benjamin okay. used to work for, um... For Sam. Ooh. For your uncle's uncle. Oh, yeah, yeah, that, that, that fella, yeah. Okay. Oh, I gotta go give Winsmore something. Okay, well, um, um, Green, let me talk to you real quick. Uh, Vern, why don't you right. wait for him? My uncle should be here any minute, okay? They're coming from San Denise, so. Sounds good, appreciate right. it. Hey, hey, Vern, you come yeah, across any, uh, there. weaponry? Uh, hey, uh, Grandpa Paul, come this way whenever you get a chance. Hood himself? I know it's funny. Yo, just look at the brain of yourself, man. I appreciate that. I cannot believe we almost have 400 subs on the Dope Master. Dude, what is going on? That is crazy. Shot, thank you so much. I mean, Berg went insane last night. Homie dropped 75% of my sub count on this on this channel in one stream. Well, um, I want to pull you aside and just um, talk to you about what's going on with John Grace and his gang and everything like that. If you can just kind of give me your side of the story. Because I've been told some right. things are just... Do not sit well with me. So I want to hear from the source. I came to you to talk to you and see what's going on. Because fellas in the cross and are saying this and that. And honestly, I don't believe things I hear from the person themselves. Right. Which you should. You should go to the source of the information every time. Always do. Always have. Right. Well. See, I can find out when people uh, are bad at what they do. When they have the wrong goal in mind. See, these, uh, Grace Gang, I used to run it. It's called the Green Gang a while back. Until yeah. I got locked up in Sisica for a while. Oh, John Grace took over. Now, I was joined back up with them a while later. But, uh, then seemed off. It's like the goals were more about family than, uh, business. It's like, uh, every day they were bitching about some drama. What the? That's They're Wolf, right? Good. Yeah. Uh, Lobos might do something. Let's just wait and see. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Probably should run over there. Y'all good? We're shooting right now. Lobos, 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 come on. Hey! Hey! Fellas, drop your weapon! Come on now! Yo, 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 watch across, watch across. Yo. You good? Julian, you good? And I wish the Lobos weren't so aggressive all the time and Jesus just fucking Christ. drunks. Just some good fellows, but we have to sometimes. Oh, what the fuck? What the? You good? More, there's more, there's more, there's more, more, more. Behind the wagon.
Jesus Christ. I shot them wolves out of town. I'm not sure they got fucking pissy. Get rid of the bodies. Get rid of the bodies. Bury them. Throw them somewhere. Throw them to the fucking water or something. I'm out the way. Well, somebody calm down the horses and not acting wild. Grandpa. Morning. I'm still shooting right now. Ah. Go in front of me. Real quick. I'm one of them. Go in front of me. I got this uh, fella, Nathaniel Grayson. He's the fella that we're um, worried that he might go after June and John. I want to talk to him real quick. If you want to join in the conversation, feel free. I want to make the big fear right there, yonder. Oh, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm going to be there if you need me to. Um, Sorry, green, 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 not Grayson. I don't know why I fucking said Grayson. I don't know why I got that name from, honestly. One's more. Don't ask me on that one. We need to talk to fish. What's going on with fish? Well, the whole fiver thing, right? Yeah, I mean, I told them pursue after fiver. Right. Right. But he's lying to your uncle. About what? About not Oh, not yeah, yeah. He needs to talk to my uncle. He needs to talk to my uncle right. and tell him how I feel. So, okay. So, the <laughs> get this right. So, Forrest is, I guess, ranting or... Just speaking to uh, June about everything, and then guess what June did? <laughs> she went to my uncle. Yeah. yeah. June is a little shit. She's an absolute Man. shit. I don't trust that girl at all. She might be my niece, yeah. but I do not trust that girl. Well, she reminds yeah, me of Jesse and Fiber. Yeah, so I I'm going to talk to Fish one on one today. Just people here. I should. <laughs> Oh, it's that, uh, that guy that was looking for, uh, Rebecca's Richie? dad. <laughs> no. Richie. Is that Richie or no? No. Oh, Richie's probably in the back, yeah. All right. Yeah, it's definitely. What were you saying? Sorry, I'm trying to remember. No, you're fine. So, uh... Yeah. You said you were talking about how it was more about family and not business? Repeat that line one more time. Right, was... So they had drama 99% of the time, and I'm a business venture and fella. All right. I want money in my pocket, okay? Are you a businessman or an outlaw, or are you both? What is exactly you do? I rob banks, kill pendejos, gun down pendejos. Mm. Right. Take it as you will, yes. That makes sense, okay, all right. So, Understood. they weren't doing that no more. Robbing banks, they were more about family and drama. So I said I'm leaving. Now, before I left, there's this fella named Judith. He's a part of the gang as well. Looks like a fucking leprechaun with all the green he wears. Where have I heard the story about Judith? Oh man, I'm just trying to remember. Go on, sorry. Right, so, me and him went out to rob a fella. A fella named Edgar Lopez in Strawberry. And we put a gun to his head. And all of a sudden, he had more people with him. Surrounding me and Edgar. Now, Judith took off and ran. And so I was left there. So, I struck up a deal with Edgar to, uh, work some business with them. And Edgar's deal was for me to shoot Judith. And I agreed. Now that Pendejo left me with a lot of people around me. And it was either I get shot, or I do business and shoot him. So I liked your business, fella. I decided to shoot him. Co took him to a building, and I put six rounds in him. This pendejo went to the law and ratted on me and everyone I was fucking with, fella. Yeah. So, Grace Gang found out. After I'd bank robbed a bank, um, they found me in Blackwater and knifed me and stuffed me in a fucking building. I even took off my gun and holster. See, there's some fucking unloyal sums of bitches. But, uh... Or James Kelly's not working with them no more. 
Seems that Kelly. What did this happen? What did the tech look at? Uh, yesterday. Yesterday? Who was president when it happened? It would be Edward Carr, Judith, and. No, no, sorry, not Judith. Uh, Edward Carr, John Grace, and Barrick. Hmm. Right, so what do you know about June? June. That was John's girlfriend. It but was. Now they're no longer, uh, yeah, was. What do you mean, was? Now they're no longer, uh, dating. Like, like they were dating, which is why James Kelly liked them. But it seems something happened there where June no longer, longer likes them anymore. And Wait, I've been whoa, striking whoa, whoa, a business whoa. with Kelly. Hold on, hold on, yeah. hold on. You're saying June doesn't like him no more. So it was one side. No, they're not. What do you mean? What, I'm trying to, what I'm trying to ask is June broke things off, not John. I think John did. You sure? I feel I don't know. Okay. I could be wrong, but I John did. How'd you hear about this? Well, Kelly told me. James Kelly. Yeah. So okay. an armadillo. Huh. All June right. was riding with Kelly earlier. Yeah, they should be uh oh, around. Oh god. I'd assume. Jabas oh, told me to be here. That's why I came out of thieves. Yeah. Okay. Met him up in uh, Saint Denis. Understood. Go on. You hear what I said? Oh, I didn't. No, go ahead. Oh, I said uh, understood. Go on. Go on about what? Oh, just, you know, you finished your story. Sorry. You know, I kept interrupting. Yeah, you're fine. Well, see, uh, I don't know really how to put it. It's like, John thinks Kelly is his friend now, right? Which is why he decided to stab me with his friends. He thought he, uh, if I started a war with him, it'd be a big war that sparks between everyone. But after talking to Kelly, it seems, uh, they're no longer amigos. So John's alone, and he's still housing a snitch that he's not letting go of. In fact, Miss he knows Uncle about now. the snitch. Mm. Yeah, he knows about the snitch, but won't do anything about it. He thought it was fine that he told the law. Interesting. Okay. All right. Well, look at that. My uncle's here. Let's see what's going on, okay? Yeah. Chat, are the colors fine or no? The clothes a bit washed. Mm. Morning, Rebecca. What about now? Howdy. Are you okay here? Yeah, I'm just having a little chat. Hey. How you been? been a lot what's going on what's happening okay so yesterday we met nathaniel green and we fucking threatened him yeah i just had a conversation with him actually funny enough like extensively threatened him J james kelly did your uncle did i did like we were up his fucking neck with it right and then june stuck her neck out for john and pulled in favors with what she considers her family, like James Kelly. Okay. And John went over to James Kelly and had a meeting with him, and James Kelly agreed to um, try them out and see how they would work under him. So John basically offered his gang to James Kelly. What but is he doing? Only, uh, but, but James accepted only because 
of June. I don't understand. And then, six hours later, he decides to, uh, I don't know, have this meeting with Nathaniel Green, where his gang ultimately stabs Nathaniel, and then John comes to thieves in probably the worst disguise ever, according to June. It was literally just him in a fussy pawn show. Um, and says that he's in hiding and that she's now in danger because they've done this. What and a fucking idiot. And she's like, what the fuck's wrong with you? Like... How does you go from this to that? How, how, do, how do you... How do you... After the talk I had with them and everything and the lengthy chat we had and the conversation, for oh, him to pull worse. off the obvious, it's almost like it we predict this is going to happen. It, it gets, gets worse. way, way worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Jesus. he's harboring a snitch in his gang. Oh, yeah, Nathaniel um, just told me about that. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. And June told him, like, it's not okay for him to, like, go and tell law things. And John had said, well, of course he's going to tell law if he's injured and someone have hurt him. Of course he's going to tell law. And you said, no, the fuck? No, you don't. If you're planning on doing something about it yourself, you don't fucking tell law. And he didn't seem to get that. And then I also found out that apparently, you know how he was going to take June to Guarma? Uh-huh. June was the one that had to pay for the tickets. Jesus. Can't even provide for June, can't even protect her. Mm -hmm. Did not and take then, away anything we talked about in that conversation. Went back on what we talked about. Why go after Nathaniel? You, you have something going. Get that revenge another time when things are better. Why do people rush to things so fast? Why yeah, not just then, plan it, be ready, and do it at the right time? It's, it's not going to matter when you do it. And then... He chose his gang that he doesn't trust one day and then trust the other day and then doesn't trust him again the next day over june so june said yeah, god help me if i see john this. god help me is he still on james uh, this... no he james is saying good riddance and so yeah god I. help me if i see john because i'm about to june go off and john have a split waist and june was the one that decided that you know what i deserve better uh, but she's upset um, and she feels remember, like she's been made a fool out of. What'd I tell you? She feels stupid. She Less feels experience. like an idiot. Yeah, that's it's, okay. It's not that's on okay. her. That's okay. Those feelings will help her get stronger. Yeah. Howdy. I'm uh, sorry to interrupt, but... Uh -huh. Look at my cool gun! That's what you interrupted for? Yeah. Wait, how'd you get that? It's a top hand gun. Oh shit, did they rob somebody? Uh, I think... I think, uh... Julian bought it from the Irish. Perfect. I have two, two Taipan guns now. This is Wei's gun. Damn. Let's make it three here soon. Come on, let's go catch up right. with everybody else, see what's going on. Uh, I'll let you yeah, I right. basically said... Uh, I want to tell John that he owes her $250 for the fucking ticket because that's why she didn't have enough money to be able to go home. And Javas had to lend her money to go home. Um, and then also, he's no longer welcoming thieves. Yeah, fuck John Grace. She doesn't want him to get hurt though. And I think that's fine. We can leave the hurting to Nathaniel Green because I'm so over this. But I do want to ban him from thieves. Right. Oh my god. Uh, I can't see no more. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, they they sell like that. Yeah. You all on drugs or something? Because I don't see yeah, shit. There was a thunderbolt that hit like literally right behind the um the house. Oh, oh god. Right. See. We'll see it. Oh right. god. Let me talk to this fella real quick. There. Howdy. Howdy there. How do you do? Doing quite well. Hell of a day. Hell of a show when I come on here. Yeah, welcome to Thieves Landing. <laughs> well, it's my kind of place. Exciting. That's good to hear. I got told you're looking for work. Is that true? That's right. That's right. I specialize in a bit of shine running, but, uh, you know, I'm game for just about anything. All right. Well, we got some product that needs to be moved. 
You the guy for it? You bet your sweet ass I am. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Well, I'm willing to offer you a good deal. Uh, if you want to accept. All I'm asking is for 125 back. For one run, you can keep the rest. And if you get caught by the law, it is what it is. You don't have to worry about paying me back. Hey, I understand if I get caught up in anything, all that heat lies on me. <laughs> I'm done time already. I can do a few more. Exactly. I'll go grab the bottles. I'll be back, okay? I'll be right out here. Do you want to come this way? Yep. Yeah. Uh, Rebecca, come help me with this as well. Mm -hmm. I might have to throw I'm gonna, some things. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, um, to pay you 100. All right. I'm charging 125. I'm making 25 off this, honestly, because uh, I don't right. have to worry about the risk. I'm gonna throw some uh, things in some boxes. All right. Real if quick, you could so grab it for him, I'll grab half if you want to grab the rest of half. I can carry probably five. Yeah, five bottles. All right. Just remember, there's like a batch and a half in them. Yeah. I'm gonna grab. Um, I'm gonna grab the full one first. All right. Sounds like Billy Blasters on crack. Trying to get some work moving on fees right now. We also need to yeah. get, get a lot of mash if you want to help me out with that tonight. I can yeah, help you. I am all yours. Better be. Nobody else. <laughs> I have to admit, I had to sit on Ronnie's horse though. I'm gonna break his legs. <laughs> We both said that if our partners knew, they'd have our heads. Probably. But we didn't do it because we wanted to. We did it because we were stuck with one horse. So long as it pays, all right. drove me to drink. Julian, go grab the other one. I got this one. All right. There you go, fella. Take this. Um, it's me 125, like I said. Okay, 125. Hey, nephew, do you have any? Do you, uh, I got do you about a hundred and eight. You want to call it even, and then I'll get you the other 15 or so. That works for me. Yeah. Roll Dominguez? Yes. You know what? I'll, I'll, 108, whatever. Don't worry about it. You know what? First, first time, 108. Next time, 125, okay? That'll do. That'll do. All right. Julian's going to grab the rest. I'll be back. We're here for the meeting. I heard you came asking about my dad. Um, yes. Yeah, we were here to ask about your dad. No, we all did. How, how we, oh, Richie, Richie. okay. <laughs> okay, this is an actual different thing. Yes, all right. Yes, I, yes. I, yeah. I thought we were just tossing this out there. I was like, all right. No, 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 Roll. I think he came around and asked him for Becker Lang. If he's speaking, I can't hear him. Yeah, he's, uh, he's moved away from the crossing, unfortunately. Is Thieves yeah, bubbled? Thieves talk quietly. Um, I'm, I'm sure you know. Well, uh, Robbie was executed. I just Thank found God. out about that yesterday. He's buried in Big Valley with a lot of the other people from the Lang Gang. Like Maxine and Philly the Kid. Michael Laburne. I was pretty volatile towards the end. And um, they went to Sisica, uh, burned down the Valentine Inn. About 10 people died, 30 people injured, and they decided to leave the crossing. Mm -hmm. A lot of riders. What about, um, it's not law, it's uh, James Gill. I heard horses, I fucking panicked, man. Whew, sorry. What about, um, Select the Kid or, or Billy Hill? I'm uh, fairly sure they left with him. Really? Yeah, or possibly died too. I don't know. So many died towards the end. Uh, it's hard for me to keep track of. Law. Okay. Uh, if Law shows up and sees it, like, no. Nope. There's back so then, many outlaws in one area. It's insane, dude. The law should be thankful for Charles Devine for making this happen, okay? okay? Good to know. I don't want Instead of hunting anywhere did. else, come to one place. Sure. Yeah, um... Did you know Georgie? I haven't...
talk to her at yeah, all. Have you couple, you said? Okay. Talk to her. I will shoot Absolutely. Her. Oh, his vest. Who is it? It's a nice vest. You like it? Yeah, I do actually. I was remaking one of my uncle's outfits that I I quite like, but I, I was finding some stuff to go with it that has little bits of red in it. No, whatnot. listen, uncle. There's one thing about you that is very, very special. That nobody else can ever, ever, ever try to replicate. Your taste mm -hmm. in clothing is absolutely superior than anything I've seen in my entire life. So. There's one thing I want to follow in your footsteps. It's definitely it. <laughs> wow, I'm I'm glad you only want to follow in my footsteps. No, it's fan. it's one of the things I want to follow in your footsteps. Is what I meant to say, I, right? I, I I get it. I'm teasing you. Uh, we we've been we were going around uh, talking to people, robbing people, stuff like that. I had Ronnie out. I was doing some stuff with Ronnie. Perfect. Hope it went I well. I talked to Scarlett. She That's said she was looking to speak to you, but she came to me. That's fine. I mean, one of us should be good, right? Yeah. I gave her some advice. I told her she should still speak to you. I gave her advice on, uh, that what, what, what people's issues were. And I told her not to feel disheartened. And I also said that, uh, if whatever, if she feels like she just don't click with everybody for, for whatever reason, even if she is trying really hard, I did recommend James. So I think James would be a match made in heaven for sure. Yeah, exactly. That was my recommendation. Uh, Ronnie, Ronnie's doing good. He's a little indecisive, but then again, not everybody's a leader. I mean, that's uh, understanding. But, he, mm -hmm. but he's doing good. As long as he ain't indecisive when it comes to shooting somebody, which don't seem like he would be. No, I don't think some people struggle on. I think um, Ronnie's definitely more of a follower than a leader for sure. Absolutely. Um, did you hear about Muppet Gang? <coughs> what? Yeah, appa apparently they double down and they <laughs> become Mega Muppet Gang. Now. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck is that? What does that mean? Alright, so basically... Oh, you don't know any of it. I'll let Rebecca tell you. It's fine, okay. Rebecca. What happened with Zip and, um... I, you got my telegram? I did, I did. We we stumbled on them at Fort Mercer. I, I, Becca wanted me to handle the meeting because she wanted nothing to do with them. Makes sense. I told him that he needs to respect your boundaries, you and you and Becca's boundaries, and be respectful. And if he gives the gun back, it's done. He agreed. All right, simple handed as the that. gun back just like that. Simple as that. I like it. Um, that's that's settled. Um, we went around looking for for people. Um, we didn't find anybody. We we held off on going after Lawman, uh, not because you weren't around, but because specifically. I'm in talks of getting solitary off the table. So we should wait on our plan, basically, I'm trying to say. Uh, I think if if I'm not present, I'm fine with y'all doing it, because I'll just say I wasn't there, and hopefully, I mean... What happens if they chase and then they shoot and return fire? What happens with that case? What do you mean? What happens if Law is trying to chase you after us and you shoot the Law? I don't give a shit. Okay. Uh, me, and Re me and Rebecca, Rebecca and I were talking, and she thinks that they'll judge us. That they, they, there's less of a chance for me to get a deal if I target law or loved ones. So as long as I'm not targeting them, she thinks it, it, it's it, it, we'll be fine. Cause I'm gonna be honest with you, nephew. I kind of want to push law to armadillo tonight if we get a chance. I'm so sick of them getting comfortable in armadillo. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm gonna give up and ride, baby. You, you nephew, I have found four lawmen. In Armadillo at 5 a.m. Jesus. They're getting way too comfortable out there. But honestly, there's the, the bright set about law going out west. More folks are going out west, too. So, yeah. There's a lot of civilians out west compared to the past. Uh, true. My, my big issue is you, you let law feel comfortable in Armadillo, then they feel comfortable in Tumbleweed, then they feel comfortable by Benedict, and then you know how they are. Hell no, they're not yeah, going I mean, to fucking tumbleweed. That's how it starts, right? Body. Exactly. So I just want to make sure they stop feeling comfortable in armadillo. I'm going to be honest, I catch one alone, I'm going to hold myself back from shooting them. Probably. Or else I'd shoot them to send a message. I mean, I'm with you. I'm with you at all. Uh, you're going to be so happy. But you what? Ready? You're, you're going to be so proud of your uncle. You ready for this? Yeah. So... I, I told you how I wanted to give Aurora that thoroughbred in return for the Hungarian half-breed. That's right. Because I was going to joke around so she rides you nuts, but I figured we'd have a better time getting rid of a Hungarian than a random thoroughbred. Yeah, fuck the Hungarians. Overpriced. Ready? 
Ready for this? I have gotten Hello. a guy to trade me a Hungarian half friend that is old Aurora's old Hungarian for three Mustangs and a Crayola. Oh, damn! It's like over two thousand dollars in horses. That is a sweet deal. He must have a lot of inventory you want to get rid of. I, I think I, I I'm just a good talker. Must be. I mean, you got two thousand dollars for getting shot, so I believe you, Uncle. But uh, so that will be going into those deeds, hopefully. Um, I will, I'll let Rebecca be the one to fill you in about the June stuff. Uh, I wanted to have a word with you on, in private uh, at some please. point. I'll, I'll fix it. Don't worry about it. So I can step away if need be. You want to talk now or later? We can talk now if you want while she's Fair catching up with Raul away. and whatever. Well, we're walking away. Don't worry. Uh, hold on. Um, Julian. I ran maybe like two hours before now. Julian, get, get that fella sorted. Get him out of here, okay? Get, get him Which sorted. Which one? The, the one on the chair. Just give him oh, the rest. Oh, he already got everything. Oh, okay, I think he's just okay. sitting now. Right. Howdy, niece. Wednesday, right. Wednesdays, Thursdays are my my old man Tom. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry about the colors. I'll fix it tonight. Don't worry. I love the fact Thieves is, is busy. I just want to make sure folks are doing things. They're just not like idling around and waiting for, for something to happen. I just don't want to turn Thieves into a lazy hub. I want, want you know, it to be productive and things to go in and out. That way, you know, we're doing something. We're not just seeing our asses. You got a cigarette? I don't, but I can go get one. No, no, no. I'm just going to give you one. Thanks, Uncle. Yeah. I got a question for you. You can. I want you to know you can answer anyway. You can answer honestly. Oh, what's going on? Do you want Ronnie and Scarlett in the group because you think they're good fits, or is it because you're worried about losing somebody? And I'm. I'll go and do more details if you want. Sure. Yeah. Why don't you go to more details so I can just wait till you're done? Uh, are you worried about losing? Somebody like what happened with Ariel. You, uh, it's a little different, I'll be honest. I felt more yeah. of a betrayal than them, you know, choosing a different path because we can't be uh, together. Yeah. I guess uh, what I'm trying to say is, uh, I know that like Scarlet, Ronnie, and uh, Ariel were kind of like your first few friends in the crossing. And I, I know that it was probably hard for you to uh, push away Ariel. Uncle, mm -hmm. the second I said yes to you, to riding with you and having your back, I fully accepted what comes with it in the territory that has, right? I knew that I meant I'm going to take a different path than Scarlet, Ronnie, and Arrow, but I still hope that, you know, one day somehow they do join me and us and be yeah. part of the, the well, whole well, thing. I know, and, that, and, and that's, that's what I'm getting at is... I know you pushing away Ariel couldn't have been easy. It wasn't. I mean, I, Charles Divine, the man that go around telling people how much my word means everything, and how much integrity, honor, and weight it has to it. I went back on my word for Ariel. I broke my word for Ariel. And honestly, <laughs> I started to feel like no. I mean, I'm not the man that I was. Maybe I'm not the same person that I used to be because the old me would have never, ever hesitated to do something like that. I would have done it on a spot. Now, I don't even think about it. It would just be like something I just do. And it would feel right. Now, I start to question things. Start to, um, you know, think out loud as far as how my actions could have consequences on myself, Rebecca, you, everybody else in the group. And sometimes it does bother me because it holds me back. I feel a bit suppressed on the inside. Not, 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 in a, you know, not trying to blame anybody. I'm just kind of talking about my feelings. Because yeah. it's not who I am or it's not who I used to be. So it's taken me a lot of time to kind of just adjust to what does it mean to be part of a group setting? What does it mean to be part of a, a you know, a family? Because I didn't have that before. Before it was only about me and me only. So I didn't care about the actions I took because I only know it affected me. Yeah. 
That's why what I did with Ariel really um really hurt me. If it wasn't for somebody like Rebecca who's constantly just talking to me and and uh, us having discussions about everything we do, I would have lost my mind. I would have went insane. So she deserves a lot of her credit. Of course, you do as well. I mean, that's not what this is about. I'm just asking. I can, I know that w wasn't easy. And I, I guess what I'm asking is, are you putting their names forward because you don't want to lose more of your friends? Or because you genuinely no. think both of them are good fans? Because I know our friendship would exist regardless of what group we're part of, right? I think those mm -hmm. um, the times we had, for sure. Um, mostly because um, I, I think they would make a good fit for the group. Okay. However, um, when we had that discussion Saturday night, and everybody started speaking up about their feelings and how they felt about the person. I thought to myself, hmm, maybe it was something I'm not saying they're saying. So I wanted to give it some time. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm going to be honest. It, it seems like, I, I'm like I said, I, I, I gave this advice to Scarlett uh, just because I know how close you are to her. If, if she feels like she ain't clicking with people and if people's opinions don't wa waver, that don't change who she, I don't want her to change who she is just to ride with a group. You know what I mean? That was the advice I gave her. Absolutely. Because, and I, um, I, and I, I did tell her she should seek out James, because I think James would be a great fit for her. Oh, Uncle Kelly would make her go, you know, crazier sometimes, or maybe wild, depending on how she sees things. Um, Scarlet, honest to God, I think she means well. She's somebody who's, um, you know, very loyal and has your back no matter what. No, absolutely. She, I, I think Scarlet's good. But she's she's either very clearly either a not clicking with people or b I'm not I've not been around enough to see it or she is very 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 reckless or a mixture of the both. She she was more reckless in the past for sure. Yeah, I think she's gotten better over time. She's made some progress, but not a lot to where people can notice. Yeah, fair. I, I mean I I I think a lot of people like Ronnie. I I wouldn't be surprised if Ronnie is in by the end of the week or in by the end of next week. I'm just, I was just asking because I wanted to make sure you thought they were good fits or if you were afraid of losing people. Because I know it ain't easy pushing people away you care for. Yeah, I mean, and it will I'm not hurt you didn't shoot Ariel. <sighs> I thought to myself, um, a bullet would have not done the same damage as me ending our friendship. Probably would have would've hurt, nephew. I'm going to be honest. It did. Uh, definitely did. I. There was a fella that he he always uh, there was, I always had a soft spot for him instead of my uncle. His name was Eddie. I think I mentioned him here or there. Yeah. I remember the story. Uh, yeah. It was probably the toughest decision I ever had to make, whether I kill him or not, because anybody else I would have killed. And it. I, I wasn't holding up okay, even thinking of it. Damn, I because I knew it was a best. big moment for me because I knew what I had to do based on my own principles and how I do things. But I couldn't bring myself to do it. And eventually, I came around that I had to do it, and he wanted it too. He was suffering. If he wasn't suffering, I don't know if I would have been able to do it. It's probably the hardest thing I've ever done since I became an outlaw. I loved him. He was like an uncle. So, it's probably good you didn't shoot her. Probably wouldn't have been easy. Probably wouldn't have sit right with you. Yeah. You know, um, I told myself it's always important to know when something has reached its end. And that's when you walked away from it. You have to. Yeah. Well, um, I can't speak on the Eddie incident, but for me, I guess, um, any things with Ariel, maybe are not almost terrible thing maybe something else is about to begin who knows yeah but um 
I really appreciate you opening up about this and sharing how you felt. I just wanted to make sure. You might not see it all the time, but I do worry about you. I ain't good at letting people in historically. I know that. I'm not the best at showing that I care. But I do love you. And, uh, you know. I just wanted to make sure. That's all. I just wanted to check in as well. Damn, Uncle. What? I, uh, I don't know what to say. I, you uh, caught me off guard, I must say, with the uh, way you're being nice to me right now. Okay. I, I, it's not like I've been mean to you the last month. Or I know, months. I know, I know, I know. But I don't expect you to be nice to me. That's why. So whenever it comes out, it feels nice. Okay. I mean... I do hesitate a little bit, just because he <laughs> said you don't want a lovey-dovey uncle, to quote you. You're a great uncle. You are one of the greatest outlaws the cross has ever seen. And you're a fantastic leader. Nah, I'm not that great of a leader. No, yes I'm you are. You no, know, uncle, I had my qu my questions, I had my uh, question marks about when it comes to your leadership, but you proved it time and time and time that you are worthy of being a leader. The way you have led everything thus far is the reason why you got people behind your back that were willing to ride with you any day, any time. I don't think you have to ask anybody in Thieves' Land to ride for you. They'll do it anyways. I appreciate it. Well, you know, I, uh, mm -hmm. just, I'm trying to get better at things, all right? And you are, because uh, I'll be honest, I'll be your hard, hardest critic because you are family. So I'll come to you and tell you how it is. I will never, never lie to you. That is one thing you can guarantee. Good. I'm trying to live for myself, all right? I'm trying to just push through. And you I'm should, because you have sacrificed so much for so many different people in the cross. And it's time to focus for yourself. I'm glad yeah. he's doing the salt there, dude. That's long overdue. Because honestly, the man I'm looking at, compared to the man I saw that came out of solitary, not nah, a day difference. My God. I mean, I didn't even see you crack a smile when you first came out of solitary for a long time. You weren't laughing. The smallest things got on your, you know, nerves. You're very grumpy. Ready to just end things. But now, it seems like you're... In a more state of clarity and um, much, much uh, more happier. So, which makes me yeah, happy. Yeah, I started getting the fog out of my head. That's why I'm worried about going back, to be honest. Don't want to regress. I'll do everything I can to make sure that's not happening. I know you will. Mm. Yeah. Well, um... It's uh, one thing my father used to say all the time is um, struggle is never ending. Well, never ending process. Um, sometimes when it comes to freedom, you never usually win it, but you earn it. And then you constantly win it through generation after generation after generation. So I'm starting to see it myself a little bit after you, uncle. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the fuck did I just say? <laughs> I keep that in mind, kid, all right? <laughs> I love you. Love you too. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I think Uncle James is waiting on us. Looks like it. I'm gonna I'm gonna just piss into the into the water. Yeah. I love John so much, chat. I love John. I love him. I love him. I love him. God, I love that man. He's easily one of my favorite people to role play with. Anytime I want to do RP, if I got John with me, I know it's going to be a good time. I'm so happy we roleplay together a lot in um, Red Dead. When I first roleplayed with him back in GTA, it was 2018. We ran a gang and a mechanic shop together. So now to Red Dead, it's been an amazing journey. Having him become the leader and me stepping back and watching what I do and following his footsteps has taught me a lot about RP, man. So I'm, I'm really privileged that we roleplay together. 
That was an amazing talk between Javas and, and, and City. <laughs> hey, what up, KY? Soon TM, brother. Soon TM. Yeah, I'll be right back. I'm going to use the restroom. Oh, I got my drink. I'm good. No, 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 no. I'm not drinking. Drinking. That's a beverage. Let me some Diet Dr. Pepper, man. That's my go-to drink. A full business Southern style. How the fuck am but I fella, supposed to I don't to know what a fucking dictionary look like, motherfucker. Who the fuck is this guy? He just I, kicked Ronnie's ass, you? too, by the way. He, he, this guy kicked Ronnie's ass? Ronnie tried to sh cheap shot him. Multiple times, might I add. Yeah, he punched him in the back of easily like whooped you guys times. ass, man. Look at you, so, okay? So Rudy, you never, up. ever Rudy. come close compared to my uncle. You, th you said what? <laughs> Rudy fucked his up. Fucked him up. I <laughs> fucked him up. You know what I'm saying? Fucked him up. You were fucked him up. Come on. That was having a real. That was having a real. That was having a real. You can throw it down right now if you like. You want to throw it down? Let's go. Come on. Get him, Rudy. Hey, welcome to Thief, fella. Oh, fella. Hey, quit cheap shotting him, motherfucker. Come on, man. Oh, are you rooting against our nephew? We got him, nephew. Rudy, if you win, I stab you. What the fuck? Yeah, that's my man. Come on. What you got? What you got? This is a fucking, this is a fight. It's not like they can kill each other. Good. Anyway, Rudy's definitely Come on, what you got? Oh my god. What you got? Man, he's waiting for you to punch and then he'll block it and then he'll punch you. Dirty fighter, that's what he is. Oh! 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 That was a oh, fucking man. cheap shot! Welcome to Thief, fella. <laughs> You have a medical bag. Oh, Perfect. Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. Bro. You keep fading. Unholy is yeah, such a dirty fighter, man. Unholy is such a dirty fighter, man. Back of my hand. Oh, he slipped on my lap. Yeah, hey. So. I did say welcome to these fella. Oh fuck! Then they're doing it around here now. That's who plays. Uh, that's who plays. Um, is that, is that how we're doing it around here now? Oh, he started swinging on Rebecca. I'm not gonna have Rebecca's back. They didn't yeah, agree to a fight. Welcome, my dude. Exactly. You're us. <laughs> agree to a fight. Unruly. So Sorry, that's his name. Unruly. Okay. Fair enough. That fella's yeah. a dirty fighter. Okay, he's a dirty fighter. I believe it. You took that Ronnie, not even. I didn't there. throw you to the goddamn fucking wall. I could have. I didn't. I didn't do that. I fought you fair and square, Fisticuff style. It's the same guy who plays them up. Yes.
Listen, this is Dirty Rudy. He's real dirty with it. Exactly. I'm Rude Boy Rudy for a reason. <laughs> right. Eddie Scarlet. A bit. Let me. Let me. Let me tell you how much. That's nice cool. I really like. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Next time I fight him, I'll be the dirtiest fighter possible. Okay? Cause this fucker always, always. Yeah, this reactive fighting, man. He's unconscious. Who played dirty and fucked up CD? Then Rebecca fucked him up. <laughs> Howdy. My head hurts. James hit me in the back of the head. Yeah, I think we can look ginger, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. We'll get you uh, some coal but to I put on it. I feel like you kind of deserve that after slamming oh, your head be, against the fucking it's side of the It's going to be a long fight to where our health can <laughs> regenerate. You're in the corner of a fucking building. Alrighty, up you get. Uh, 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 it's a uh, like Rudy. Rudy, 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 Rudy. Good fight, fella. Hey, sir, I just got busted lip, but otherwise it's fine. It's me of everybody. Is there a content for hours waiting for somebody to punch? True, that's what happened. I can I can stab this fish? You're gonna stab me. Oh, I don't wanna stab you. I wanna stab the fish. Don't stab me though. Well, no, I don't want to stab you. I feel different. You choked my ass out. Bullshit. Bullshit. You threw me to a wall, Ryan. Don't worry, this guy's this is a dirty fighter. Just stop talking. Exactly. You okay, Sunny? Yeah, I'm alright. Just my head hurts. My ear rings a little bit too. Your ear is ringing? A little bit. I'll be okay though. I'm Did he hit food. you in the temple? Nah, I'm not sure where he hit me, but my head hurts. You waiting for us? Mm. Need a willow bark? Yeah, I got some willow bark tablets. You want him? Yes, please. Okay, I'll go with you. You can have it there. I'm gonna. Offer June's the... been cooking as well. Yeah, I need some food. Yeah, come here. June's been cooking. I would need to grab a medical bag and this cream back here. Can you grab me one too? Yeah, for sure. When you're feeling a bit better, do you want to have a conversation? Yeah, we can definitely talk, for sure. Alright, just let me know. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, amazing. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Mm. Mm. Julius cooking is pretty good, actually. Yeah, she's pretty good. Here you go. Can you swallow wrong? Right? Good to see you again, CD. Hey, likewise, Everett. We'll get to work in a little bit, okay? Sounds good. Are you going to be around Wednesday night, by the way? What's Wednesday night? Uh, Josie's birthday. They want to do a big old bank robbery on her birthday. Absolutely. I'll be there. Hell yeah, sounds good. I'll leave you guys too. wrong I don't know I just feel like down today really yeah you want to get out of here and do something together uh, yeah but I think um your uncle said that James wanted to meet all of us I'll still talk to him. yeah what's going on Ronnie uh the bass told me to ask you two if I have been around long enough and I'm allowed to go to bed. If I have met my no, not really. I need, I need you to go get me uh mash, okay? Wait, what? Go you get me go mash. Pull crit Uh, I have you... seen a lot of you today, so you've met. I have my not quota. seen anything of you, Ronnie. Okay, so go out there to the farms. It's five and a half hours. That's not enough for me. <laughs> Seven hours minimum. <laughs> minimum. Oh my god. 
to be to be fair, CD, he's been around for a really long time with us. Get some sleep. I'm just messing with you, I right? Good work today. I spent an hour alone before anybody was even here, too. Yeah, you've been you've been around a lot today, so thank you for showing your face. I appreciate it. I will be around more frequently. I promise. All right, have a good okay. night. Good work. Don't don't worry about that too much. Okay, enjoy yourself. At the end of the day, Ronnie, it's all about enjoying yourself and not really counting the hours. Okay, so. Don't worry about that, right? I know people give me a hard yeah, time. Yeah, let then. us count the hours and you just right. enjoy yourself. Exactly. Yes, I will definitely be capable of doing that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Also, um, I have some feedback for you on the okay. Eastern Patrol we took. Yeah, how did, how did I do on my patrol, Becca? Uh, well, uh, it was probably the most awkward rat I've ever seen to Ansberg. Ever. Yes, I And it probably that. took like a million miles longer time than it needed to um I know. but oh. that said you avoided all law and we didn't write information and you didn't make call outs so well done well done ronnie i know you could do it i mean junior outlaw to hopefully a potential outlaw i hope for the best yes right. uh, we it. would like you to can see do more of this well done all right Understood. thank you ma'am Absolutely not. Where did my uncle go? Yeah. He's talking uh, to the green. Hey, uh, darling, real quick. Howdy, howdy. Hey, you just wake hey, up so right now or you've been around? I just woke up right now. I have a headache, which is kind of why I didn't wake up a little earlier, but I wanted to see who was a buyout before. Well, we're all like about. I mean, everybody's around, basically, except Josie right now, and Aurora. Mm, okay, okay. Yeah, so, um, I'm, I'm definitely gonna get to work. I just wanna see what my uncle's doing. He's the most wanted among all of us, so I wanna make sure that he's protected before leaving Thebes. Okay. I can stay back in Thebes. Since yeah, I'm well, equally wanted. You know how law has been coming well, down here in right? So I wanna make sure that at least we got five uh, with my uncle, at least. At least. I, I got, got some my shine hand gun, it's fine. Looking to do some work. Absolutely. I'll take it all off you. Okay. I'll uh, get that to you immediately. For, uh, Have you showed you the two boxes Julian's been storing shine in? Julian's storing shine? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where oh, right? Also, Forrest, um, June's been doing a lot of cooking. I oh, know you've been she knows like, how outsourcing. To uh, she cooks food. Well, yeah, I mean, she do a lot of stirring in the pot. Yeah, probably if she makes more stew. Than more than that. Soup. More than that. Um, but yeah, um, I spoke to Jubas and Aurora. We kind of want her to take more of a, a chef role if you're okay with that. I know you've been outsourcing a lot. I've been trying to, but no dice. Uh, yeah, no. I'll, uh, I have a few recipes lying around I could toss her away if she wants to do. Yeah, she also told me she knows how to make peach cobblers. So yeah, I've given I've her some money to get every us a lot time, of peach man. cobblers. One mm -hmm. of the most famous songs on TikTok. Right. We could do. Uh, my old, my old recipe book is TikTok, uh, we can make cheese here, like like actual cheese. We can make um, wheat milk, uh, different types of eggs, scrambled eggs, fried eggs, poached eggs. Yeah, oh, man. Uh, sounds, sounds all good to me. Mm. She's made all the scalloped potatoes, and she's cooked a lot of good good meats and stuff. And um, there's also sausages and fried eggs over there. In, yeah, in plenty of food, the, uh, plenty of food. I woke up uh, early uh, yesterday, and uh, me and June just spent like a good bit of the morning cooking together, which was that fun. That was nice. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. That's good. I'm glad she's getting a lot of time with everyone. She's uh, she's very kind. Yeah, she's and a very... little shit too as well. She's she's a a bratty young naive little girl. Um, that just needs a little bit direction in life, I think. That's exactly it. Fish, let me show you the shine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This way. Oh, man. Uh, okay. you, keep your hand that's tough, Rudy. They didn't it's want so, your hands. It's okay, I'll keep the hand. Yeah, keep it. I don't think anybody thinks you're a fool. Next time. I do. <laughs> don't know. Uh, this way. Uh, 
can talk to Forrest about five. I already, I already have you. Yeah, yeah. One right here. Okay. Some in there already, actually. I bought those off of them. So, and there's one over here. Oh, he's storing actual shine. I think we need to store mash. Yeah, we should. We should. Like I said, um, he had Ooh. one ready. He was gonna do it at night, but uh, he uh, decided not to, so he kept it here for the time being. So, Ooh. but most of it should be shine. Sorry, mash, mash. Having a whole bunch of buckets of water in here would save me having to just fucking go all the way to the water and keep making fucking shine. Mm -hmm. I could actually have a little spot to refine and... Oh, if you want to do nice. that, that'd be great. Yeah, yeah, actually, it'd be a good idea. We can just do it all at once in one place, right? Instead of going mm -hmm. back and forth. Mm -hmm. That way, all I need to do is just get the sugar and just... Oh, oh that'd be sweet. Hey, just, right. That just gave me an idea. Hey, fish. Yeah. I love you. I love you too, man. And if you ever right. need any help, anything, I'm right here, okay? I got your back. Loud and clear, brother. Loud and clear. And remember what I said two nights ago, okay? If you want to talk to my uncle about it, you should. Um, you know, I think I'm going to have to. At first, I was going to keep it to myself for a bit, but I... I, I <clears throat> June is sweet. Very, very sweet. She could tell I were upset, right? I, like many things, man, I get upset over a lot of things, but when you let that shit stew for a bit, you just forget about it, man. I was hoping to just chop it up to just forgetting about her and moving past it, but June, man, she, she inquired and, I mean, what was I going to do? Just lie to her? You shouldn't, you know? You should never lie about your feelings. That's how problems start. I didn't. I told her. I told her how I felt. And uh, she brought it up with your uncle. <laughs> now I feel like I owe your uncle a chat. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't like the fact that my niece brought it up to my uncle. In fact, um... She deserves more than this love or race when it comes to that. When it comes to, um, you know, personal feelings and how you feel about certain things, you shouldn't be a messenger on somebody else's behalf. You should I told talk her to that not person. to. I told talk her not her. to. I'll have a I talk with ask her. her. If you're okay with that, of course. I know she done you wrong, so. You mind if I be there? Sure. Yeah. I mean, we don't have to do it now, right? It's just whenever. Yeah. I need to talk with Tobias first. You should. You should definitely talk over with. Yeah. I hear he's, uh, not quite too happy. Yeah, because I had talked with my uncle a long time ago. And he says that if people are not being honest about how they feel, I'm going to be very upset because I'm trying to give them, you know, the opportunity to speak up, but nobody does. They say, they say one thing at the meeting and they feel a different way. And that's uh, one of his biggest concerns. But at the same time, not a lot of people like to um, talk about how they feel in front of everybody else. They would prefer either a one-on-one -on -one conversation or something aside to where it's more secluded. To be honest, brother, my feelings are about as a book, man. They they are only transparent if you open and turn the page. You if you look, you ask, you see. I don't I don't go around. Listen, I wear my heart on my sleeve. I make myself happy. I like to make my friends happy, my family happy. But I'm not gonna bug my family with. Shit like this, you know. Hey, you don't think your uh, cam yeah, you don't think your family cares about your happiness. You don't think we care about how you feel. We're not affected by that. If I see you around, you're not feeling too good. You're not happy, and there's something bothering you inside. I'm gonna do everything I can from my side to hear you out and see what's going on. See if I can help you. That's what family does. They care for another. Right? This shit, this shit's so complicated, CD. It is. Tell me about it, okay? Tell me about it. I'm the I'm the one that. Now he's got to think with his brain when it comes to actions because it affects others. <laughs> I never thought I'd even start to consider the day where I'd start fucking thanking myself. It used to be a whole lot easier by myself, I tell you what. But it also comes with um, the fact that you got people that got to get your back, right? So. Yeah. Well, anyways. Um, no, no. You know what? Something I forgot to tell Rebecca. I'll be back. That was, that was the this? least slick smooth. way to leave. Smooth, brother, smooth. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that.
picking up all your habits just like that. It's just because they. Yes. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Howdy, howdy. 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 Uncle uh, James, so what have you been doing recently besides uh, just uh, trying to find people? What well, well, plans or goals you have in mind? Just get back. I'm gonna get a bank job plan. You oh, find see. for that. We've been robbing but some folk. Ranger, deputy. Rangers, huh? I wish you were there actually when they stand off with the Rangers. And one of them got very lippy during the conversation. I said, next time I see you and you give me that attitude, you get lippy like that. There'll be major consequences. And a fellow ranger named Bear stepped up and said, Oh yeah? What are the consequences? Wait, wait a minute. You said Bear? Yeah. Bear. Big motherfucker. Oh, it's not it's not it's not the beard that I robbed this gun off of? Most likely. He has a big beard? He, yeah, he's got a big beard. This is gun right here, motherfucker. Oh. What gun oh, is that? That's well. um, Bear's gun. Hey, I wanna swap? I'll give you my gun for that gun. Let me see your gun. Is it a navy, first of all? Yes, yeah, navy. Let me see. Did you, who did that to the navy? Can, can, I, can I take a closer look? Zip's gone. Zip, did that? Oh can I, can I take a closer look? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, take a look. You can take a look at his gun. Hold on one second. Oh, shit. Hold on. My bad. Hey. So I stole this from Zip. It belongs to somebody else. It's just peace and quiet, which are the Let opposite see. of you. Ain't no piece of quiet over here. It's pure chaos. <laughs> yeah, that's an ugly ass gun, motherfucker. You see, you see, you see this, James? James, look at this gun. Yeah, I'm ugly this gun one's one's It's pretty yeah, ugly, but you got time rainbow. to leave your imprint on it, right? This one, this, gun? this one's already done, though, right? Yeah, that's what I wanted. Oh, okay. It says, it says, it says, it says, it says, it says mango. What does it, what does it say again? Mango, Colorado. Mango, Colorado. Exactly. Sounds delicious. Man, no, he's, gonna keep, he's gonna keep that gun. It's the first, it's the first gun he robbed. It's, it's the first, the first exactly. Ranger. It's, a, it's a memory right here. It's memorabilia. Exactly. Like, anyway, so he steps up to me, right? He said, oh yeah, how are you gonna do this? Fist of cups with iron. I fucking pulled out my fist. I started throwing haymakers left and right. Took him down. And as he, his face hit the dirt, he was talking a lot of shit. I was walking away. Yep, he said you hit like a school child, but you must be Something sitting like there that. in the mud. Something like that, yeah. But a little bit. I'm not sure what's wrong with the Rangers, but recently they've been on just edge, man. I'm not sure what's going on. I don't know if they've been robbed a lot, they've been attacked a lot, or the wildlife nature's been going after them. Been like that. Yeah. He said some See. smart shit to, to Rudy as well. What do you say exactly? He said, he said, he said, he's looking forward to having that gun back. <laughs> I said a double back and put a bullet in his head is what I started doing. Damn. Rangers are going wild, that's for sure. Next thing they're gonna be doing what the law is doing out there, being bloodthirsty too. Well, well they better be quick on the draw, motherfucker. Cause I drop them. Luckily, we don't run on four legs in a ferry. If any, they at a disadvantage. Uh, yeah, we're well, bipedal. I I've done that before, actually. I throw on this um, wolf hat. Yeah. What? Pretending to be a wolf no. chasing after Rebecca no, like she was some sort of um no. CD, That's please disgusting. Stop. No, CD, please. What? We keep it. No more. We keep it interesting in our in our in our relationship, right? Yeah. No, I'm the, the big please, bad wolf walking in, and she's no. the um, she's like the sleepy sheep. Does she go like? Does she go like? Does she go like? Does she go like that? That's not how sheep sound like. No, 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 oh, she, she pretending to be the thief? Yeah. You eating the owl, motherfucker? What? I mean, hey. that's how it starts, right? God. Damn it. That's a whole lot of information. Too much. <laughs> you, you know, you're like, peel the... <laughs> peel, the peel the what, motherfucker? Go ahead. See, it's... <laughs> Really, not too late to stop, please. I think it's a bit too late. It's man. not too late. I think it's somebody ducking and leaving. I think I can The only one way to there's one only one way until he hits right bottom. I just I just hear a lot. <laughs> CD, please stop. Dude, where's the law, man? Where's the law when you need him? I'm gonna go take him all on by myself. Him, man, man. <laughs> no, I'm gonna go take him all on by myself.
Yeah, but uh, that's how um, that's how how things out in nature, right? Some um, some so cattle. So you make it go bad? Is that what you do? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Depend on how loud. Like, give give me an accurate like like how loud. No, I'm no, I've gone too no, far. Okay, I've crossed that line. That, that's that's plenty for me. That's. Why don't you use your imagination? That's one of the most so amazing things we have like, in our minds. Like a thief right now, you, you can't do that. Come again? You can't scream like a thief? Oh, it's not that. I just don't want to go that far. That's all. I think I went far enough. Right, Scarlet? <laughs> Motherfucker, I, I feel like you went far and then farther. So, so, so it's too late now. With what you I feel just like. kept going. You just kept going. Like, like, like everything behind you is all foggy and shit. It's too, you know what? This is, a, this is a perfect time, uh, Scarlet. Why don't we have this conversation one on one? I ain't talked to you for. Good lord. Not because of the wolf and the sheep, because something else. It's ain't about the thief yeah. noises. I'll be back. Oh, I just I like your outfit. Thank you. How you been? Yeah, I've, I've been right. It's a lot to think about. A lot to think about? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Man, I want Scarlet in the group so bad. I'm telling you, Scarlet is a... Is a nobody sees what... Oh, watch out, Snake. There's a snake. There's a snake. Okay. You want to start first? Um. I mean, if you want to start, I already kind of know the context of it. I spoke to your uncle today a bit, so it's up to you. Remember the first day we met? Mm-hmm. Where was it? Uh, Valentine. When we officially met and we started talking. Uh, up in uh, Tall Trees. Well, Sissica. Sissica. Tall Trees. The same boat ride back to Sydney, right? Mm -hmm. We met shortly afterwards. Scarlet, there's been somebody who I knew for a long, long time. Probably longer than even Rebecca. And everybody else. I believe it right to you before anybody else in Thebes. However, our journey did not begin until afterwards. And, um,. There's been somebody who's been a great, great addition in Thieves Landon. Somebody who's always hardworking, very loyal, and um, just wants to help out. She cares a lot. I have a lot of respect for you. I wanted you to be part of anything I did. And um, I was hoping that one day that you'd be able to join my uncle's group so we can be in the same group because I think we work pretty well together. Um, when I brought up your name, you joined the group, there was a lot of feedback that was kind of just said out loud that I can, you know, consider to be valid or fair at times because I've had my fear, not my fear, my, um, fair, you know, sense of frust frustration with you in the past, um, where, um, I've kind of just gotten into a little argument with you over small things that bother me that, you know, sometimes can, um, really affect the group as a whole. And I, and I brought these up to you and we talked about them, we got past it together, right? There was nothing wrong with that because we we're able to talk about problems. If I have a problem with you, you will show me how you feel and vice versa because I think we have that kind of friendship where we can be honest with each other no matter what. And you're not going to get upset at me. I'm not going to get upset at you because I expect our friendship to always be, um, you know, on the, on the same page. 
transparent. We're not hiding anything from each other, right? Yeah. And um, during the meeting we had, people mentioned how how um, you know you're hot headed, very reckless. You are somebody who sometimes disappears. Uh, they haven't had a chance to talk to you and open up to you. And also, one of the factors was, is we already have two hotheads, maybe three if you include me at times, that are, can, can, can kind of, you know, just affect how the group does things. The fear is, um, we might be having a conversation with somebody, and they might say the wrong thing, and you might pull and turn it into a shootout, or you might try to stab and attack that person, thus affecting the whole group, right? There is definitely a fear in that. And I'm telling you this because I'm trying to tell you the feedback I'm hearing. Now, Scarlet, you're somebody who I trust through and through. If you, from my perspective, and from what I know so far, if you are to pull out a weapon and shank somebody, then that person probably deserved it because I know you so well. And I know that you would do something like that if you saw it worthy of them getting hurt. That's why I fully trust you, and I don't have an issue when you, get, when you act aggressive because I know where you're coming from, right? But a lot of people in the group don't have that. They don't have that perspective. They don't have that um, understanding of you like I do. And I'm not saying it's over. I'm not saying this is the end. But I do believe this all chance for you and Ronnie to join our group. It's just going to take more time. And it's going to require more, more of you. Kind of just um, putting the effort with other group members. For them to understand you better so they can feel they're more comfortable having you in the group as a whole. Does that make any sense? Yeah. Yeah, it does. Scarlet. That mm -hmm. does not mean I'm not going to stop working with you. It does not, it's not mean I'm, I'm just not going to see you as a different person. Us will never change. I truly love working with you. I truly love riding with you. I take you in anything we do together. Um, that I can, of course. Unless it's something that is group conflict, which I cannot involve you in, as you all know. But everything else, I'll never change between us. Because um, I love having you around. I enjoy your company. And you're somebody who I can trust and have my back no matter what. You'll always mean a lot to me. It'll never change. That's why I brought up your name. And honestly, I said yes to you and no to Ronnie. Because I know you better than I know Ronnie. And I was able to kind of just say, I feel confident in what I see. What? See, he's being honest. Yeah. See, he's being honest with Scarlet. I mean, it has to be this way. So, I know uh, you spoke to my uncle, and he made a recommendation of going to um, James's um, group. That is up to you, or you can always be part of Thebes. I don't want to hold you back. I don't want to say, hey, Scarlet, wait for us, or wait for me, or lay you on this false promise that does not exist, and then have you and then say, well, when is my time? Is my time even coming? Do I even get a chance? I don't want you to hold it, hold on to that small thread of hope. I want you to be confident. I want you to be sure. And I want you to follow your heart. No matter what. I always respect you. Support you. And I'll be here for you. Mm -hmm. That friendship will never change. You mean a lot to me. I just like I I get the other day I was I was very hot headed. I'm I'm frustrated, I'm pissed off at the fact that Ronnie lost an eye and once again somebody that I care about has been hurt and there's nothing I can fucking do about it. Scarlet. You do not have to explain yourself to me. No, but I feel like I do because No you do just... not. Because I know who you are. And I don't want you to change. 
I would never ask you to change. You are great the way you are. Like I said, it's just more of a misunderstanding and understanding who you are is what people lack sometimes. So they judge based on what they know without having the full context. I mean, I wasn't, you know, intentionally disappearing those two times the other day. I was, was preparing myself because every conversation that I've had with someone in, in regards to law and even myself, when I've interacted with law, it's been aggressive and immediately you know, they don't just warn Shut you up, once. Yank. They don't just warn you a couple of times before they shoot anymore. They fucking warn you one time and then they're shooting. I so, understand that. You know, and I give you my feedback times. on it. Okay? Yeah. Just let's stick together when it comes to it. If there is a time and place where you can feel like you need to get into that position, that's fine. If we're preparing for a shootout, I'll let you know right away when to jump out, when to prepare, right? I don't want you to feel like you have to be in that kind of position all the time, right? I know that it's just, especially with Strawberry, I felt like they they had no idea where I was or that I even went behind that building. So for me, I felt like I was going to protect the people that I was with that I fucking care about by going behind there and getting a better position on them because they were being aggressive. But let's be real, they all had their fucking guns out and we were out. And there's nothing. nothing wrong with that. Maybe tap somebody's shoulder and say, hey, I'm going behind you. Right? Communication, that's all it is, right? I didn't know if you if you lost your head. I didn't know if um I lost your head. sorry, I didn't know if you had a headache. I didn't know if you um left. I didn't know if something happened. So for me, I don't have that context that you have, right? That's what I'm saying is like communication is important in a group setting, right? And that something will come a time. It's not your fault. Don't get me wrong, CD. I'm trying. I'm trying relentlessly to to get to know other people within the group. The people that I struggle the most with is is Winsmore and, and Becker. I, I feel like Becker is such a closed book, and I struggle so much to, to try and get her to even you know warm up to me at all. And when it comes to Winsmore, I mean the amount of times that I go up to Winsmore and I'm like, Hey, Grandpa, how you doing? And I get nothing back. I don't know if that's just me. I don't know if that's just him. I don't know if he just doesn't hear me. I don't know, but I'm fucking trying. I feel like I've been trying since the day that I got here in Thieves. And, and uh, honestly, I never even thought that I would have a chance to be a part of the group because I'm uh, somebody new. I, I'm, I'm, you know, to these people, I'm, I'm not anybody. I'm a nobody to them. So I, I honestly never thought that I would even... You're somebody to me. Yeah, but to the rest of them, I'm not. I didn't think that I was even gonna. My name would even be brought up as as a as a proposition. Like I've I've fucking tried since the day that I got here, and it's not even to be part of the group. I just tried to fucking help everyone. And I have one bad day, and everybody sees that and goes, "Oh, Scarlet's too reckless. Scarlet's too fucking over the top." And like uh, respectfully, CD, if it were you that was hurt, Becca would go to the ends of the earth to fucking, you know, hurt the person that hurt you. You would do the same for Becca. Jabas would do it for you, for Aurora. But I do it one day and I'm looked at like I'm reckless and I'm, I'm pissed off and I'm, I'm too hot-headed. No, I just fucking care and everybody that gets hurt, I can't fucking help them. And I hate that. Everybody that has done wrong by any of us here in Thieves, I've never been able to do anything. I've just had to accept it. But sometimes yeah, that's I, how I things are going to be, though, today. Scarlet. That's how things are going to be sometimes. You can't be always in full control, right? I feel like I'm never in control, CD. It's not true. You I feel are. like I'm always living in the shadow of Ronnie. Nah, always, damn it. Uh, I, I, Who has I'm noticed wrong, you I've and... Did you not hear what I said? I said I chose you over Ronnie. Because I know what you're capable of. I know what you've done for thieves. I know how hard you work. That has not persuaded my opinion about you. Those moments have not persuaded my opinion about you. Right? Because I know you so well. And sometimes that's what it takes to trust somebody, right? 
and it, it's it's not anything towards you, CD. It's just you know, with Ronnie, it's like it's like when we went to do the moonshine the, a week or two ago, and and he's like, oh, get on the back of my horse. I'm like, no, I want to ride my own horse. He's like, no, 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 you need to get on the back here. And then you literally turn around and you're like, why didn't you ride on your own horse? Like I fucking wanted to. I, I feel like I'm I'm in the shadows of Ronnie sometimes, and it, it it's hard. I'm trying to be my own person. I'm trying to make a name for myself, and yet I feel like I'm just. I don't know. How can I help you? When I first came around here, everybody was like, you know, Scarlet, you're too quiet. You know, you need to do more. I do more, and everyone's like, you're too hot headed. You need to calm down. I'm like, I'm, I'm trying to find the happy medium. Be here. who you are. Stop. I think you're. I think you're trying to adhere to whatever complaints are coming your way. Be who you are. Be receptive to the feedback. Obviously, learn from it. But do not change 180 when it comes to it, right? Does that make any sense? Yeah. Scarlet. Yeah. I will do everything I can to have you part of my group, part of my uncle's group. You now, God forbid something happens tomorrow to my uncle and things start to go their own ways. You are one of the first people I'd select to ride with me. And I wouldn't even think about it twice. I'm just, I'm trying to do my best. I, I, I don't complain about shit. I don't, you know, when everybody's like, hey, let's go out robbing, I go. And I keep hearing like, Oh, if I get a charge because of Scarlet, I mean, the amount of times that I've been there, the second that someone's like, Scarlet, we need we need somebody to, you know, come along to do this, I'm right there. I don't complain again about getting charges from the law. I don't complain about nothing. I mean, isn't that part of being a part of a group? It it's is. going along with shit like that. It is. So to, to have people be like, well, I don't want to get a charge because of you, it's like, well, I've got the amount of charges I've copped because of... I've been there to well, help people uh, see, back up. See, I say that, Scarlet, because, um, you know, sometimes we don't try to push it too far, right? We have to be understanding what we do and to make sure that the law does not take what we do as ammunition and turn around using against us, right? Because they're waiting for you to make a mistake. They're waiting for you to do something that dumb to can say, oh, you know what? I can argue attempt to murder right here and lock us up for a long time because the whole goal is not be locked up for a long time. It's to avoid any time possible because time is all we have and time is the most important thing that we have listen if you're looking for action and looking for someone to ride with right now and you don't want to stick around with thieves James my uncle James would be good be a good fit I just don't know if that's a journey you're willing to take. However, for it to to ride with anyone, I'm 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 here in thieves. Thieves is my home, but I feel like I'm saying if you're looking for something, if you're looking for something, I'm just throwing everything on the table so you understand what's going on. You ask me, I want you in thieves. I want you to go anywhere else but thieves. This place needs you. have a lot to think about I think you're gonna be fine okay you gonna be okay think about it it's the time you need if you haven't need any help with anything let me know I'll be here I will thank you all right we'll go back to everybody Surely Becca would approve her in our TV's group. I mean, like I said, if it happened. I think, uh... See, if she ran a group, it'd be a dictatorship for sure. It would not be like a, a vote system like we have right now. It would be like, this person's joining. Either you like it or you don't. I 
I would definitely run a more like a like a like a iron fist kind of just uh, rolling. Chat. That was a great talk between um, JD and Scarlet. I mean, JD cares for Scarlet a lot. Probably, I would say maybe she's pretty up there when it comes to um, people he cares about. You know. I hope she. I hope she makes. Um, I hope she makes a move. I would love to see Scarlet and Ronnie take the last few spots. That would be my opinion, but you know. Where'd everybody go? I too heated by it. I let it happen, but yeah. No, I just think we should respect each other in the in the gang, and sometimes we don't realize when our jokes go slightly too far. So. Whoa! What? Yeah, but I'm good though. You know. I'll, I'll tell you all I was doing yesterday, cause I didn't, I didn't run off like I was some crying muppet. Yeah, I, yeah, I was just making shine. Talking, and me and Everett did a shine run. Okay, because, fair. Uh, I'm, but you could see how that might take me by surprise. Uh, no, no, I, I do, I do, I understand. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I'm talking about June. I'm just waking up to this, like, right now. Uh, J June telling me this. Like, I I, I, <laughs> I I had a fucking telegram. I have the telegram on me right now. <laughs> you want to see it? Yeah, sure. I don't think she meant to, like, no, she definitely cause meant issues. That. No, no, I know. I know she just cares, but... And I know she's really worried that you're going to hate her. <laughs> She oh, needs man, somebody to talk to her about that, though. She should not be doing you, that, man. I, I can I can talk to her if you want. Okay, yeah, you should. I think um, she knows. I, I already had a conversation with her, though. Sometimes, right. What the you know, fuck is it? It's, okay. it's better to not put your nose in other people's business, even I'll keep though you going, think you're helping. Man. She, keep going, man. She, she, she tore out a whole storybook for me. Oh. It was a nice, it was a nice story, though. I, I had a good read of it. I need to go check telegrams pretty soon. I'm going to go to Armadillo since there's a lot of... Right, let's, um, let's, let's all go because of law. Yeah. Yes, I, I need to check around as well, too. Where did um, Winsmore and Everett go? I don't know. I don't know where the old man went. Let's get them. Let's get them. Let's all six of us go. All right. Um, I'm on my mo. CD, CD. Hold yeah. on. Yeah. Real quick. Hey, you too. You too. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, uh, just real quick. Mm -hmm. Um, so me and Everett are, are making a gun for uh for Josie's birthday since it's coming up in a few days. What uh, are you making her? Uh, it's a special looking navy. Okay. Why? What, are, are you doing a navy too? Where is my damn navy? Uh, do, you, do you want a navy? <laughs> I'm supposed to get one, but it's been a month late. Here, uh, man. CD. Here, no, CD. No, it's fine. It's fine. Please. It's fine. No, it's fine. Oh, 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 oh. Ah. Anyways, if y'all want to pitch in, y'all don't have to. Just go to Everett and toss him some cash and tell him, hey, you know. How about you get her, like, for the nice rifle girl. instead of... Well, we already got the Navy. We're just touching it up. I, I think the Navy's already done. Have you done, done. Work to it? Uh, I think Ev has. I could ask him real quick. Have him show it to y'all. See, my uncle is really good at that kind of stuff, along with Rebecca. They're really good at making an amazing Navy. The one that gave to MF, probably the best Navy I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Tip it is. Mm-hmm. And yet, nephew, it is hard to go to a fucking town to make a gun uh, when I'm wanted for as long as I am. So you that don't love me. me and Becca haven't. <laughs> Excuse me. You're okay. Excuse? <laughs> Do you think Rebecca doesn't love you? Rebecca, you don't love me. <laughs> Since when? Since you don't want to give me that navy ready for me. Oh, I, okay. I love you, CD. You uh, want you want a knight? CD, do you remember when I gave you that Litchfield and asked you to be my king instead of my knight? Yeah, do you remember when I got you um, a Schofield? Yeah. What my a queen and lad. Yes. Okay. I'm just saying, forgiveness well, for the self, for being selfish. That's why you forgive people. Not for them, it's for you. Uh, what? So I'm forgiving y'all for myself. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, l listen. Just because we haven't found the time to go and do up a navy for you doesn't mean we don't love you. Mm -hmm. You 
You want Loki's horns? No, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I got Zip's gun. I should be good for now. I think I show you every day. Oh, I need to get the gunsmith. To, uh, did the old barrel. man show you what I got him? The 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 Zhang Wei. Yeah, yeah, the Thai <laughs> pilot one. Yeah, yeah. All right, uh -huh. let's let's find the old man and Everett. Let's go to Telegram. Right. Yeah. June, where did Everett and Grandpa go? They're inside the speakeasy, talking to a banjo fucker. Okay, all right. I'll... Banjo fucker? <laughs> oh, it's gonna be great. Banjo fuckers? Are these the people that wanted to kill me? Oh, yeah, I remember those folks. Banjo fuckers. Oh, good lord. Now you fucking this. What's good, motherfucker? Hi, motherfucker. How you doing? Hey, what's good? Who, who was you? Everett, where's uh, Grandpa? I'm, I'm Forrest Fish, man. Hey, you yeah, Forrest Fish? We're gonna head, oh, yeah. we're gonna head to uh, Armadillo. Check Telegram 60. Let's go. Yeah, you just call me FF. F. I'll call you, we'll I'll call you, I'll call you, I'll call you Lil F. Alright, come on. You gotta go grab my horse. Go get your horse. Julian, if you get more mash, let me know, okay? Alright. Appreciate that. June. Yeah. You are a little shit. Why? Because I said so. Okay. I made more potatoes in there, uh, for you. Are you being nice to me? Uh, you're my uncle? Mm. Okay. Thank you. Uh-huh. Where'd it go? Uh, you buy some backers to it. Uh, I'll go get him. <sighs> Man, Ch Chad, the roleplay's been fire, huh? I've been left Thieves Landing the past two hours. How? That's crazy. Yeah, we're ready when you're ready. All right. Let's go. Oh, if we see Law and Armadillo, what do you want to do? Uh, yeah, I agree. What was that? If you see Law and Armadillo, what do you want to do? Push him out. All right. Say less. How you doing at your bass? What was that? Pushing that arm. Um, who's an Armadillo? If there's any Law and Armadillo, I'm pushing the fuck out. I'm, I'm sick of fucking law. Going to armadillo. Think careful. I'm I I'm Do you actually think I don't love you? Come on, Rebecca. Our love well, is you're eternal. Just saying that. I'm saying that. To, yeah, I'm just messing with y'all. That's all. Yeah. Beta Fenrir? Yeah. I, I, I'm, my storage is constantly used on bonds and Rebecca. How's your conversation with Scott? It went really well. Um, she, she, I could sense she was getting a bit emotional till the end. Because she, yeah. she feels like no matter what she does, somebody will find a way to complain about her. And I said, listen, you're right the way you are. Don't change. Um, obviously, take the feedback that comes your way. Uh, learn from it. But do not, hmm. you know, you know, change 180 because somebody complains one time, right? Yeah. Take it step by step. Yeah. It's, not, it's not all about about making those drastic changes to yourself, so people can love you. Right? Then you gotta yeah. be who you are. You cannot live somebody else. It's pretty good advice. You know, I'm I'm starting to think that something has happened recently to me, to where I'm starting to like spew these like wise words about life mm -hmm. and what to do mm -hmm. instead of oh, slowing down.
stopped telegramming, but you didn't put your telegram on. Shit. Well. Hey, it's Vern. What are y'all up to right now? Uh, we're riding to Armadillo. Is there any wall there? Uh, they just rode out of Armadillo going west. About four. Huh. Okay. Four of them. That's right. And they're going west of Armadillo? They, they were going west. That's right. All when right, was this? This was less than 10 minutes ago. All right, let's go. You want to be on separate horses or no? Uh, well, but if we can, let's get the tumbleweed. Right. Do you want to push them out or do you want to take anything off? It just looks better with six and five. Uh, what, what do y'all want to do? do I say we push them out. I'm the one most you want to do. You want to rob any of them? It's really up to you. I don't give a shit, honestly. I, I'm not making that decision because I'm facing 15 fucking months already, so what's fucking five? I mean, I think you should be the one to make that decision yeah, you since you're the one that's facing so long. I don't, I, to me, I'm facing more than 10 months. So they, might, they might turn into a shootout if we try to rob them, though. That's the only issue. To be honest, I'd say it's best we probably avoid them the best we could. That way you don't get too much time stacked on you. But, I mean, I, you know, if it, it's like a fucking, uh, uh, you know, how to all say. It's like a fish, man. If they Ladder to the right. Okay, so I ain't no help in it. Uh, well, I, I, I guess we'll do this. We'll, we'll go there with the intent to just tell them to get the fuck out of the west, leave straight out, and uh, if they start getting lifted or something, we'll rob them. Probably left here. Uh, hey! Why do I feel like one of them will die tonight when they get lifted? Well, hopefully they have hot heads. Make sure that you punch them, Mr. Ashi. You know, you can kill somebody for a punch. Egg. You ain't never heard about Humpty Dumpty Wayne's more. You're like Humpty six Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All of these <laughs> king's horses and all the king's men. I like that. Never stop the Humpty Dumpty from reassembling again. He fell from he a rose fall. from the grave and he started blasting every one of these motherfuckers. I don't think that's how it goes. Yeah, that's my rendition. <laughs> <laughs> that's how it goes. <laughs> That's how it goes in my, my eyes, my butt, my, my, my head. Man, this fog's really helping the law right now, huh? I know. You're thinking they'd probably go to, like, what, Fort Mercer? Um, Rascal 4? Tumbleweed, maybe? If they're in a group of four, there's no way the hell they're looking for a fight. I'ma let y'all know, as soon as we get to Armadilly, Cholera, or the Cholera Land, I'ma take a piss. Hey, Japan, do they have cadets with them? Uh, last time I had a fight with them in Tumbleweed, they made one break off and go to the Benedict Telegram for more. You know, so, uh, yeah, if we engage in combat with them, one of them might break off and send a telegram. We gotta cut them off, though, and make sure that's not happening. Maybe, maybe me and Ev can chase down the fucking babies, then, if y'all want to go ahead and do your thing. Oh, that works. See you. Just depends on how many there is. We'll match, we'll match their number. See you. I got that stuck in my head now. Humpty Dumpty fell from a great I wall. Probably, they wouldn't risk it. Possibility about it. We know it with the intention of pushing them out, but if they get lippy or they're handled in a certain way, I'm at least wrong. If not, do it on my side. We follow the yard lane. <laughs> you were saying something's been happened to you lately uh, when you start. Where people are coming to things. me for wisdom and knowledge instead of me seeking mm -hmm. it, right? Past, I'll be talking to people asking for help. It seems like a lot of people are coming to me for help now, so it was nice. But yeah. I'll be honest, I don't have it figured out. I pretend to do sometimes, I pretend like I know what I'm talking about, but most of the time it's just um, step by step, day by day. Do you want to know a secret? What is that? None of us have it figured out. Not wrong. Some of us are really good at hiding it, though. I'm gonna machete them while I said don't Yeah. I'm proud of you, though. Oh, I have a telegram. It's probably from Everett, and then I'm going to be depressed. <laughs> it's okay. You can go there and Hey, don't worry, wins more. I had a, I had almost two pages of telegram to read today. Oh, yeah. Holy f 
fuck? Yeah. I have, these are the most telegrams I've had in my life, and I only have five. <laughs> <laughs> Three of them from Javax. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start sending you telegrams on that too. Don't worry. What do you want to do? Do you want to wait for an armadillo or do you want to go out and look for them? Oh shit. Do we want to go to Tumbleweed in case they're not there? We can just grab six horses. That works. Oh fuck. North is alive. Ooh. One of the Boons boys. I can't fucking read his writing. Who's good at reading broken English? I'll be Everett. Is that what? <laughs> I don't know. It was, it was it was you or fish. Do you want me to read what? it in an accent too? I don't know. Please, please don't. I can read it in in, in an please accent. Please don't. What kind of have you heard? Yeah. Have, he's he's like Scandinavian and he just like barely speaks English. And then oh, when he okay. fucking say less, I can. Do oh this. god, and he barely can write. All I read was Sissica. Hey, there you can go. That's all I need to know. That's my host not answering my call. Where is Joey taking me, Marjorie, betraying me? There is a telegram from Marjorie, husband, saying that he saved me. A I don't understand. I will get out of here today. What? That was hot. <laughs> what? We're back at talking about that one. <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? Huh? Okay. I, Basically, he's saying we'll practice that Marjorie in the tent. betrayed him. Uh, Baji's husband saved him, and he's in Sisica, and he's out today. <laughs> Marjorie? Who the fuck's Marjorie? I don't know. Thank you. But I'm glad you can read it, because I, I can't fucking read his writing. Mm. Okay. Sorry, I have to reply to this. Fish, you good? He's, he's pissing. Oh, okay, I see. You don't see? You don't see? No, I'm not looking that way to see if there's a stream coming out or not. You can hear it. Oh, yeah. Hitting the wood. I hear that. You're right. You were saying, Rebecca, one more time in that accent, one more time? <laughs> what do you want me to say? Say, I love you. Oh, I love you. Say, Charles Devon is the greatest outlaw the cross I've ever seen. Charles Devine is the greatest outlaw the crossing has ever seen. Oh god, I might pass out. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Fish now he's like pissing. Who's <laughs> Marjorie? Why does that sound familiar? Let's scroll it. I don't know. Who's this? What, June, you dyed your hair? What? Never mind, there's the sunlight. Oh. <laughs> you saw something I saw, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did actually. Like, what the <laughs> fuck? Who is this Wait, girl right here? She looks blonde in some blonde? angles. Yeah, oh, what the fuck? Okay. June, you gotta wash your hair, it's full of dirt. Uh, yeah, I saw her. I see her as blonde. June, in, in some angles, your hair looks really dusty and almost a little blonde. Ooh. Hey, give me a minute while Fish is p pissing. Yeah, I need to send a telegram to um, John Grace and let him know he's banned from thieves.
the uh the second line rebecca cash bang john grayson thieves wait what oh this isn't good Yo, am I weird for liking turkey? Uh, beef turkey? Not beef turkey, sorry. Turkey, no. Turkey jerky? What is this, man? Oh, uh, okay. What the hell is this? Do you oh, remember turkey Joey steak? the Ranger? DD? Oh, was that one more time? Sorry. Do you remember Joey the Ranger? Yeah, what about him? Do you remember how we, like, tormented him? Uh-huh. And strawberry. Oh, yeah. So he... So reading this telegram over... North said, Last I remember is Joey attacking me. What? The North was... A ranger attacked, attacked him? Joey. Apparently. <laughs> Last I remember is Joey attacked me. Marjorie... Betteringi... Saved me? I guess that's what that says. I have a set telegram from Marjorie. Something's missing. I talked to Joey. I can fill in the blanks. We need to talk to North first. Fuck talking to Joey. Alright. Um. I got a question since people are responding to telegrams and whatnot. At this point, do y'all want to just wait for them in Armadillo and we can set up in case they don't leave? That's what I said. Yeah, I mean, I'm saying I don't think, I think we've been waiting around long enough that it might be the better option. Yeah, the only, if, unless it's the southern exit, we will not see them. Unless you want to, you want to be more south. Call me crazy, but I kind of have an idea. It what if here. we put like two people up on the rooftop? We had three in the middle of town, and I waited at the telegram booth. It's good. Like behind the counter, so when they come to write a telegram, I could just start speaking to them and they won't expect it. Yep. Okay. Come through to send it to we would need to hide the horses because if they see all this or all these horses, they might skip us. Yeah. I'm if we hitch the horses, they'll know if people are around, don't they? Right? Yeah, we'll, we'll hitch the horse. Them. We'll follow Everett and he'll show you a spot to hitch from. Where is oh, let's go. Come on. Still pissing? Yes. Come on. What's more? I'll hitch his horse. Man. Hmm. Yeah, perfect. You can hitch around this grass. Ever, I'm going top of the saloon. The law show up. And yeah, we'll see you motherfuckers later. We'll head to the floor, like, All right. Know. Be careful. There's law at West. Yeah. yeah four four All right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm working on it. Oh, right, you can be on the other side if you want. If you want, you don't have to be up upper. Just letting you know. He's hitching up a, a directly northeast of the saloon. Or do you want me to say CD? Mm, anywhere. Wait, I, I see people. Hey, what was that? Just rode out. No, over the hills. That was not James Group. I saw a bunch of people. Or at least one person. They're creeping up in the grass. Creeping up. Oh, I see them. I fucking see them. Hey, Allah sees us. They do. They're, they're, on, they're on top of the hill right now. Uncle, you there? Where's Uncle? I don't know. He, was he here? Where'd your best go? Uncle? 
Hey, fish, losses, you go on the other side. Hey, lo- Oh, that's you. Where's, where's my uncle? Uh, behind us, doing this way. I just told him. Sorry, I'm rough. Paid. You are banned from thieves. <laughs> and we can okay. discuss whether we lift that ban when you pay your debt. Okay. Um, All right. Yes. L yes. Law is um, they spot us on top of the hill. You want to engage them or what do you want to do here? Are they still up there? They were hot in the bushes when I last saw them. So. Do you think they're gonna come to town? No, they spotted us. Yeah, but there, it's not like they spotted a group of six of us. I don't think. Well, I mean, I don't know. Um, if they spotted us. And there's only four of them, and they figured out that we're outlaws. They're probably gonna sneak around, try to get out of here, uh, or call for back out, uh, back up, and then we're gonna be outnumbered when they come back. Yeah, I mean, we're, so we could. Do you uh, have eyes on them again? Uh, no? West, on top of the hill. No, I barely have eyes. It's a bunch of people running through bushes, so I, I couldn't clearly tell who it is, but I was assume it's Log because it seemed like they're hiding in bushes. Uh, and which Jim's group just left. How about this? Just get horses. Let's go find. Let's go. To All right. Which direction is it? Look west on the hill. Get horses. Come on, everybody, mount up. Let's go. Yep. Let's go, everybody. I don't have a horse, so I can't, unfortunately. No, that's. that's... They're coming down the hill right now. They're looking at us. I see them. Really? Yeah, they're on top of the hill. Is that Benny? I think I see Benny with one of them. It looks like a uh, Scarlet Winter. I mean, I mean Zoe Winters. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about Scarlet. Our Scarlet, our Scarlet. This is a really bad timing. Up on the horse, Rebecca. Yeah, Windmore. sorry, it's just really bad timing. Old man. Let's go, mount yeah. up. Mount up. You just hop on his horse if you want to call your own. Grandpa sleeping? No. Are we going in again? Sleeping. Yeah, let's go. Oh, sitting on the floor. There was some law right up on the hill, not even hundred feet away from it. Yeah. Oh, they're right. Oh, they're turning to run. Looks like. Hello, howdy. it's us. The howdy, howdy, howdy. Hi. Howdy. Yeah, alright, let's not do anything silly. Like, circle us, please. I mean, you guys circle us all the time, so it's only fair we return the favor, that's all. I think I know. I think I've met you before. What's your name? Mine? Fish. Yeah. Fish up? Yeah. What's your name? Redding. Redding. About you. What's your name? Love. Deputy Love. That's the one who was trying to sacrifice herself to die. Oh, yeah. Love was the one that we had Howdy. as a hostage when they shot us down like a fucking firing squad in, in Blackwater. I remember. How are you? I'm uh, just fine, thank you. How are you? No, I'm all right. Y'all. How's the West uh, treating you? Oh, it. To treat me lovely. Y'all out here, uh, just the four of you. Yes. I'm not riding after you if that's what you're wondering. I mean, it just it feels like y'all been getting awfully comfortable out this way. Yeah, well, I'm stationed out here actually. I think most of us are. What a damn shame. Yeah, that's so unfortunate. Oh, I don't know. I like the West. Do you? It's beautiful. Yep. Best sunsets in the cross, huh? What's beautiful about it besides the sunsets? Hmm? So you always that been lower and take your beautiful thing. Yeah. Oh, just the sunset? I mean, there are wonderful uh, waterfalls by it. There are lakes. <laughs> I guess you can't find the sunsets out east and sat down. It's all you fucking see up there is fucking smog. Yeah, Santa is a shit hole. I, I, saw him with I agree with you there. Crayon. All right. So you were uh, meeting people in Amadillo, were you? Nope. Saw another group ride out. 
People rode in. Sure. The town outs are all right. Yeah, you know, people right in, people right out. It's just kind of how towns work. You should know that from like Blackwater, Strawberry, Valentine, Rhodes, Saint Denis. Mm -hmm. mm. So where, where so are y'all heading next? For? Yeah, where are you looking for in particular? We're <laughs> heading back in. Back in where? Back into East Blackwater. Hmm. Good. And who, well, who are you out here for? Like Rebecca said. Oh, that is so. Uh, that's between us. I mean, so we can keep like it between you. us. If you want to tell us. Oh, between the deputies. Could be between oh, all of us, though. Looking for. But no, not after you. Not looking for a firefight right now. I can tell, but you got your guns out. Every day for protection. Uh, if you were gonna get robbed or shot, you've already been robbed or shot. Yeah, yeah you're probably right. Uh, come on, Zoe. You know I'm right. <laughs> well, I'm glad that's not happening. I mean, honestly, it makes me more tempted to point a gun. Because we're holding our gun. I mean, you're, you know, I'm, I'm coming with you civilly. I'm smoking a cigarette. Yeah, I know that's true. But I don't know. I'd feel a little stupid if I put my gun away and then ended up with guns pointed at me. Do you mind removing your hat? Mine? <laughs> no, I really don't want to. Oh, come on. Wait, why? <laughs> you got, like, you a, got a haircut. We don't know about. <laughs> yeah, I got a haircut. You can look different now. Yeah, it wasn't the kind that I got in the... Trying a new style? No. I, I, it was... It was an impromptu... Involved Careful. Haircut. I don't know how to word that. As if I break up with Annie and come after you. How do you read and how you do? I'm doing fine. about you? What happened to your what? hair? <sighs> Have you seen Zip recently? Yeah, I was born Can I ask you a question? I hope not. Oh. So any fellas dressed in ponchos no, and some few. Paros, how would you raise your neck? Okay. So. Unfortunate. I, I'm not drawing my gun right now. I could. I could come out here with my gun out. Could have surrounded you. Disarmed you. Told you to get the fuck out. But if you're going east, go right past Armadillo and get the fuck out of the west. That simple. All right. You're saying you're oh. not out here for us? Just go past Armadillo and keep going. That is the plan. Well, then go ahead. Right. That is a good plan. All right. All right. Be giving so you a warning now, though. If you stop in Armadillo, I will come there with all my people, and I will surround you, and I will gun you down. Why is that? Oh, are you going to go over there? Are you going to go send a telegram and get as many mm -hmm. deputies as possible and come back out this way? So you can leave Armadillo, go right past it, and go back out east like you said you want to do. That would be the worst plan. Yeah, well, that's what we're going to do, but it, without the threats would have been nice. Well, like I told you, if you're going to get robbed or shot from the beginning, I would have already had my gun out and you would have already been robbed and or shot. I'm telling you how it is. I'm telling you, you go down there, you will be robbed or shot. So keep moving. I think you know how people respond to telling law to get out of the West, right? It's like barrel rings. I don't think we care. I yeah. mean, you're already heading out West. We're just, you know, giving you an extra push. Like you said, though, instead of taking it as a threat, maybe take it as him being merciful because he's being honest with you instead of you having to find out the wrong way. How about oh, this, Zoe? How about you tell me? I literally put his mock out! As if I don't already know. Well, you do know. Exactly. I think Weaver knows as well. <laughs> How wrong. So my fucking point is I could have come into this conversation way more aggressive. I could have come into this conversation with guns drawn. I could have disarmed all of you. I could have fucking shot you to s prove a goddamn point. I'm telling you to get the fuck out of the West because y'all are getting awfully comfortable coming out here with less than fucking six people. Coming out here, what, four, three? I found four of you in the fucking saloon at 5 a.m. You're getting awfully comfortable out in New Austin. So, go past Armadillo, 
Do not send a fucking telegram in Armadillo and get the fuck out of New Austin. Well, people are expecting a telegram from Armadillo. I don't Otherwise, give a fuck. You'll have more people riding down people here trying to find us. Butt. You can tell them in Blackwater. There you go. And the longer you delay here, the longer they're gonna be worried. You got fast horses. Chop chop. Yep, yep. Really? Alright. Sayonara. Toodle. Yeah, Miss Lou. Farewell. I saw the way go. I saw the vista. He said they were fast horses. Come on now. Yeah. Should we shoot in the air? No. What should go straight? Uh, telegram. At least till we're all on the horse. Get, get ready. Get ready. They might go with telegrams here. Yep. Get on the horses. Let's go. Oh, God. I don't think they're taking it seriously, though. I don't think they're taking it seriously. I'm going to tell you right now. They sheer disrespect. The fact that they don't understand the consequences. That's right. They're not going to get to tell you. Wins more ever go. Throw it to the left and turn. Alright, give this a space to leave. Speaking of Redden, this is his gun right here. That's the fellow that, that said me not shooting you in your vital organs is enough, right? Uh, yeah, they, 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 I just want to keep an eye so they don't turn back and go to Benedict or something. You know, we can see, we can see, I can see if I'm married. Like 400 months that, off, or days off, sorry. That's the guy who fucking, was that the one that picked me up? Well, <laughs> said he hopes my ribs break again. Just get ready for love to be out hunting for us after this. They can definitely get more and come out here again. Just to oh, make yeah, a point, so. They're gonna come here with like 10 minimum, just to say some Herman Dillon. Minimum? Oh, they could, minimum they didn't last time. Yeah. Show of force, yeah, I could say that. So, I mean, it's up to y'all if y'all want to stay here, stick our ground, or get moving. Stay out of town if we want to fight law. It's just, uh, I'm tired of us having shootouts at Thieves, and I'll have y'all be feel about that. Oh, I yeah. don't mind staying here. Yeah, I mean, I know that they're going to probably go through Thieves. If she gets the black water, they're going to run through Thieves first thing, then come here. Oh, they just disappeared quickly, up the ramp, so they're definitely quickly, going back east. Though. Uh, is anybody prepared? Y'all got bandages, food, all that thing? Yep, I've got 20 bandages. I've got a little bit of food. Got yeah, I got 300 rifle. I need half okay. 10 bandages. Let's go to Tumbleweed then. Let's go to Tumbleweed. Let's yeah, go. I was going to say, it's up to everybody if we want to stay. Uh, if you need medical stuff, get it here. But if you need weapon stuff, Tumbleweed. Yep, anybody that needs bandages and medical supplies. I'm good on that. I just need more ammo and I should be good. Okay. All right, well, let's get to Tumbleweed and come back, please. I think Forrest needs some medical. Show these horses, man. I'm not sure what they're doing. Shit. If anybody needs money, I can cover you. Just let me know what you need. Uh, I think I only have like a hundred. I only just, I have just under 200 rounds. Probably. Depends if you waste ammo or not. I saw a horse, right. man. Tumbleweed. Grab a hundred. Don't they only try and bring the military into, into this shit when, if we push big lore out west? I mean, my uncle. And everybody else took out 14 lawmen and a Gatling gun. I definitely need the army's help, that's for sure. Uh, I mean, look, I I just wanted to prove a point. I don't even necessarily, uh... What's this? What's this? Howdy, howdy. 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 How you doing, Yeah, how you doing? How you doing, Carl? Who is that? Cheddar. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, it's good to yeah, see it's you. It's been a while. Yeah, I just saw uh, James and the others are up at the fort. 
That sounds good. We're, uh, we yeah. just kicked uh, six lawmen out of the west. Oh, we're not really? Six, on four, the four lawmen out of the west. Really? Yeah, they're not very happy. Oh, they, they, were, they were already making threats about what happens to people that mm -hmm. try to kick them out of the west and whatnot. <laughs> that was good that you taught them a lesson, man. Yeah, I just don't be be if you're wanted, just don't be surprised if they come out this way in numbers. They will come out yeah, numbers sure. for sure. Is James at the fork? So I want to go warn him. Yeah, they're up at the fork right now. You should be able to catch them. All right, all right, rest safe. Let's go to the fort and then we'll go tumbleweed. Sounds good. Rebecca, we can show them Clill. None of the new people know Clill. Oh yeah, we should show them Clill. All right, follow me. We'll go. I'll take us to the fastest route to the fort. Right. Pick it up. Can we to show you the clue? I don't think I've seen it before. I know about it! Well, we weren't sure if there was like a little mountain, a little hill, a little cliff, or whatever it was. So we called it clue. Uh, oh, I see. It's probably not the best name for it, but you know, it works. There's actually a foot buried there. Uh, really? Mm-hmm. The name sounds familiar. Uh, Max Brady's foot is buried there. Jesus. I'm kicking them at the bottom, I get more comfortable. They should know the West is dangerous. I think I think the law does not fear the West as they used to, honestly. Also, now the law has more numbers where they can actually patrol the West than before. Oh, I'll, I'll, I got some raw stike here. I'll hand you some raw In the past, stike, law would struggle with having six, seven, eight, nine deputies on duty all the time. Now they can average that easily and they can get more. So people are actually getting stationed out West and there's actually active patrols happening. Hey, scroll us on to James, man. Look at that. What happens when people kick them out of the West? Trying to reference taking a Gatlin gun out and whatnot. Howdy, Mills. I told them. I told them, uh. I said, uh, am I, am I, how the fuck would I, of all people, not know what happens? And then I started rubbing in salt into the wound about Weaver. So, uh, they're most likely, even if they don't come out here with a fucking Gatlin gun, they're most likely coming out here in force. They are. If not six of them, probably more. So, they just got told to get the fuck out and go to the east. So, just a heads up. Where are you heading now? Uh, we're heading to Tumbleweed, then probably uh, to a little spot called the Khalil. Did we you use... tell him that they weren't here for us? Oh, yeah, they also weren't here for us, so they were probably looking for you. Most likely, yes. <laughs> Interesting. Ev, uh, I heard them say something. They were, one of them was asking you about something. Uh, he, uh, he asked me if I seen the Lobos out here in the middle of all that, and I'm like, no. Nope. Even if they're looking for the Lobos, why would you look for them uh, with only four instead oh, four? of six? Yeah. They've been getting their asshole by the Lobos left and right, right? So. That makes sense. They they probably went to Rat Skello instead of Tumbleweed. This is the law we're talking about. We ain't talking about no geniuses. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. They, uh... They also are claiming that three out of the four of them are stationed out in the west, so apparently they're getting real comfortable with, with station and folk out in the west or whatnot. That might be the lady that me and Mills paid a visit to the other day. Was McAllister with them? No. It was Zoe Winters. Winters Zoe was, Winters. Zoe Winters was leading it. Oh God, she has a hideous haircut right now. How is oh, Zoe not a senior yet? No. What? It was, it was forcefully cut off, apparently. Yeah. Oh, who did that to her? Well, I wasn't I don't know, but I kind of want to shake their hand. There was. I, I like uh, how she brought up Zip, though. I told you they're, they they like each other. 
She likes Zip. Uh, she did ask so. if we'd seen Zip recently. That is gross. <laughs> uh huh. It was uh, her. It was a guy named Bishop. A, a love and a reading. Those are the four. No, I. First time I'm hearing those names. I basically didn't. There's so many new deputies. It is insane. They're growing up like fucking crops. Well, I could say that. I could say the same with the folk out west, to be honest. So I ain't too concerned. Yeah. Thanks for the heads up. I think uh, Cheddar Bob just rode in, so we got five now. All right. So just be prepared. They might. They might try to come back out here with six, and they they might try to hit y'all. But, I mean. Y'all be fine with five, even if they brought six. Motherfucker, we'll put them down like the dog D. I'm gonna tell you, <laughs> I'm gonna tell you one thing. We had a rabbit chase after us into the fort, and as soon as she saw the fort, she had a flashback of the past Brentley and fell back instantly. So, they will not try to attempt to attack this <laughs> fort. It brings a lot of bad memories for them. Yeah, but you never know, nephew. They might see they only have five and they have six and just say fuck it and do it anyway, because they're reckless. And that's the other thing. These newer deputies, they don't have the history, so they don't know what to do and what not to do, so they just make reckless decisions. Yeah, I think, they sure I think do. they're probably gonna reckon they'll bring everyone they can get, take over the town, and just hold the town. That's what they've done last time. Numbered. Last time they came out of Armadillo, we, we saw the first uh, six, and then four came afterward, and they had ten in the whole town. Yeah, I think you're right, CD. I think that's what they'll do. They won't fight us. All right. Uh, well, we're gonna move on to Tumbleweed. Make sure we got ammo, and then we're gonna stay at a camp we use out all the way out this way. All right. Hey, you doing that for the rest of the evening? Uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll go back out. I I don't know what everybody else got planned. I've been around for about eight hours, so I'm just kind of relaxing, going with the going with the wind. Right. I do I do think it would be uh... funny if all of us went out east. <laughs> Because I feel like they're going to send like 10 or 12 deputies out this way, so I do Yeah, think but they know what they say, right? They say, well, y'all want to claim yeah, the West, I mean, but you don't I, even hold I, it down. I want to say out West, but I do think it would be funny. Especially if they bring a fucking army. But, Not a bad uh, idea. We'll, we'll probably be at the, the Khalil, which is... Uh... Uh, it's a hill just south of Gaptooth. Yeah. Yeah, we'll probably oh, okay. be over there. Near Coronado and whatnot. Is that the, the Sam Hill? Uh, no, but you can see it from there. But the camps on the cliffs? No, no. We'll, we'll show y'all. Alright. We're, we're gonna get going though. I just want the warning. I'm there. Yeah, well, well like I said, you need Um. <clears throat> yeah, Lama, I have hell of numbers. Why be scared? <laughs> Oh, yeah, exactly. No, don't yeah. do it. Get down. Oh! <laughs> uh, fuck you, old man! I'll bite you! Ow! Say that baby Winters, she was pushing her luck. Thank you, you too. You too, June. Be you careful of the law. Uh, you, you brought. Go to Tumbleweed. Sorry. Alright, let's go. Come on. Yeah, I've reached a very, um, mellow mood of the night. Man, that Ansberg shootout we had with them, I'm so glad I took down a Weller right away. When he made that flank, I made sure every single bullet went toward his direction. I, I always go for Weller first. Always, always. That fucker is always thinking about a flank and trying to get you from behind. Honestly, I, you want to know why I, I'll always try to shoot Weller first? So I don't have to hear him speak. <laughs> you know, it was awfully quiet doing that shootout, I must say. I feel the same about Bolton. Bolton also seems to be one that calls out a lot of tactical shit, so yeah, I tend yeah, to yeah. aim for her. I always go down. I always aim for the tactical leader they have. That way, they're not planning; they're just holding down things. 
I'm just scared of a fight right now. That's all I've got is a skull. I thought you had your navy. Use your damn navy. Oh, do not use the skull field. Use your navy. We're losing it. Let's play, let's play, let's play. What is the point of not using a gun? I'll give you my navy, goddammit. I'll give you my navy if you want. I was gonna use it against top hand. Old, old man, old man. Take my pocket. No, I like it. I wanna use the skull field. Let him use the skull field. Okay, if I lose the shootout, we can blame him. I know it's shit. Uh, actually, skull fields aren't that shit. A close range is not that shit. Yeah, but how often these shootouts with law at close range? Never. Well, you use your rifle at long range. He doesn't have one. But he doesn't have one. You lose it. Oh. You look good with it. I don't only have one. No, he does. That's why we're gonna go buy some, damn it. All right. What the fuck? A little bit more. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy that he's holding that gun, though, to be honest. Don't worry. He's gonna flank from Tumbleweed all the way back to Armadillo. War, <laughs> pestilence, famine, and death. The apocalypse it's gun, okay, man. Forest, I'm gonna put four law down with this gun. I see, sure so you kill so. Bass I'll plan first? Yeah, it's true. So a lot of people get guns. You buy them, Woody. Have you ever I'm a gunsmith. Like, like the gun store? <laughs> That's the only way, man. There's no whitelist. I, I do like that, honestly. I split them up. I think whitelist and RP sometimes That's can be very bad. That way they like if gun, if there's a gun whitelist, back in 1901, that would be unimmersive in my opinion, because anybody can make guns back then. Anybody can buy guns. Doesn't matter who you are. There's no, there's no license. It's a right to bear arms. Second Amendment, brother. Could you imagine that? Like a bullet going in. Guns were like. Having basically um, keys to your car. You always had those on you. There's your fragging that. Alright, just stay if you need it. Hey, you want to grab it? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't like the fact there's like no even. I like the fact there's not even um, you know, a whitelist to make dynamite, for example. Anybody could just make dynamite, right? I think whitelists just gatekeep RP most of the times and help it, unless it's something that comes with a lot of responsibilities. I like using my revolver over my long arm. Oh, for sure, I love painting. So you can walk, you can walk up to the, the gun store right here, and then you can buy it right here. Each uh, gunsmith has different kind of guns, though. This one doesn't have a leech field. Unless Lancaster, Phoenix, Shotgun, and Schofield. Hope you like that one, Winsboro. I, ma I made that one personally. Hey, it's beautiful. Mm-hmm. I mean, we're at the stables. I could always grab my thing and then give this back. I wish I, I can no, get an extended on this uh, Navy. Looks great. Looks great. Why don't you? Uh, we'll have to go to somewhere else. Strawberry or no, oh, I should know what uh, would be Valentine, most likely, right? Yeah. It's stopping my arsenal, man. So, I mean, yeah, I came that. here to customize a weapon last Why? night. I, mean, I didn't realize that uh, you can't do it here, so I have to go all the way back out to Valentine. Yep. I mean, you ain't. That shit was dreadful. Up, you know, I said, you borrowing it. You know, Yo, I, feel bad. I, I, get, I, I get to get, feel guilty. Is it because you feel like you'll lose it? How much rifle ammo should carry? We got 300. Is that enough? Yeah, yeah that'll I mean, be fine. I feel fun. like I need to go get you something for now and give you something. No, no, no. Uh, tell me, what is it gone for, Winsmore? Uh, killing people. Oh, that's right. Is you gonna kill people with it? Yeah. Then that is the best gift you can give to me. Rebecca, can you ride your own horse or no? Uh, yeah. Do you want me to? I mean, the quill's real close. And I think if we shoot horses away, it would be good if we have some people that have their horses ready, just in case. That's yeah, fine, you know everybody. I mean? Everybody. I doubt they'll come out that west, though. I think they might just go to Armadillo, because um, 
Like I said, last time they did that, we did that. They came down to Armadillo and held it down. All right, let me let me check what your bass he has. Just um, just have it ready. That's all. Just have it ready. Yeah. Okay. Cause I think I have that already. It's not about a box on, is it? No. You got room on your horse? I do. I got a few spaces. I was gonna say forest. <laughs> I could hold something on my horse. Yeah. Perfect. Since I don't got tobacco for it, can you hold on to it? Hey, CD, I think we should be yeah, banned from rooftops. Well, good thing there's a lot of them in Armadillo. Thank you. Thank you for trusting yeah, me. You know, I kept my, kept my no, no, no. I gotta conquer my fear of gravity, okay? I'll be fine. I might not be. See ya. I don't know how I even passed out like that. I, I hit a bag of corn. Like the softest thing you could probably think of. I hit a wagon. Head first. Alright. What's the Can you ride your own horse? Uh, if needed. How do you want to do this, Uncle? Four or six horses? What do you want to do here? Uh, let me just do four. Okay. Right. Uh, we're just going to the. I mean, Quill is literally two feet. Yeah, it's not far. Honestly, it, it would be good. Oh, we don't want to go back to Armadillo? I thought we were going back there. When did we. When would we say that? I thought we were going to resupply and hold down Armadillo. Okay. <laughs> I don't think anybody. No. Know. no. What? How are we gonna hold Armadillo down once they bring like ten bring down there? They're gonna bring twelve man. I don't know. And I'm he's extremely know. wanted. Good fuck risking that just for a tag. Oh, so you wanna you wanna hold down the Khalil then? Yeah, I mean, we just wanna stay out west to see if they come out looking for us. Okay, sounds good. Alright. Yeah, I wasn't sure. I thought we we're gonna supply and come back. I thought I thought we were doing that. Oh, let, let's check the mods. We we're just getting supplies while uh oh, we're out this way. Winsmore wants to check the mods. All right, let's check the mine then. Cool. Right, okay, go. we need to go right, right. anyway. I'll leave, I'll leave the way. Or fish can. I thought we're gonna go back and hold on armadillo. I don't know. That's what I thought. I don't know. I don't know why I thought that. Uh, uh, by the way, uh, uh, Julian is wanting to start up a mining company. So you told uh, me this. I did. Yes. Yeah, you said that last night or two nights ago. All right, I just wanted to make sure. And we've been trying to find people for him all day, pretty much. I actually recommended somebody to him, yeah. Oh, that's good, that's good then. Because uh, I'm going to be helping him with that, helping him Release space? Build up. I thought a bag of corn would be soft. And hopefully all them gems he brings down over to us. It feels like a, like a, it feels like a pillow, no? Yeah, we met a, we met a guy up in Ansberg called Big Joe that we started calling Big John. Um, we robbed him of his gems, but I said if he comes to Thieves, we'll buy them next time. Ooh, I want some gems. <laughs> really? You so really like blingy things, huh? I like what? Like shiny things? That's why I chose you. <laughs> you think I'm shiny? You have your moments. <laughs> okay. Yeah, likewise. Can't ever find us in here, therefore. Dry corn is like rocks. Hmm. I was, I always thought dry corn would be soft. Um, you know, if it's like in a pillowcase. Oh, shake. Oh, it's more be careful. <laughs> Jack no, shit. I love eating this plant. It's my favorite. I hear some, I hear some people make pies with this. Yeah. Eat plain seed. Yeah. I, I don't know you what tell who hunts and who feeds animals? Listen, man. I, I didn't grow up on a, on a farm or I never hunted. So I'm just going on like what I believe or no. And check and correct me, man. Nothing wrong with that. But you never know. Poisonous. Oh, what is it? You can try it. Yeah. That shit barely does anything to me anymore. It would be interesting if we overlooked uh, Tumbleweed and see if they push into Tumbleweed. 
I, I just want to see what their response is like to that. Honestly, I'm curious. Do we have anybody that's not one? Uh, Rebecca, maybe. How bright that I'm, camp right there! Oh, it's beautiful. The clill is right ahead of us. The clill's ahead of us. That's where we're going. I'd suggest shooing your horses away down here so that we don't pull too much attention. I'm gonna hitch mine. Okay. Uh, yeah. That would be terrible. We have to run back to Tumbleweed to get him. I'm just gonna hitch my horse. I mean, I mean, Larkin is just on top of the hill. Wait, hold up. What, if, what, if we, what if we hit your horses by the mine? Yeah, yeah. Alright, yeah, do that. Can we call them from afar? I'll be back. I can't hit my horse! Brother. What? There we go, finally! Be honest. If we hold that armadillo, we're gonna have to fight at least ten, maybe mm. maybe more. And I don't know if that's a risk that we should take when like we're so close to uh, getting out of solitary, possibly. Right. Yep. It's fair, it's a good idea. I so mean, I could my, head down. My thought is, we like Winsmore said, we send one that's not wanted to scout uh, to see their response, so we know it, when we do this again, when either a I'm not as wanted or not facing solitary, we can hold down armadillo and expect a certain number mm. in the future. Yeah, I could do that. Okay. Uh, well, you might be wanted now because of the it whole threat like thing. Yeah, it right into that. It'll, It'll definitely try to hold you up for that, so. That's okay, I'll throw myself in. They'll give me like Oh, so one day, I would love to hold down Armadillo and just stick up the whole entire law. Yeah, that's what we're talking about right now. I, I think I think it's a good idea to do that, but we got to prep for that. Yeah. yeah. So this is the first step in prepping towards that. Yep. Like uh, Alright, like everybody, box. this is a spot. Um, Rebecca's already up here. You come over. Ah, it's gonna take us a minute to get it. Oops. Oh no, I'm gonna break a hip. Yeah, you are a little bit. All right, so basically the way the way to describe this is you want to do it on like you want to like run on it on like to the up and to the right. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> just run! I'll be up to jump. Just run. I just oh, ran. I just jumped onto this side over here because it's a lower platform. What is that? So well done. There's, Thank there's you. you do well. Actually, I want to try something. Becca, did we ever try this? That didn't work. <laughs> there you go. The golden spot seems to be right here. This is the golden spot. Grew up in this kind of music, man. I know, I know, I know. It's definitely more uh, older for sure. I don't, don't worry. I'm down here with you. I feel 
feels kind of surreal to be back here. Why's that? I'm up here now. Sure does, for sure. You spend a lot of time here? Back with your great uncle. I got a lasso. Oh, there we go. Oh. No, James has mine. I do have a lasso in case someone fails. Man, I can't believe Grandpa beat you up here before, Uncle. I know, I couldn't get it for the life of me. I'm the one that found this path up, this one up. We used to use this one. You remember when we just used this one? Mm-hmm. This one's harder, in my opinion. There's two ways up, though. There's this area here where we just went up, and then there's an area over by the butt crack. To the left of the butt crack by the tree. Though. Nobody comes up here, old man. I know, we used to... Uh, Boone's camp was that thing on the cliff, and we used to just sit up there all the time, and no one would ever come up to us, and we'd watch them on. Well, this spot, nobody's gonna come near it. And if they come up here, the only way they could push us is, like, right here and that over it, there. So we could literally just rain down on them. Not even pushing, it's honestly just, that's our weak point. I don't think, I don't think it would be that bad, to be honest. Especially... It would definitely be, uh... You got oh, rock, yeah, you yeah got we got some here. rocks. Never mind. Got rock you can get behind here. Never mind. Oh, I take back what I said. It will be fine. See, so yes. Uh, when we yeah, give me a minute, to, uh, quick, go sorry. camp to camp when we were wanted, this is what we referred to in telegrams as the Khalil. C L I L L. This is uh spot Rebecca and I used with the gang. God damn. Never been here before. My God. What a great spot. Yeah, it is a good spot. <laughs> Y'all picked a really Brings good spot, huh? Memories. It's, like a, it's like a fortress in the desert. Yeah, we shot someone here, too. Isn't Max's foot somewhere? Yeah, Rebecca yeah, says it's buried somewhere over here? Yeah. Y'all should have buried his entire body, honestly. I mean, the foot should still be there. If anyone's what was crazy? Interested. Zip riding with Max only lasted like a few days. That's it. I mean, most sip things last only a few days, right? Not wrong. So, uh, how did the conversation go? Because you never explained that part to me. There wasn't much conversation. I, I, Rebecca and Everett, am I wrong? It was pretty much just like, yeah, okay. And then go to then he went to Tumbleweed, handed it over. There you go. Yeah. There's literally Javas saying, uh, don't overstep with um, Rebecca and my nephew and hand the gun back and this is all over. And he said, okay. Yep. He's not welcome at Thieves, right? If we see him, what if he tries Maybe to... You see uh... him, just tell him to fuck off. Okay. All right. Just making sure. Also, so everyone's aware, I've telegrammed John Grace and told him that him and the Grace gang is not allowed in Thieves until they pay the debt to June of $250. And after that, we can discuss whether they're allowed back in Thieves. Can I, can I have a full story on that? Uh, yeah, you, oh, you want to give it? <laughs> well, it's I long. don't know. It's long. I'm just confused. Okay. Is there um... a short version? Yeah, there is a short version for sure. Yeah, can someone shorten it for me? Long story uh, short, um, yeah, John and um, Nathaniel Green, right? Is that not get that name right? They were part of a, a, a big yeah. gang called, uh, or, or just a gang called uh, the Greens? Yeah, Green Gang. Green Gangs. Um, it was named after Nathaniel Green. Mm-hmm. Damn, that's a cool gang. Green Gang. Um, they had a, they were all together. They had a fellow that was um, named Judith uh, that was Green. also part of the group. But, uh... Mr. Green was more focused on the business aspect of things and conducting a lot of business. However, uh, John and the rest of them, they wanted to be kind of like a family and more just in a business kind of uh, group or gang. So they started seeing different, you know, from um, how uh, they perceive things or we're not seeing eye to eye, I guess you could say. As a result, they grew apart and there was an incident where Judith was with, with, with um, what's his name? Uh, Green, Daniel Green. And they were surrounded by somebody who was trying to rob. And during that time when they were outnumbered our gun, um, Judith decided to run away and not back up uh, Nathaniel Green. 
So the people that held up uh, Green told him, listen, um, we're not going to rob you, we're not going to hurt you, and we want to conduct business with you. All we're asking is you um, teach that uh, person that ran away a lesson to prove to us that you're willing to work with us, and he did. However, John was not very happy with the fact that um, Green uh, did that to Judith, who was part of the group. So they separated, and now they're going after each other. Uh, previously, or last night, it seemed like uh, John made a move on Green. But the problem is, now Green's people want to go after John. And John is afraid, so he's going basically in disguise. And uh, is scared that something might happen to June because of his association with, uh, with, with his group, right? Are you with me still? <laughs> yeah. I'm Old listening. man, you're, you're, you're still listening. following? Okay. All right, I'm listening. Perfect. Okay. So, um, John apparently um, was more scared about losing his group, group members and himself than actually about his relationship with June. Also, when, when, it, came, when it came to the trip going to Gorma together, he made June pay for it, which was the $250 Rebecca's talking about, instead of actually paying out of his own pocket. He made June do it. And on top of it, um, it seemed like um, he's willing to throw his own gang members under the wagon or save his, his himself and uh, his reputation. He tried to join with um, uh, James Kelly and his folks. Four riders behind us? Oh, James and them. It is. Hmm. They're going to get fucked if they go to Armadillo. I wonder if they, they, they know. For miners to rob. It would be and it's horses. Nancy, our horses. Your horses. And look at this. Scarlet's riding with them. Where are they? So, um. They look. They looked at us and then just kept riding. <laughs> long story short, basically, uh, John is a piece of shit. Should not be trusted. Who um, okay. is willing to even protect members of his own gang and is willing to snitch to the law. He's also willing to snitch to the law if something bad happens to him. Uh, in order to benefit himself, he does not have any, um, you know, I guess, um, principles or morals to go off of. And I'm glad June left him and tried to um, join Uncle Kelly. So when I called them Muppet Gang, they really were Muppet Gang. Correct. Yeah. And he was trying to make a fool out of June um, by choosing his gang over her and everything that she'd done for him to try to help him. Oh. Mm-hmm. <sighs> so, okay. John Grace and Grace Gang is not allowed in Thieves. If they come to thieves and you ask them to leave and they don't, feel free to shoot them. Is there like, do they wear any like identifying stuff that relates them to that group or? I don't believe so, no. No, just... but um, the ones no. I do know of is um, John Grace. There's a guy called Varric and yep. a guy called Edward. But that's, that's the ones I know of. Okay. Yeah. So, um, that's, that's them basically. Um, all I know is, um, Nathaniel Green came to talk to my uncle and, uh, what happened from there? I don't know. That's something my uncle can tell him. You just want to work. Oh, I was short. Yeah, there you go. So you want to offer yeah, things. Deep. So, Might make sense. so how do you feel about groups coming down thieves asking for a sponsorship right away? I feel like, um, you should warm up to that in a little bit. Oh, there they are. They saw us. Yeah, I agree. I, I'm, uh. I'm I'm tasking with robbing guns for me. There you go. There they are. Howdy. If you can make it up here, I'll give you five dollars. What the fuck? <laughs> he just rode his fucking horse up here like. He yeah, just just do like not, not teach the law how to do that. Why would you get our horses up here and hitch them? Y'all didn't leave them up front of the mines on purpose. We did actually. Yeah, we did it on purpose to think they were mining. Hey, this what's that? Well, fucking tricked us. Hey, good. Oh, Use your horse, y'all. It's easier that way. <laughs> <laughs> y'all seen it a lot, yeah, Wes? We didn't uh, run into John Gray to the telegram station. Didn't say anything. He didn't say anything. It was a bit awkward. Would you look at that? Speak of the devil? Anything? Yeah. I said howdy and you just ignored me, so. <laughs> And that fella had everything going for him and he decided to throw it all away. 
Yeah, I'll dodge the bullet. What the fuck? Told, I told you, little Muppet Gang Kelly. That's one way to do it. When, Winsmore did call them Muppet Gang before he ever learned about any of this, and somehow it rings true. Yeah, yeah, we need to trust his instinct more. <laughs> didn't I didn't grow this beard overnight. I don't think anybody thought you did, old man. I'm just saying I'm wise. Why have a big beard? Wise. A beard does not make you beard. wise. I've seen sword. many bearded men who have been absolute idiots, like John oh. Grace. Him so up what, uh, oh, it depends on how long through the beard is, to be fair, right? Um, it's about the size of yours. Now I don't want this beard. Shave it. No. So you like boulder hats, rude boy Rudy? If it way. You like bowler hats? Yeah, I like the bowler hats, motherfucker. Who the I'm fuck is this guy? He never introduced himself, actually. Did he just say motherfucker to him? I said, what? I said, who the fuck is this guy? Motherfucker, my name is Rude Boy Rudy, motherfucker. What's your name? Y'all have literally had a fist fight. Yeah, yeah, but I never actually got the introduction because yeah, afterwards. Hey, Rude Boy Rudy. Yeah. Charles Devon, nice to meet you. Charles Devon? Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, they, they Where be you from? me Woo Boy, Rudy. You know what I'm saying? Where you from? I'm from the Bayou. Bayou. How'd you yeah. find yourself out west? That motherfucker, I was searching for the greatest gunslinger. It's like I could have a little soda in. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Become the best gunslinger they ever is, was, they ever will be. Mm. And you couldn't find out east, huh? Said you come out west. Well, motherfucker, out east, there ain't no gunslingers. They stab you in the back, that's for sure, them, them, them city slickers. Yeah, they don't got alligators in the swamps, they got snakes. Exactly. All they, right. don't know not, they don't know nothing about no gators. Nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. How'd you find Uncle James? <laughs> Wait, I, I met this one motherfucker down in Rose many months ago by the name of Robbie Go. He told me. I told him, hey, I wanted to be the greatest gunslinger that ever is, was, or ever will be. He said, well, at the time, the greatest gunslinger you ever find, his name is James Kelly. And he killed this one very, very big name uh, city selector, you know what I'm saying? I said, okay there, motherfucker. Many months later, found myself with guns and shit. I came out riding. I bumped into him. Wasn't expecting to find him, to be honest. Rest is history. Hmm. God damn. There's belief. Hello, Coops. Just That's the, what are you all saying? Sit, 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 get back over here. Say that one more time. James Just, Kelly told him that. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, James Kelly told me that motherfucker. I was about to say, it remind me of somebody I miss right now so much. I haven't seen in a long, long time. Don't make him laugh. Oh, yeah, don't make him laugh. Yeah, don't make me laugh, motherfucker. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> huh? Huh? <laughs> 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 what? Because I've been seeing Unk in a long time. <laughs> Who the fuck is Unk, man? Well, don't worry about it. Stop laughing! <laughs> Goddamn motherfuckers. It's like, it's like, like maybe it's his lost son or something. <laughs> it's gonna be his own language one day. Spreading. This guy is the 1901 Ratchet Block Ancestor. <laughs> I just love the view from up here. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? <laughs> now he's weaponizing his laugh. Language, man. That's the new language. <laughs> oh my God. He's weaponizing that laugh. Yeah, he, he he laughed at McAllister earlier and spat all over her and then wiped, wiped her down with his shirt. Exactly. I was the charge for that. Dirty shirt. Yeah, I wiped the face They're gonna hit you with a stolen battery for that. Motherfucker, I couldn't give a red sand, motherfucker. <laughs> Hell yeah. Damn yeah, straight. No, we can't rain. We have to break off. The rule is six.
There's no way in hell the law comes out west, right? I'm too scared. Nah, I guarantee you there's like 12 they of them. They probably have the whole department currently in Armadillo. Yeah, yeah. they probably hold in Armadillo. God, I, I hate the fact that you do that shit. Oh, I can go oh, man, I might be too bullheaded, but I want to go in there and just fuck him up. June robbed a ranger today and a lawman. Yeah. <laughs> hey, every, you're not wanted. If you want to go check Armadillo and just see how many are there, but like from the yeah, outskirts. Sure. You know, be yeah, safe. Mm-hmm. Be back in a bit. I'm scared for Everett. They might think it's Mills to go after him. <laughs> I mean, he's not hey, wanted, hey. so even if they do come at him, he will just he is. Like... I mean, he was with us. He might get, like, something charged. I'm not sure what they give him. That guy wins my So, Law can bring. You have bad friends, Charlie. Law can bring unlimited people in towns. Outside towns, it's only six. What? So, it's a 6v6 outside any towns, but in towns, which I wish I agree with. I think I think it's an immersive change for sure. Because it makes sense in town, you have more law, right? Well, out of town, you don't. So, I like that a lot. Obviously, if you if you wanted heavily. I just love this view. It's very beautiful. Uh, this this is actually surprisingly very lot. If you if you wanted heavily, and um, honestly, like when I used to be wanted very heavily on Sam, I haven't done it on, on, on Charles before. If you if you wanted heavily, like 10, 15, 20 OOC days, um, you can request for the law to bring more than six, and I think I think you should because it makes sense. The more wanted you are, the more stars or response it is as far as you know how many law. You were saying, um, that you were feeling down? Yeah. What's wrong? I know, I'm just having one of those days, I guess. Anything I can do to help out? No, I think I just need to suck it up. Something happened to make you feel that way? You just woke up feeling that way. <laughs> no, I just I woke up feeling that way. Understood. Well, if there's anything I can do? Make you feel better, you let me know, right? Yeah, I will do. I don't have my green You know, standing here looking out over this, I can't help to want to say like that everything the light touches is gonna be yours one day. Not not mine or yours. Ours. Rebecca. <laughs> Forget that. Alright. Ours. What the fuck is that? Just don't go where the shadows are. Oh, yeah, not wrong about that. I mean, being in the shadows can be good for the time being. It can get me ready for the sunlight I'm about to face. Yeah. Yeah, I bet. Are you still feeling a little bit bad about scheming? Um, no. <laughs> Rebecca. Because I remember you said the other day that you feel like you're becoming Jesse a little bit. Oh, you know, I feel about what, yeah, when I when I did that stuff, yeah, when I started to feel like, um, what would Jesse do, or um, Fiverr, or, um, you know, all those schemers out there in the crossing, I started to feel that way for sure, because, see, I sometimes scheme, not because I want to scheme and I get joy out of it, not because I want to scheme because I find it as a solution to my problem. I scheme because sometimes I have to. And if I don't, I'm probably going to get buried. So it's something that I definitely reach my hand to and grab if I need to. It's an option. Yeah. Not my first option. Not something I want to go with. But I know that when it comes to conflict, when it comes to war, and any future connections, you have to play dirty. You, you cannot be some sort of honorable outlaw that, that lives by one code and try to run the whole entire west because some people will use that against you they will take your weaknesses and exploit it to the fullest capacity possible and i cannot allow that for somebody to come in and do that to me no i get that so i'm trying i don't, sometimes I don't necessarily change my ways. think it's bad yeah. i mean i in times of war with the Dicensos, I was very much for playing mind games with them and make them feel unsafe in their own home. I don't know, I, and that sort of stuff is pretty scheming. I like, 
It's like if I'm wearing red, I have to yeah. take off red. Well, those folks only know scheming and business and um, playing dirty. They don't play fair. So if you show them you're able to match the same level, the same kind of language they speak, to me, not only do they start to respect you more, but also they will not take you lightly. Um. You know how we don't have secrets from each other? Yeah. I had a conversation with June earlier. Uh huh. And and this this got to stay between us. Okay. Sure. Uh, she told me that she had gone up to Forest and said, since I'm not seeing John anymore, you can now ask me out on a date. Did you find the skull shoes I was talking about? Uh, what? Listen, it's, it's got to stay, stay between us. Why Forest? I don't know. I don't know. But I said, I if it up. does happen, then oh, I'm going to make sure that you and I chaperone. I don't want to chaperone. <laughs> when I hear the gubby fish make noises. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to tell you right now. She's already her heart broken once. Let's not make it twice with Forrest. His mind and his heart but... belongs to Fiverr. I'm yeah, telling you that right now. I tell what it is. Yeah, I, I think it does too. But I'm just telling you what she said. Oh, so I'm gonna start being really mean to June. Why? I think she needs it. I'm gonna be. Really I'm gonna give her a lot of tough love. You. I don't care. That's the thing, Rebecca. I don't care because I'm only doing it for you, not for me. Hey, what a fist. Oh, I'd prefer if she doesn't hate my partner. Okay, well, this is how I operate. I'm gonna get Shar some tough love. Because she's been going around and being a shit thrower. And I don't like that. I'm gonna give her a taste of her own medicine. You're not interrupting, you can come up. Psalms for the poor. Oh, uh, I got a knuckle sandwich. Would you like that? On the cliff side. <laughs> what if I, what if I fall over? You know, hold on. Would you still do it? Absolutely not, fish. Come on now. I, I can't. For the record, I can't fucking see you right now. You gotta be careful. Wait, what happened to your eye? I'm I'm blind now, CD. I can't I can't see, man. I. <laughs> You gotta bench me, brother. You gotta put me down. What? You got I I I can't fight no more. Well, I can't fight. I can't fight fish my nature. Does not need his eyes to swim in a river. That's actually true. I ain't gonna lie. Most of them sharks, by the way, like like actual sharks, they can't fucking see because of exactly. parasites. Also, I got told that sharks don't have necks, so they can't turn around. They just circle around. That's why you get circled by a shark. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know you was brushing up on fish facts, man. Maybe you should start riding them, then I do. No, I should not. It's just every now and then I do get curious. And just hearing the fish facts gets me thinking, huh? So uh, I grab a book and I read. Hey, that ain't so bad. Hey, see, do you, you, know, you know I do I knew them tarot readings? Have you tried one? Have I tried one? Uh, me personally, I've 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 had I've had cards read for me, but but I, I read for people. Old man, he, you ever interested? Mm. I mean, yeah, sure. Yeah. If you want, if you want to try it with me, by all means. Sure, sure. I know my... Go ahead. Huh? Whenever we get back to to thieves, we got a quiet time. You pull me to the side, and be like, hey man, I want my 
on my fortune red today. Oh, I, I could pull a, a single card for you, see how your day might go. I could tell you how, oh, freak, you're how right, your you're life right. is going right now. Well, I mean, I won't be telling you shit. The cards will be, but you know what I mean. I would love something like that. I don't believe in that shit, I'll be honest, but I'm curious I, to know what you have stored for me. Don't got to believe in it. It's all about believing in yourself. The cards Damn don't have straight. the power. The cards are just a message. That's all. Right. Makes so, sense. Don't, you don't got to believe in the hoodoo, voodoo, anyway. brew harrier, the, the blackest of magics. You you do uh, what you think is best. Okay. But, but, Take of it as uh, advice. Take the hat off. I'm like the... Uh, now? It's like I'm the ticket master, you know? It's, it's like you buying a ticket, I, I punch the ticket in, I hand it back to you, and you, like, enjoy, like, your moving picture. It's kind of like mm. that. Mm. I mean, the well, cards, after all, are pictures. I pictures. do know the ending, how things are going to end. I can tell you that for a fact. But I don't know what's the start or the beginning going to be like. Oh, middle. Yeah. Why are you showing me your ring finger? Oh, oh shit, man! I, I, I ain't like, I ain't like, I ain't like, I ain't like flipping you off or, or, or anything. You know, like, like, like I know. Because you's gonna, you gonna, gonna get married, real. right? That's the way it ends. Don't let anybody tell you no. You only do what you want to do. It's gonna end up with me with a rope around my neck and me hanging. So, like, you ain't gonna be getting married? No, I am. I plan on doing that, actually, fish between the two of us. I'm waiting for a shootout to happen and just pull out the ring and ask her, Rebecca. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe if we have this armor does shoot out, I might pull out the ring. Doing this alone. Should we? Should we even be talking about it right now? She can't hear me around right? whispering. Right, right. Um. <laughs> I, 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 I understood. Mm. I hear you. Mm -hmm. I, you know, I don't know about the whole, uh, whole ball and chain thing, but, but you know, I'm. I mean, me personally, if if I ever got married or something like that, I, 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 I right. Or, Never mind, false alarm. I, 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 I think, I think I'd, I'd present like, Eddie. like a fish mouth with the ring in the mouth. Mm. Do you got, do, do you even got a case for that thing? You gotta like. No, gotta I got like, it in my pocket. That's it. You gotta like kneel though or something, like present in like a fancy like so, jewel box or uh, something. God near town. Yeah, yeah, I'll do for ticket. Them on rooftops. Oh, I'm just gonna count how many. Yeah, well, the floor, and there was an armored wagon dividing the street in half. What? Oh, God. Damn. Damn. We should taunt them, y'all. We should definitely taunt them. We should taunt them. We should absolutely taunt them. Come on now. Sure. Uh, identified so red and a and maple because of his dumbass hat. They had six there. on rooftops. Yeah, so and how many on, on below? I couldn't see how many below because of the wagon. It split off into the road. At least you're circling like sharks, honestly. I'm I'll... saying 12 at least. They're not going to leave the town, y'all. There's no way to leave the town. They have advantage. They're not going to leave the town. But we circle them like that and just taunt no, them. They'll 100% they'll leave eventually. No, well, not with 12. I mean, if they see us, they're just going to grab six and chase. Right, yeah, we, have, yeah. we have the distance and we can always fuck them up. I mean, so if we ever do the armadillo thing, we bring our own wagon. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, she got caught. Yeah, I heard about that. Speedy got caught. I'm just saying. We might get destroyed. They have a fucking shit. armored wagon. They have an armored wagon in the middle of armadillo. I'm telling you, we got to talk the shit out of them. They're pissed. What are they doing? They declare martial law or some shit? Well, the law is not like this. Well, here's the thing. If they've got 12 law and armadillo, like the rest of the cross is just going to burn. Exactly. Let's taunt them then. <laughs> Uh, so what you're saying is go around them and rub everybody else. Uh, uh, CD, CD, <laughs> yeah. define, define taunting real quick. Oh, I just want to ride, and, exactly. and, and I want to ride with six horses around Armadillo with uh, guns out. 
Just circle them okay, a little bit. Okay, well, what we do then if they start chasing us? We get in our right position, dismount, fuck them up. Okay, so you want to give them smoke. Okay, okay. Absolutely. I'm tired All of right, seeing right. the Law of West, y'all. I'm tired I'm of it. I'm game for that. He's trying to take them off the senses, motherfucker. I'm trying to humble them. Because every single time we tell them to fuck off, they come back with more. He's trying to stimulate and eliminate So we them. take, I, I don't we think take gonna, their hands. I don't think they're going to leave Armadillo. They don't? Then, hey, either way. It's, it's a win-win no matter what, right? They, yeah, that's they, why they, they, they probably so want the fight there. Yeah, I know they want the fight so bad. That's why they're not leaving. Then they're going to mm -hmm. mount up and come to, with their horses, right? They're going to just stay on Armadillo and expect us to just come through. But we're not. I think they're them. sending a message right now. We sent yeah. them out of the West, so they think they're sending a message by bringing the entire fucking law to Armadillo. Yeah, for sure. Dick swinging competition. Yeah. Uh, my concern about going and taunting them is we're trying to land this deal for Jabass, and I don't want to fuck that up by getting him in solitary earlier than... I mean, regardless the of the conversation trying to that he needs to have with someone. I get that, but I'm just saying. Um, we well, send the message as well, too, right? I mean, I think we did send a message, to be fair. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to respond with a bigger one, though. It doesn't always have to be an escalation upon an escalation. That's how they speak. Yeah, but that doesn't have to be how we speak. So they, they showed up with what? And you can't... And you didn't see how many? Six on rooftops. So I can only imagine that there's going to be and more. And did you see any below? That's a no, hard the way push. The, the telegram office. Well, yeah, yeah let's well. not push Armadillo at all. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm saying just from well, the distance. See, why, one of the reasons I wanted to do it like this is to see how they would respond. Yeah. To, to, for the Great future, because guys. I want to just hold down Armadillo. Now we bring an armored wagon. <laughs> Very intimidating. I mean, I'm gonna, we, I'm we gonna let be them honest. Part of me wants piece. when we hold down armadillo. Part of me wants to get three on one roofs, three on the other, and then when they show up, not pop out, and when they get up on roofs, take them hostage on the roofs. You know, you could just go to Tumbleweed, grab an armored wagon, and just use this portable cover. Bring your own armored wagon. You're gonna torn them. Ride around and just shoot the horses instantly. Portable cover, motherfucker. But the armored wagon, as soon, soon as it loses its horses, it stays in one place. That's the cover right there. Exactly. Yeah, in the future, if we do a whole lot of armadillo, I think we should do what they're doing. Is uh, cover, uh, block off all the main entrances to armadillo with armored wagons. That way and they have to roofs. go around. Or funnel in one direction. Have an oil tanker on, on the outskirts as well. <laughs> Any, See, because, any gaps? Because knowing how they, how they, uh, knowing how they're coming, and back and how they're going to treat it in the future if we kick somebody out is very good information to have. Yeah, I mean we, we ain't a fucking army or anything. We we can run from fights. It's smart to do that shit. Because because what they would do right is they'll think they're all big now that they kicked us out and they fucking. You know, they'll, they'll shit talk us, and then we'll come back down here in the next two days with like four or three of them, see, and then see, we'll and, and, them. And, and here's here's my point: the message I wanted to send is for them to stop feeling comfortable. If they have to bring an armored wagon and put six on rooftops to feel comfortable, I, I I'm sorted. Plus, we gain information. All right, yeah. so uh, what are y'all proposing doing now? Nothing. We have our information. All right. We know what to expect. We let them fucking sit there and think we're going to go there and <laughs> I, kill I, them. I don't know. I don't know. Are you going to sleep? Old? Uh, who's all staying awake, dude? I'm staying awake. I got to get some work done. So. Sure. We'll stay awake for a bit. Rebecca? Uh, I've promised myself to help CD with his work. Okay, Everett? I'll be around for... As long as you need me tonight. Old man? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, if you want to do work, we'll, we could do this. We could uh, we could start riding towards Armadillo and then go around them and then head to Thieves. But they're most likely going to pursue. Bro, bro. Hey, Uncle, you're the, the one that was one of the most, just recall. And we, we can even avoid Armadillo completely and just go south. We, go to, mm -hmm. we can go to the canyon. I'm saying if, we, if we're going to have a fight, we go to the canyon. Fuck thieves. I'm not fighting there again. <laughs> I agree. Anywhere but thieves land, I'm okay with it. I've had five fights the past two weeks in thieves. Yeah. How about how about uh, how about we do this then? Uh, I'll, I'll meet you in the middle. We'll go. We'll 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 stop at Armadillo basically. 
taunt them a little bit, and then we'll go up the uh, the train tracks, and then we'll go up to the canyon. Works for me. I should go back out east, grab uh, a lot of mash and stuff like that. And that's all. how far east are you gonna go? Honestly, this would be the perfect time to do shine runs. If yeah, that's yeah, what yeah, you want to do. You, you want to do? You, we have you, some you right now, to... right, fish? I tell I tell you what. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We could go to Tumbleweed. One of my horses, I, I believe, got got the mash. There's a there's a distillery not too far from here around Ratskellers. We can go make it over there, and then we can find somewhere to go run it. That way, we well, I would rather just keep it in mash on. than than bottles of shine. It's easier to carry that way. That way, when we get to the distillery, we can just turn it right there. So do y'all not have enough for a moonshine run? Yeah, we do. Piece? We do. No, we do. We do. So well, if, we, if we you want to do if you want to do work, how about instead of going by Armadillo and uh, fucking with them, uh, we head out. Go to thieves and then y'all do your run. Works for me. Yeah, let's do it. You you don't want to preemptively make the bottles of mash. It's gonna be heavy to carry, and just in case the law shows up, at least we got some space for our ammo, right? Uh, believe it or not, it's actually heavier to have the mash. Yeah, but I'm talking about space, right? You can, you okay. can stack the mash easier than okay. you can with the bottles. Okay. That's that's true. It's fair. All right. So is that what we're doing? Yep. Let's you, do it. You, since you want to do some shine anyway. Yep. Hi, uh, oh, just nothing important. Which direction are we gonna go out of west? Right, south is the safest one, but we can go through the train tracks. Yeah, go around. South of the train tracks. Train tracks will lead to the canyon, so if Law shows up, we can hold on the canyon too. Yeah, let's do tracks just in case. But let's try to do it in a way where we don't get detected. Do you think so many necessary fights when Josie and Forrest were, were wanted for a long time? Sure. That was that was more hot hide a reckless CD though, right? I think CD's not trying to take a fight with the law. I think he know he knows the law won't chase. He's just trying to taunt them because they they know they want to be um, you know. Is my horse gone? Oh no. My horse is gone. How did everybody's horses stay, but mine did not stay? Sometimes it's more powerful to send a message with just the actions you take without being direct about it, right? By be like being indirect. You love this moonshine runs? It's how we keep our money, man. How do you think I got a lot of money now? My horse is gone somewhere. Was that? My horse is gone. It ran off. Becca, can you call your horse? My horse is gone. Yeah, yeah, of course. Right. Um, CD. Yeah. Can you talk to June, please? Oh. Why? Uh, everybody's laying their head down. I know I can't ride with you guys, but if you need me to help make a uh, mash or whatever you need, I can assist. Yes. Uh, I need uh, wheat. Okay. And... I need, I need wheat, wheat, corn, or potatoes. All right, I can get wheat. Where should I meet you? Uh, I'll you send you a telegram. To go hold on to it. Get in a box or something, okay? Uh, okay. I'll have to go to thieves to get my money. We'll have that with you as well. Well, wheat you can pick it up. You don't need cash for that. All right, ready. June, I'll send you a telegram, okay? Or send me a telegram when you have it done. All right? Uh, how much wheat do you want? As much as you can gather, basically. So I should get a crate? Yes, you can. Right. Yeah. Crate full of corn is crap for bulb, but wait to see here. Where do you get corn? Uh -huh. Where do you get corn? Where's the where? Gray's place. No, not Braithwaite, Gray's place. It's okay. uh, by roads? Outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Outside of roads. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Cornfields there. Oh, let's go tumble and let me get my horse. Honestly, if you're gonna be riding with six horses, oh sorry, we're gonna be riding out. Just in case the law is looking for us, we should have six horses, in my opinion. Yep, old man, grab your horse for a tumbleweed. Okay. You sure you don't want to make the mash preemptively? Because as soon as we get to things, we can just start the run right there. No cooking we process. Yeah, I, I can help you with half of it anyways, so we can do a double. Oh, 
Okay, okay. Just making sure. I just want you carrying like 50 bottles of shine on you. That's all of these. Oh, that's fine. There's a lot of rocks. Miss you buying gems and stuff like that. That was a good time. I mean, we don't have a chance to, man. It's been, it's been, it's been busy tonight, Chad. Tonight's been busy, huh? Hey, I'm in it. Thank you. Or see. and then it's like fucking mole rats they all peaked up just their heads started popping up <laughs> all right uh becca can you take us like the back way to the tracks to go to armadillo I don't uh know. yeah yeah I can do that. or like a safer route than just straight there because that's where i go yeah no crashing so far huh man no crashing so far thank god i've been alt tab though my team speak has not crashed too. Give me a second. Goosey, I haven't tried what you said. I just updated a driver again and then no crashing has happened, so. Mm. Left will take us up on the canyon side of it by the train tracks up there. Mm-hmm. Alright, let's go. I don't I don't always want to have a fight on these rocks here. <laughs> Listen, stick together as a group, okay? Uh huh. Right. Stick together as a group, have each other's back. Uh, if your horse is uh, falling behind, let us know. Just, just talk to each other. That's all it is. Are we riding formation right now? Oh my god. Uh, I'm not gonna push the And thank you for the rain, the host. I appreciate it. Don't you play Mr. Lancaster? Welcome, I appreciate the raid the host, man. It's not my main channel, it's my old channel, but I really appreciate the raid the host. Honestly, I stream this for uh, chat. This is what I usually do when I'm not streaming, basically. That's what my old channel is. It's what I'm doing when I'm not streaming, but instead I'm streaming for chat. Welcome, Raiders, welcome, thank you. Yeah, I'm working with Choco. I'll get you guys some unique Dope Master emotes. Okay, don't worry. You get new Dope Master emotes for subbing to this channel. Don't worry, I'm talking to her. Okay, give me some time. We'll get some cooked up. <laughs> also, I'll add all the CD emotes to the Dope Master so y'all can use those. So, brother, you're 70 Lancaster, man. Thank you. I, lo I love your roleplay and I love your character so much, man. Thank you for the host on the raid. Hope you're an amazing stream. I love the way you play um, Lionel Lancaster, man. It's so good. Left, fish, go left, 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 left. So many damn pricks everywhere. Hey man, I'm just telling you the truth. See anything in armadillo? No. I see somebody on top of a rooftop. A <laughs> sheriff's office. What was that? I barely see what looks like a person on top of the sheriff's office. Get close a little bit and you can see it. I don't know. I don't see it anymore now. 
Two saloon, three on the right, one sheriff's office. I don't see any on the saloon. Yeah, you get closer. I saw for a second, but now I barely can see anymore. That's why they're holding the back. I saw right there, chat, like right here. A little for a second. closer just to see. Sure. They ain't gonna chase us. Where did Wrecker go? Oh, she's down on that hill. I mean, if they chase, we take the train tracks, and then it's, a, it's, a, it's an easy ambush spot for us, honestly. We get up on top of those rocks up there, we should get a good view of our dead line. Yep, take us there. And yeah, if they chase, we, we retreat to the train tracks, and then we unload on them. As they're coming into that tunnel. Or before, if we have to. Yeah, I agree. Let's dismount. I see one horse at the sheriff's office. Don't know if I see anybody though. I might have fucked up on back to Blackwater. It's a possibility. Yeah, I feel like they've already left. All they're looking for us. Those are the only two things you can think of, right? I'll try on flank. Okay. Yeah, don't don't be don't be blindsided. Look everywhere, not just. Uh... I see a horse outside the sheriff's office, black yep. and white. They think they rode out no, after us because they saw me. No, repeat, no. repeat. I got a single horse at the sheriff's office. Yeah, we said that yeah, yeah I said that already. I, I didn't even <laughs> There's nobody on rooftops. I wonder if they rode out. I think they, they rode out. Yeah. They, I didn't, they didn't sit there. Well, if there's one by himself in Armadillo, that's very brave, no? I say we... Okay. It, this is ballsy of me, but I say we ride into there and, and, and rob the one alone. Absolutely. <laughs> Let's go, Uncle. I'm with you. I, I know it's ballsy, but you, Ev, you said they're not on the roofs? Where they were? Nobody on the rooftop so far. Alright, fuck it. Everybody down for that? Absolutely. Yeah. What are we doing? They, so, they, they're not on the roofs anymore? We think they, they rode out when they saw Ev. There's no horses. There's, there's just one horse run up off the solo deck. Uh, Could be a bank code, so... Yeah. Yo, I mean, we can, we, we can approach this bit closer, like I said. I, I say we, we, move, we go in. We go in on horse. We, we stay tight-knit. What over well, right through. Absolutely. But one person should lead so we can follow a person out. So who wants to lead us in? If you guys want, I can run to town and come back. Can I, uh, what's, what's the point of riding in? Can I just find out, please? To rob the deputy who's alone in town? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. You want me to go in screaming just, Help me, help me, help me, I'm being chased. No, I just want to go in. I want to see if there's actually only one in there and then we'll, we'll rob him and then we'll fuck off. We can also, um, what, see what's, better. What's our plan if, if they are there? Uh, what do you want to do? If there's more than one? If yes. there's like a bunch of them, so yeah. there, retreat to the canyon. Yeah. All right, canyon. By, by the All right. Uh, somebody take, somebody take point and just ride in. If not, I'll do it. I, I can do it. I can do it. Follow me. All right. All right. As, uh, the longer we stay up here, the longer, if, if they did ride out, the longer, uh, the quicker they're back. Jump the rocks. Go around. Left. For Winsmore, have him catch up a little bit. Yep. Say that again, nephew. Just waiting for Winsmore to catch up. I, I can't hear you. You gotta speak up. I said I'm waiting for Winsmore to kind of catch up a little bit. He, he's here. I'm gonna go far left a little bit. Far left before we go far right. Yeah. How will we have separation if anything happens? Keep your eyes peeled. I had nobody on the rooftop of this room. I don't see anybody so far. We're good. <laughs> howdy, howdy, howdy. There's somebody inside. I don't know. I just 
this guy here. Yeah, man. Now it's gonna be Deputy Rivers. That was the good ones that just meet fate. How do anybody inside? Poor Rivers, man. She's by herself. There's a horse. Oh, it's a. Chow, 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 move that horse out the way. They, uh, they brought a bunch of uh, long out to Armadillo. Mm -hmm. this, is, this is us. <laughs> I guess they all fucking rode out. It's unfortunate for you. It left you behind like that, River is damn. They don't dirty. Look, I was just coming to send a telegram and I was headed home. Where's home? Like Don Julio. Alright, how about, how about this? Uh, you, who are you sending your telegram to? I'm assuming law. No, I was sending it to my fiance, letting her know. Oh, okay, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what. You mm -hmm. go to Lake Don Julio. All right. You, you, you're, you're good to go to Lake Don Julio, all right? Okay. It ain't nothing personal. Law wanted to bring out a bunch of fucking lawmen and armored wagon armadillo. You're just unfortunately the unlucky one that rode in as we did. Yeah, you got, got caught in the crossfire, Rivers, that's but fine. that's how it is. Mask one favor, Jadis. Go ahead. May I have my uh, the skill field back? I won't use it. It's from my fiance. Uh, because it's... I like you, Rivers. Yeah. I appreciate it. If it was it. Will or somebody else, oh. probably no. Appreciate it. No problem. Yeah, I'll stay safe. Stay safe. Yeah, I'll say the same to you. Bye, Rivers. Have a good night. Why is she coming out here, though? Forest place? He's at the other end. Forest, I, I don't know it. He's going for it right now. He's probably watching the other end in case they can. Over in the western side, that's why we're over there. So right. Law must have either went back to Blackwater or they're out more west looking for us, right? I think Let's they're out further west. Let's just hope that, hope we that just, nothing happens to James. Yeah, we kicked the hornet's nest. <laughs> let's, let's go. I mean, we've warned Uncle James about the law here, so. Oh, I did. He knows. Can we go to train tracks? Uh, or canyon? Yeah, train tracks. Alright, left, 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 left. Follow me, follow me. Left. Yeah, let's go. I'll lead the way. Get off the rocks. <laughs> Off-roading here is the worst thing possible. What happened to her? She just came here to send a telegram, apparently, to her fiancé and going back to uh, her home or house in Don Julio. You guys are... You actually rob her or just... Yeah, my uncle did. Only for uh, Lancaster, not her uh, Scofield, though. Even if she, 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 she got her one. I like Rivers, though. I like Rivers. She's one of the good ones. Sadly, she's very amicable. Yeah, I'm the same boat as well. She aggravates me because she's so kind. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Are y'all doing a shine run? Yeah, thieves. Uh, do, do you want? Do y'all want me to be a six? Because Probably we should stick together. I mean, you can just you can just ride with us. You don't have to do the shine run. Well, that, what I'm saying is, I don't. It's never my first choice, but I feel like we should probably stick together. Yeah, exactly. No, for sure. Like we should stick together. Yeah. So. What'd you say? We're going to Cattail. Cattail Thieves to Cattail. Thieves to Cattail, but yeah. Perfect. Oh, uh, a few nights ago, I'm not sure if uh, Fish or Winsmore or ever told you, ran to a fellow named Ronnie. Oh, uh, yeah. Confirmed. Yeah. 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 yeah, apparently they sell a lot of cheap guns. Also, uh, does anybody need it? Well, I've got a Lancaster now, a law Lancaster, and I've got three pairs of cuffs. Oh, I want God. cuffs. You should probably get the Lancaster or Winsmore. I got three cuffs on my horse. Stop right here. Stop right here real quick, fish. Yeah. You want a pair of cuffs? Yeah, I want a pair of cuffs. I lost my last one for a long. Huh? Do you want me to give you this and I'll take the law gun? Sure, sure. Take that. Perfect. Uh, we'll do Dev, you want to hold these cuffs for me on your horse? Because I'll keep the other two, but I don't have a one on my horse. <laughs> yeah, I'll get you. We got a disposable gun, no point in using it. 
There you go. Thank you, thank you. Hey, I'll take the, uh, the law gun. I just hope that, uh, who's left with... Wait, thank you. June James. June went to go get some mash. I don't think she's, yeah. um, James Skelly them. They went to bed, Skelly. so they should be fine. Okay, good. Yeah. Alright, let's, uh, let's move on to, uh, Thieves. Yeah. Also, I like to check telegrams at Riggs. Actually, no, after the, the, the... the after the Shine After the Shine one, yeah, yeah. You can just check it out well, it's after the Shine one. Exactly. Alright, come on. Pick it up. Let's pick it up a little bit. Slow down. Who is that? Yeah. No. Maybe they drove the armored wagon to Thieves. <laughs> I mean, everything was gone from the sound of it. Alfred described the fortress. When we got in there, it was nothing. No patience, man. I'm just confused why you hold down. I mean, they'll probably want to find this. That's probably why. Maybe when they saw Everett, they thought there were somewhere more deep out west. Well, I can only guess that they got tired of waiting and wanted to try to find us. That's what I'm saying. They had no patience, man. Blood for the blood god. <laughs> I mean, his wife ran all that forest down and then not use it and leave it for 20, 30 minutes. Well, because it ain't coming out of their damn paycheck. No, Uncle Sam's funding them. How, how often do shine runs get bloody? Never. Um, I've never had law. You know if I'm here, it's gonna get bloody. So you want me to take risky routes? Um, no, I'm just giving you the heads up that if they see Jabaz and Maul start pursuing, it's getting bloody quick. Well, I guess let me ask you then, you want me to take a safer route or risky? I don't give a shit. Do, do whatever, but I'm just, I'm telling take you. Take a I'm right, take a right, take a right. Fish, you need some help? <laughs> I don't know, I Stay mounted, stay mounted, everybody stay mounted. Me and Fish will take care of it, okay? Fish, I can I can make four bottles. That's it. Does that work for you? I, I should be able to hold all of it. Just take the take the mash real quick. Yeah, I, yeah, I can make four for you while you're making. Oh. Or actually, yeah, just take that one. All right, perfect. I'll go I'll head over there in a sec. I'll go make this right now. A factory pumping key? Oh, doodles. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And now, I, I cannot wait for Harry Potter game to come out, chat. How many of you guys are going to play the new Harry Potter game when it comes out?
Listen, it might have a lot of hype, but always keep the CHI burners ready. Hell yeah. You know what the CHI stands for? No, but I believe copper you. Tin, copper tin heating apparatus. That's what we call this distillery right here. They, CHI, this is my baby right here. Oh, I just let the local distillery do its own thing. Oh, hell no, nah, man. I, I get down to nitty gritty with it with my own two high ends, man. I put the clay on the top of the copper tin, lowing off all the steam, mix it around a mash, squish the squash. You know what I mean? Well, I'm with you. I'm definitely with you. Mm -hmm. Some crazy shit, right? Moonshine, right. labor of love. It sure is. Honestly, if it wasn't the shine activity, I would have lost a lot of money. It's the reason why we got a lot of cash flow coming out of thieves. Mm hmm. Hold on. Uh, fish? You soon? Uh, just about done. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You want me to run the cart, or...? Yeah, probably. I didn't carry all of them. I have a slight problem here. What's that? Can I kick this? Uh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Uh, I don't want to burn this. Uh, Alright, what you need? Choco! Here, uh, I'm gonna, oh, let me finish it real quick. Okay. Get that ammo on the ground. Choco! La, 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 la. How are you? Got room for all that, right? Yeah. Hell yeah. Let's, get Let's it. go. Let's go, fish! Woo! Got that Wagin. Is our. Why, my right, Move out the way, move out the way. Wagon coming through, move out the way. Windmore's using the bathroom. Oh, hold on, hold on, fish, 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 hold on. Oh no, he started. Shit. Somebody have a lasso to tie him up? It's fine, we can wait a minute too, it's fine. It's not like we gotta rush. Okay. How long, when did he go to get to the pace? How long has it been? Ah, uh, about a minute. We'll be fine, we'll be fine. Just means we'll take the risky route. It means we have to go a little bit faster. I don't have a yeah. lasso, though. I have handcuffs. Can I throw them on here? No, I can't. No. Hey, he's good. He's back. He's back. He's good. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. go. All right, everybody. Everybody, go and Follow fish. One's more lagging behind, so just wait a little bit. Just, just a tiny bit. Do we full, full push the horse? We'll push them sometimes, and sometimes we'll rest because uh, we need them at full speed for the law. Yeah. When we go across the canyon here, or not the canyon, the flames, I'd say we push straight through so we can go go immediately right through the burnt down uh, village. Alright. We'll push up there so we get off the flames. Yeah, I'm doing a fantastic man. Oh, what up, Crooked? Holy shit, I just saw that wagon fly. Oh, this is honestly a rare, rare occasion. Outlaw justice! Why riding through the Great Plains in, in near Blackwater is such a, like a Wild West theme for me.
So far, so good, no law. Shove the bridge. me if you can absolutely why why does Winsmore always lag behind man I swear to god that turkey is shit I should have bought a fox shutter. <laughs> Ramp, are you all right? Yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right. It does, it does. I'm also lost to catch up at the start. So. I'm right there. How was your relaxation day yesterday? It was really good. Stick those more often, honestly. Come back rejuvenated, ready, you fresh, should. new outlook. I would think it's gonna get boring too quick. Yeah, I normally relax at least twice a week. I know it's good. I'm gonna try doing that more often, actually. But I'm working honestly, out very often. Should. I'm around every single day at Thieves, helping out. I can't help it, man. I just love working yeah, at Thieves. I mean, even if it's just a nice day of just sitting in fees all day, not really. I mean, it. that's what I did today. I had three hours just conversation. I don't think yeah. I've done anything till this shine one. It's been four hours. Yeah, They're the best type of day. Jesus, that was so hard. Yeah. Well, that was great. That was probably the quickest one I think uh, we've ever done. Absolutely. I like to wait. Pick a horse. Which one you want? Yeah, I'll go with you. All right. Go back to Wallace? Yep. I drank a lot of coffee today, and my eye is like twitching by itself. Oh god, my eye is twitching, chat. Too much caffeine. Not yet, not yet, freaks. I, I, we don't, we didn't get the rundown.
Thank God, no telegrams from me. I'm happy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna piss real quick in the house nearby here, right? Yeah, I've had a response from John. Let's see. He says, I don't want a war. Job, back. I've lost enough from this. $250 will be brought to June soon. I hope you know that she's safer without me. I think you know that. I did what I did to keep her safe. But for all I did, I'm sorry for how I hurt her. Yeah, I highly doubt you did it to keep her safe, you bastard. What was that? Muppet King. <laughs> yeah. I wouldn't call him a king, though. He's more like a jester. Mm. Jester. Even over Muppets. I missed it. What did you say about John? Rebecca? Don't know why, don't know why, don't know why. I managed to get the bandana on. How'd you pull that out? Holy Ooh. fuck, what are you Yeah, it looked wearing? great. You look great. I'm wearing my, my very special occasion scale mail armor that I keep padded underneath oh, this scale coat. Mail. You scale can't wear mail? a belt with that outfit. <laughs> I need you to. Can't. It's, it's got my hair mo. You gotta get rid of the gum belt. <laughs> but it's got yeah, my it's, it's got my hand. Just, get, just yeah. take it off. You're right, the gum belt sucks. Take off yeah. the gun. Oh, that is so much better. There we go. Oh my that God. was ten percent better. Look, it, it, <laughs> you, you'd be at a tactical disadvantage, but you look better. Yep. And that's all that matters at the end of the day. Exactly. Darn cool. I right, sorry, so did you want to hear what you said? Yeah, can you repeat one more time? Sorry, I didn't hear it. Yeah, let me read it to you. Um, he said, understood. I don't want a war. I've lost <laughs> enough from this. $250 will be brought to June soon. I hope you know that she's safer without me. I think you know that. I did what oh, I did shit. to keep her safe, but for all I did, I'm sorry for how I hurt her. He attacked someone that we told him, as long as you don't fucking touch them, it's not going to be a problem and June won't be in trouble. And they decided to still attack that guy. Good riddance, honestly. I better Muffet. off this way. The promise is So himself. he definitely didn't do what he did to keep her safe. Mm-hmm. Where's also, Everett? How, you, how do you, uh, how do you want to divvy out this money? He's getting changed. Just split it. No, I don't need money. I'll take I'm money. I'm good, I got, I got Lancaster out of it. Okay, then I'll take money if, if old man's giving, taking the, the Lancaster's payment. Yep. Okay, if that's oh. the case, then, uh, you have all the money five of us, out of the five of us, everybody gets 60. I'm just gonna put any any money that give, give me uh, sixty dollars. I'm just gonna put it towards group stuff. That's what I do. I buy um mash or gems with it. Yeah, yeah I don't need any money. Just keep it. Okay, I'm just giving out. Wait, Wait just put put it to put it in a pot, and whatever we make, we'll buy guns from the firm. Mm -hmm. Ain't a bad idea. Yeah. Here you go. Here you go. F. Hundred bucks for a navy is pretty good. They said they're short on that though. They're short on navies right. and Lancasters. Got a supply on that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, but if we give it a few days, they, they might be up again. I had meant to get in contact with uh, Hathaway because I still need to get rid of these fucking bombs. He was in Guarma for the death match. He yeah. he sent me he sent me a telegram today. Yeah, he... so then I need I need to move bonds too. <laughs> I'm sitting oh. on way too many. I've got like sick sixty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then I, and then Aurora's holding like twenty for me. <laughs> what? 
when we uh, when we saw Hathaway on Quamo, it was hilarious. She's like, "You guys know blue coats on the island? Fuck that guy! Can you <laughs> Dude, kill Hathaway, that guy?" Hathaway, the Bond guy, was making me laugh my ass off, man. He, like, you saw blue coat and you didn't shoot him? Shame. And I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> the Bond guys, man? Like, are we ready to move? Guy. Yeah, we can move. Where 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 do we want to go? Um, I think June wanted to meet. Canyon? Canyon or Thieves? Tell Canyon. I think June's just a little lonely and need people right, around her, I think. Telegram her to go to Thieves. Uh, let's... Let's go through Big Valley and let's rob the mines on the way through and then we'll go to Thieves. Okay. Alright. Once we get to Thieves, we, we need to clear every single rooftop, everything, just in case Weller and the Muppets are there fucking... <laughs> waiting. Weller, Could Duncan you... and the Muppet Brigade? Yeah, Duncan and the Muppet Parade, yeah. Could you imagine we rough at these in that armored wagon and just sitting <laughs> blocking off an entrance? I oh, did it last time. He blocked off the bridge. Don't worry, don't worry. I've 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 been I've been through training. Japussy is ready to cut off those fucking those horse reins. Alright, let's move. Where? All right. Uh you don't have a horse, do you, Force? Uh no. You here, take here. my horse and I'm sitting on the back. Okay. Call him. Don't call him. Here he is. Asgard! Rebecca, if you want to ride with me, I'll worship you as well. It's up to you. Yeah, could I? Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't want to be clingy. I love the word Muppet. I'm obsessed with it now. You and James Kelly. <laughs> Dodge door, right? Keep going or you can look. That's a good Sound like a bull action. Do you remember that Muppet we brought last time in here, CD? And he was Who is really he? angry. I'm not sure. It could be a hunter. There's a lot of bears around here. Who's this? How you doing? Mills? Mine around today. Uh, Richie uh, was in Thieves, but he left. Uh, it was way earlier in the day. I, uh, I, besides Richie, not really. Uh, I know James was around with, with a few people out by Fort Mercer. I'm giving you a heads up. If you're going out west, we kind of kicked the fucking beehives today. Uh, there was four of them out west. We told not them to fuck out the they tried to the sit tribe there is and puff their chest out and say, on. you know what happens to people that kick us out of the West? And I said, ask fucking Weaver. Because I'm sure he fucking remembers. And uh, they came back with like a bunch of uh, law and had an armored wagon in Armadillo. And then they, I guess they fucked off. So we robbed the, the, the people in Armadillo that they left behind. The uh, the lawmen. There's only one of them at that point. So they, they're, they're going to be pissed. For a fight. Yeah, they're going to be pissed and looking for a fight. Careful, Mills. Yeah, I'll keep my head down. We're we're heading to Thieves if you want to meet us there. If you want to talk at all, but uh, we're probably gonna rob uh, a few, uh, some of the mines on the way because we need a few guns. All right, sounds good. I'll see y'all down there then. All right, see you in Thieves. See you. Uh, the YPD stuff, um, honestly, I can see that happening. How are you today? Future. I'm alright. It has been just kind of me just enjoying myself. Yeah. Uh, eventful day. A lot of talking. Yeah, it's been a good day. Finding out about John, I can't say I'm surprised. Somebody right there. Who is that? Anyway. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Who's it? Deputy Danny. 
Oh. Well, well, well. How are you? Uh, part. I'm good. Just woke up, doing a bit of hunting. Seems I'm not the only one. A bit of hunting. Yeah, honking. I think we're hunting different things, though. Mm. Are we? Sure are. Uh, you know, they were long out west today. And, uh, we pushed them out of the west. You know what they like to? Uh, you? you? know what they like to do to me? They they they, they threw their chest out and we're talking about uh, what happens to people that kick people out of the West. Do you remember do what you happens know. to people that get kicked out of the West? Well, can I talk first? I'm just asking. You're asking me a question. Do I get a chance to answer? I wasn't finished. Okay. Go ahead. I am a new Austin deputy. Mm. I spend a lot of time down there. I have before I was a deputy, and I will keep doing another one. Doing. I go down there and I bring them water to Armadillo. I make sure the people at Armadillo have food. I'm working on trying to get the stable opened up again. What are you doing for them other than driving away safe places for them? I don't even fuck with any of the civilians. It's the lawmen that are sitting out there, four or five of them, just sitting out there all comfortable, Ooh, trying to grab people out there from alone. Months. There's yeah, people that like to be seen long, as individuals. You don't like seeing others as individuals either, do you? Y'all don't like seeing us as individuals. Never have. We're all criminals. Deny the law. So you know me. You've dealt with me before then, have you fellas? I, I know. I have not. Pretty sure I remember. Yeah, you're ready you to brandish me with what? Your, your sure, beliefs uh, that you think that I'm just a horrible person and here to wreck your day? No, I'm pretty sure uh, you were. You were there the day they caught me for the, uh, for the, uh, Mercer shootout. If I remember correctly. It was. I transported you. Yeah, you were part of the transport. Do you know who I am? Danny. Uh, I believe you were close to Weaver, correct? What happened to that fellow again? Partner. He's your partner. He's your lover. You killed him. I did kill him. I mean, Uncle, we can finish it right now. We can kill her too. Well, you could ask her nicely. Would you like to see your partner again? I'll see him when my time comes. Yeah, that's true. You can Everybody face your maker now. What kind of horse is this? You're right. This on. is my horse. Yeah, it is. I know, but I'm asking, what is it? Looks like a Mustang. Looks like a Mustang. I like the way the uh, coat. Looks in the uh, in the ring. Boy shines. Looks pretty. What are you hunting specifically? I was trying to get an elk. Why an elk? They're good eating. Their hide can be used for bedding. Is that a uh, that a Schofield on your hip? I can't tell. Ooh, a Schofield. I can't tell. Is it a Schofield? I couldn't tell. <laughs> It's you're on, the, you're on my bad field. side. Can't tell if it's a navy or a scope. It's a navy. Even better. Tell you what. Hand over the navy. Nobody will rob you for any cash or anything like that. Alright. I guess maybe I'm taking down. pity on you. You're taking pity on me. Yeah, for killing your partner and whatnot. Uncle was very gracious. <laughs> Sorry. Thank you. Did you uh hand it to Everett? Too. Yeah, out here often. Or are you mainly in New Austin? I go where I'm needed. Fair. Do you have cigarettes? I don't smoke. You don't smoke on the the job. I don't smoke in general. <laughs> I um tend to get shot more. <laughs> I don't need to be giving myself any more troubles, do I? What do you mean? Smoking is good for you. <laughs> I hate the way it smells. Yeah, I like the smell. 
Here's your dollars. It's 200 days, bro. Mm. Well, you've come a long way, fish. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I have. They I swam up the water. You. Training you as a ranger. <laughs> You're a shark now, not fish. You're a ranger. I didn't know that. Yeah. yeah. Not, not forest. I knew I had high was. hopes for him. How long were you a ranger for, Danny? <sighs> Almost eight months. Why the change in art? I wanted to help more. Were you partners with him back then? Or no? With Weaver? Yeah. Yeah. I was, was with that Weaver part of before. It? I was a ranger. I see. Was that oh. part of it? Going over the law? To be with your partner? He wasn't law when I became law. He see. wasn't even in the cross and... How do you feel about Mount Hagen? Does it mean a lot to you? Because I spotted something up there. Yeah, so have I. It's actually funny. There was a time I was up there alone for a few days. Wait, 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 wait. Let and me I guess. Y'all found in, snow. Reeled in. There was, a, there was a day that I was up there alone for a few days. And, uh, mm. I stumbled upon that grave. Mmm. Did you piss on it? No, I don't desecrate corpses and grave sites at least. That's too bad. I would have. It's a simple question. That yeah, means a lot to me. <laughs> what do you I think do I'm feeling? No, I was just curious how what it meant to you. So, like a special place for the two of you? Please. Would you like to be buried up there too? It's just a question. We're not saying we're gonna bury you. You still talk with him? You still hear his voice? Do you remember it? Every day? Yeah. What's the words you hear? I hear dead people too sometimes. What? Fish? I hear different things. The main one is I love you. That's fair. You weren't at Fort Mercer that day though, were you? No. You ever regret it? Not being there? Me too. You were a bunch of assholes. You feel like you would have made a difference? Jesus Christ. No. I wanted to be there with him. My God, yeah. I replaced Danny. Shout out to her. It makes She's still you feel any better. I'm sure he didn't want you there. But if deputies in New Austin want to try to puff their chests out at me about what happens to people that kick people out of New Austin. I just feel like they're, if anything, just bringing up the fact that I killed Weaver. Don't really work on me, but I'm sure he's glad that you didn't die with him that day. I understand feelings of regret and not dying with somebody you love. But maybe the next time you hear his voice, you, uh, Remember, he probably didn't want you there to die with him. But also, the next time you hear his voice, try to remind your deputies not to make little threats about trying to bring out a bunch of law and a Gatling gun out west again. Maybe they'll take it better coming from you. You'll never own the west. I know. We're not trying to. But, but guess what? Want... You're not gonna own the West either. Yeah. No, I also just don't want... West. Fucking... Good. People just be getting comfortable. I don't like things being comfortable. Especially for law. Either way. 
I ain't gonna hold a gun to your head anymore. I'm gonna rob you while you're out here anymore. Got the Navy. <laughs> Let me ask one thing now. Oh, no, no, hold Do up, you hold feel up. comfortable right now? Do you feel comfortable right now? Because you seem quite comfortable right now. I do, but my question was if you feel comfortable. No. I'm surrounded by evil men and women that are making fun of my pain. <laughs> I sympathize with your pain. Yeah, everyone's got yeah, pain. Uh, I, for starters, I'm not making fun of your pain. Quite I frankly, am. I'm trying to give you advice. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? Don't help? No, my advice is... That maybe when you think about having that regret about not being by his side, that maybe he didn't want you to die with him. Which is genuine advice, not making fun of you. If you want me to make fun of you, I can make fun of you. If you want me to be vicious towards you, I can be vicious towards you. Is that what you would like, Danny? I know you, I know you can. I know. So why the fuck did you scoff, by the way? Before Rebecca... I wasn't scoffing oh. at you. Hmm. Was I? Oh, my apologies. Let me try and say something better. The battle of getting better is never ending for you. You happy now? <laughs> what do you want? I was, I was trying to say that I wasn't going to do anything to you. You're free to go. I, I got the Navy. Bye, Danny. You stay safe. Happy hunting. Are you still dying? Chin up, buttercup. All right. Fine. Um, should we go somewhere else? She's gonna run until the lawn strawberry. Uh, she's running straight to strawberry, yeah. What do you want to go here? Uh, let's, let's check the big valley mine and then let's go uh, up to the snow. You don't want to check Telegram since I told um, June we're going to Thieves. We can stop by Red and then pull back. Yeah, we should head to Ridge. I think we're going to go out more north, right? Yes or no? What was that? I mean, that works just fine by me, but we need to make sure we let people know we're going thieves, right? That's what I'm saying. So how about Everett, you go send a telegram to June and uh, Mills and a couple others that have gone to the snow, because I think Mills said he was going to go to thieves, and then the rest of us will rob in Big Valley and meet us on Mount Hague. Uh, if we're going to the snow, I really want to get changed, though. Yeah, they need yeah, change. It's called a scimitar, Kempa. Oh, he wants a scimitar. It's different. Well, that's not a thing. I want a dead lawman. That's what I want. Yeah, there's plenty of those. A little bit. Imagine how cold are Or a saber, that'd be cool. Is a dead lawman somewhere still warm, some close? Yeah, probably, Goosey. Probably. Oh, rickety bridge. Oh, rickety I bridge. I'm listening to myself. One is going to fall apart. I will. It's gonna happen. One day. Damn right. Most likely nobody there's, down there. I mean, there's, there's a fella up in that corner with his horse smiling. Where? Uh, Ow. Will you sell somebody? No. No, just previous experience. Oh, I see.
Say I don't blame CD you with rabbit trying to kill him every chance he gets. Yeah, I mean, it's mutual, right? Oh, fuck this bridge. I love this cave. It is a cool cave. I use pretty often, I must say. What is that? So it's not used pretty often. I've seen more people out west mine than out east. This yeah, is where I robbed everybody in the <laughs> mines. This is where I robbed Max Brady. <laughs> After we left fucking you guys. God, I saw Valentine's crazy. Oh, there's a bear. Grizzly! Bear! Just mount, just mount, just mount, just mount. Get up, get up. Bear is dead. Come on, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, close. Got a wolf out. I have one already. <laughs> it's my alpha plus no. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on mine. Shot. I'm gonna have to do it. I'm good. Nah. Shot. Are you ready for it? If we're gonna go camp out in the snow, I have to, man. I have to, okay? If we're not moving around, I gotta send a tip in. I have to. Come on now. I have to. We're so wanted, man. I'm almost at 800 days on CD right now, at least. We're so wanted. I gotta give it low some crumbs. Also, who the fuck introduces I am. as deputy when they're off duty? I'm not looking at 600 days right now. Wait, we robbed deputies right back to back. That's 400 days by itself out there. Four hey, OOC days. Where is that bridge? I didn't tell oh, you it was not. That made us a Wallace. Yeah. T100% thinks we're going out west. So. Yeah, but eventually we're gonna get caught, man. And we're, nobody lasts on the run forever. Eventually, all the laws are gonna get lucky one time. That's it. One time. It's over. Telegram to law is so fucking weird. Brother, it's not. No, it's not. Not, not if you're going to, um, you know. Not if you're going to telegram stations where, like, those locals outside could have saw us. Uh, what is this? We're going into the snow, correct? We got a problem. <laughs> Uncle. What? I got a telegram that James Kelly and Scarlet got caught. They've been transported by law. They must have caught him out west. What do you want to do? 
Enough we can do. He's not a part of our outfit. Doesn't matter. I mean, I've broken out people that aren't part of our outfit before, right? <laughs> He's looking at a heavy time. He's been gone for months and months and months. Mm. We got six right now. We can stop it. Is there Jeez. still time, though? I don't know. How, what have to, what have to go to? Um, was the, where was the telegram sent from? Yeah, who sent it and where is it from? Cisco. Oh, wait, I just got a telegram from June. They're going to send it to me right now. This is sent from just now. So. Okay, I've got it. So, okay. We gotta hurry up when we do this right now. Um, do we want to do it? I say okay. yes. Can we break out, James? Uh, yeah, why not? What do you all? What are you? Why is everyone pondering? What the fuck? It, he's looking at months. They're worried about like if they can. No, but like he's. Does I mean? Does it matter when it comes I mean, to the laws? Just, we could just hit the transport and take their guns. Yeah. Not our group. I have. I don't know what that means, honestly. I say somebody's wanting for a long time, or close with them. I don't see an issue. Hey, is everyone feeling okay? The Catching fact that we have to sit here and break just out like... charges for James. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I'll do it. Question, you know, all hands down, I'll do it. But I, I think mean, let's uh, try to send any of them, but we gotta do it now. I gotta, I gotta quick. We, we gotta have a fucking actual plan. Uh, they're yeah. not gonna value a fucking hostage. Is no. having a hostage? They already had to send any according to June we, from we, Blackwater. It's our roads. Oh, fuck. Do we want to ride right into Saint Denis and hit them, or do we want? So they're probably in Saint Denis. This came from roads. So they just saw them I've going. Got a, okay, I've got a crazy fucking idea. It's absolutely crazy. Y'all can tell me I'm fucking insane. We go. North to Saint Denis to the boat dock. We grab two boats and we meet them on the open waters. I'm all for it. A waterfall, hey, though. Buddy. It's. I might think he's up. They get too close to Cisco. We'll how, how easy is it to sink a boat? I don't know. I mean, I mean, look, we're, we're fighting against limited time here. We could either ride straight into Saint Denis or we could ride up north, grab boats, and try to hit the boat. I say we ride right now, then come up with a plan, a spot. As all we right, see let's do it. Because uh, we don't know what they're doing. We might have missed the transport by now, right? So it's not playing something unless we know for a fact what's going on. I, I don't understand. I, I get people are saying the rule of 10, the rule of 10, the rule of 10. But this is law conflict of somebody who's, who's going to get locked up for 12 to 15 OOC days, right? Like, it feels weird not be able to help out one of my fellow outlaws when they're, when they're looking at heavy time. Does everybody feel comfortable doing it? I mean, like I said, it's one of the, our fellow friends, it's an uncle of mine, he's looking at months. I'm all for breaking them out, right? We're talking about the law here, y'all, right? Everest common enemy. True. But here, here okay, I, I don't care about the sales pitch. I'm saying, does everybody feel comfortable? I do. Okay, I know you do, motherfucker. Everybody else. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I'm interested in getting... Paid. I mean, I mean, James will definitely pay us. There's no question on that. We're burning time. Let's at least talk about it on the road. The, Rebecca ahead. and Forrest, do you do you both of you feel comfortable about it? CD says, yeah. I say, yeah. I mean, I want to help out James, but like, let's let's move while we talk about this as well. Yeah. Right. Let's at least move uh, towards Saint Denis. Oh my God, dude. <sighs> God damn it. God damn hey, it. Hey, old man, what, what, you, what do you mean? I'm just with whatever Rebecca is saying, I'm on the same page, so. Yeah, and Forrest is also on that same page. Mm hmm. Uh, we're gonna have to haul ass if we want any chance of doing this. Like, we need to full oh, push. Then, then, let, let me lead. Oh, you're the Forrest. Go, go, go. Go straight and make a right. Actually, no, go straight and make a left and we got a car cross Valentine. Make a left. Left, 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 this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. I, I don't see an issue with it, chat. Like, I don't see this, like, breaking the rule of 10. There's roleplay behind it. Somebody who's we're close with is not part of our group. It's not some random person, right? I don't know. I don't know why 
We can't hit the transport. I just. If you rule. Well, six of us only hitting it. What do you mean PvP rule? What does that mean? I've paid people to help us before in the past. I've had people that are not part of my group ride with me and help me break the law. What difference is that? All right, let's slow down a little bit. A lot of horses kind of rush a little bit. I'm saying I'm done. I got, another, I got the telegram boy waving me down. Should I just go check my telegrams? Just keep going. What do you think? If you check your telegrams, I hope you know there's no way in hell we make it. And yeah. don't. All right. How is everybody looking as far as our horses right now? Uh, not too good. Right, 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 right. I, I like. I'm. I'm gonna be honest. By the time we got that telegram, nephew, even besides talking about what if we wanted to do it or not, That's I think it's it already we're, too late. We're gonna miss it probably. Yeah. Most likely. Uh, we're still on the way to me. Y'all ready? I'm gonna pick it up again. Yeah, it's like that 42 an hour. It's more, I'm pretty sure the rule is made for more gang conflict, right? Not really for gang, uh, conflict with law. So that's why, like, I'm not, not I'm like okay with it. If it was a gang, then I can understand what's, uh, if that's a gang, like, if that's a gang that had the like, fucked up in my gang, we had to step in to stop that gang? I can see that. It doesn't matter though. Uh, geez. You don't have to be in part of the original scene to break somebody out. It's not saying, man. I've read the rules. I don't think it says that in there. What do you want to do here? Do you want to go through St. Denis right away or go north of St. Denis and grab the boats? I don't know. I feel like... I feel like we, we could ride through St. Denis and if we don't see any law, then we go quick to the boat. All right, y'all. Even, even even the boat is extremely risky. It seems like Keep people didn't want to do it. All right, watch for me. I'll, I'll, I'll message the bot tonight. I'll ask that question. I'll, I'll message the bot tonight so we can get actual clarification. So we're not like, you know, in that gray area. Going behind right now. I'm about to kill Grandpa's horse, by the way. <laughs> it is a piece of fucking shit. <laughs> it's a Turkoman, it, man. It's literally the most awful horse the crossings ever breeded, okay? <laughs> How do you take a thousand dollar horse and turn it into a piece of shit? He's got two people on it, to be fair. Oh, that's no, it's fish. Yeah, <laughs> I held him, my Grandpa. <laughs> 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 Wait, what? I love you too, Grandpa. Yes, I fucking hate your horse. Hey, that's my horse. <laughs> okay. All right, uh, y'all ready to pick it up again? 
fish. How's your horse looking? We're good. All right, let's pick it up. Be able to push too long, but I can push for a bit. It's useless to push now. It's yeah, really we to push yeah, wait, wait, wait a little bit, a little bit in town. All right, let's push it now. Can I go hall? Let's go left. Howdy, howdy. Slow down a little bit, Everett. Let him catch up. <laughs> Alright, so if we see them, what do we want to do? I mean, let, at, at this point, uh, I think at this point we go slow, because if we're going into Saint Denis, it, it could, we could be going into a fucking hornet's nest. Uh, do we want to send in one? Uh, do, Ev, do you want to go in alone and scout? What do we want to do here? All right, take. Well, let's, the wagon, let's go. Let's go to the factory store right where Chen's used to hold out. It's a really good spot. Let's send me to the wagon. I see a rider. Ever, we're gonna make right. the wagon to the right. This factory to the right, right here, okay? Factory to the right. Come this way. Oh my, my cat! You've got to be. Oh my god, bro! I'm cat. June. Hold on. Nico, my local. I'm gonna have to restart my game. Uh oh, chat. It's the worst timing. Oh. So it's just a normal crash. It'll be fun. It'll be fun. You little shit. Why do you always attack my keyboard, my Go XLR? Okay, leave it alone. Leave it alone. Go XLR, go XLR. Yep. End it. Start it again. That's my my computer's like dying. Uh oh. My my, my PC is just dying. What is going on? Chat, can you hear Jimmy? That was wait, what? What is going on? My Go Excel keeps crashing. Thank you. No, oh, can't hear these people lying. My chat would never lie to me. My chat would never lie to me. My chat, you never lied to me? Bro, like my cat picked the worst spot possible to jump on my keyboard. This little shit, you could have picked any spot possible. My Go Explorer app is not working. Sorry, chat. This is like bad. I don't know. It's like, oh, what's going on? Okay. Okay.
I can't lay in front of my screen while I was playing earlier. Attacked me while I was moving. Always, every time. That's cats for you, man. Always. Find a way to do that. Ah, uh, dude. If something would have happened when I was crashed. I would have. I would have felt really bad. Uh, you're never gonna guess this. What? As soon as you fell asleep, ever it came back and said James on a boat. So we missed it. We missed it. Yes. As soon as you fell asleep, Ev came back in and James was on a boat. It was un very unfortunate timing. Thank you. Yeah, sorry about that, y'all. It, no, it's, it's not. not your fault. Don't apologize. There is still six law in town, and they so. already departed on a boat, so we should probably leave as soon as possible. Go. Uh, so Forrest, grab my horse. Yeah. Where's Rebecca? No, no, they were all in positions while we were waiting on you. Damn, dude, that's <laughs> unfortunate. That is unfortunate. It is what it is. Shit like this happens. All right, let's uh, let's move to Emerald, Emerald Ranch. Let's go. How much you could do? Man, they moved them fucking quick and through San Denis. Yeah. That confident, huh? I I mean, let, let's let's be honest. They they literally said to me on the transport y'all broke me out that they should have just gone to Saint Denis and if they're smart about it they would have had it same people waiting in Saint Denis for them to get there. We were. That's what we're doing. We had Saint Denis blocked off first. Yeah, but my, my point is if they do it smart they'll have ten law in Saint Denis by the time they arrive with James. All right, then the transport will be hit before they get to Saint Denis if they start doing that. Well, I, I mean my point is it didn't this time. It worked for them. I, I get why they did it. Yeah, like if they would have had six crazy. law or like eight law in Ansburg waiting for y'all and they fled to Ansburg while y'all tried to hit it on the way, y'all would have been fucked. He's still heading up to Mount Hagen. I mean, do we want to just go to Thieves or yeah, we what do we want to do now? I mean, if we, if, if we, if we, I'd imagine law's busy in Saint Denis now. I'd say if we're going back to Thieves, Ev will need to send telegrams back out. Yeah. Go to Emerald. We're going to Emerald right now. I hope they see you. They're not just waiting on the map. Actually, fuck it. Let's just go to Valentine. If if they if they fucking took James and they had Law waiting and, and you, you, how many Law did you see? At least five or six. Jesus Christ. And they had what five or six probably transport James. Damn. They were the, 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 let's just go to Valentine. Check Telegram. Send out telegrams to thieves and rob somebody in Valentine. Don't have to tell me twice, Uncle. Let's run! Was Maz in my chat? Is that somebody to the left or is that a local? Was that a local rider? Everybody good to pick it up? Yeah. Jump on the ledge. Let's go. This way. Well, I feel like he's more aggressive with the uncle around than himself. That's because um, with Jabaz, he plans things, right? It's easier to uh, ride with my uncle. I and CD. Comes up with a plan. We're good.
Go also see through, see how far he's come. Uh, I don't think he liked his uncle at first. He was the one making wise uh, cracks, but I think his uncle has his wreck now for sure. Yeah, I think uh, both the relationships have come a long, long way, man, compared to day one. Holy shit. It's been nine day difference. It was seen Dope Master between the cup between Javas and CD. That one with James Hurley, man. Fucking great scenes. It's unfortunate for Scarlet because James, who she was riding with, now is gone for like a long time. Damn. You got Uncle James for a long fucking time, brother. I know. That timing was so bad. Oh, damn I mean, it. it sucks that we got that. We're probably late and at Wallace. It was also such bad timing for us to where, where to be at to get it, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then bad timing for... It was already going to be hard, but then... <laughs> it, was, it was bad timing all around. We also just weren't prepped for a fucking... Transport ambush. Yeah. Also, the one, the one that we broke you out of, Uncle, once more... Put that shit together in five minutes, me and Aurora. We just said, we're doing this. Grab your, grab your ammo. Let's go. Everybody, let's ride. And then if this right. happens, we'll do this. All right, telegrams. Send out telegrams, uh, and then we can rob somebody in town. See if there's law in town, too, somebody. Yeah. I'm sending a couple to Mills and Alice if James is caught. Scarlet is called, too, as well. You said we're going back to these. Yeah. Yeah, fuck it. June apparently tried to uh, distract them. She can find a hostage. Who was with James besides Scarlet? Did she get caught too? Rudy. Rudy, obviously, yeah, but he's probably facing no time at all. I'm not sure. I saw him. Oh, June, June was with them, but she got away. Is it eight? Howdy. Four horses in town. One of them's got a braided horse tail. Ooh. Ooh. Uncle, we got some company in Valentine. How many? Four horses. Might be the people from the north. From the north. Fucking whose horse is it? Yours now. Hello. No, it ain't. One, one there in general store. One in general. Go through the front, I'm going through the back. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Howdy, fellas. What's y'all's names? Howdy. Name's, What's uh, yeah. name's Bernie. Oh my Bernie, god, it's Bernie! Bernie. Bernie. <laughs> Bernie and Amber again. Wow. Yeah. Bernie, y'all ride with anybody? Sebastian, no Bernie. Come no. on, man. Nope. No. No. I 
like the uh, like the gun felt uh, gun belt fellow with the blue shirt. Thank you. It's pretty old. What y'all doing over here? Just something by the general store? I'm not sure what happened, Mads. I don't uh, know. Yeah, we just, uh, we just, to, to be honest with you, buddy, we just did a little bit of mining because we're really tight on money and uh, just sold some of our, some of our stone. That's all. Well, we, uh, yeah. we were coming here. Uh, we're, put your hands up. Not gonna take everything. Just, uh, just wanna Thank see, you, fella. Okay. Yep. Sure. Let me see what you got on me. Oh, yours. What the, and so Bernie? Yeah, ben, I, my name's Bernard. Everybody calls me Bernie. Ooh, three hundred dollars. That's a lot of money, no? They uh, they call you Bernie the Butcher. It's a little bit. Like I said, we yeah. just spent they, all they day mining. Really, man. They used to. I've been hungry lately. What uh? What happened? Got a gun with no ammo inside of it. I just uh, like I said, man, made, we're pretty broke. Choices just trying mouth. to make some money to get some food and some Sam. ammo. Do you uh? Do you remember Sam Bass? Um, yeah, I remember Sam Bass. Rest his soul. Rest, rest his, soul, his soul. He says. Pardon? You say rest his soul. He said yeah, rest his soul. He this man away. tried to kill Sam Bass. Yeah, he Brian did. did. I didn't think you yeah. were on good terms with him. Yeah, but I, I mean, I, I never tried to kill him or nothing. Yes, he did. I, I this bastard is lying. Man. And if, if, if somebody <laughs> perishes, well then, may God rest their soul. See, if I thought, if I'm remembering correctly, and I could be misremembering, there was a time where you, where I was told that you were going to cut my uncle's tongue out. Now, I could be misremembering. Uh, no, I don't. Uh, I don't believe I ever had a problem with uh, w with your uncle. I know that uh, a colleague of mine did. My my uh, my issue used to be with uh, with myself and and James Kelly, but James uh, and I sorted that out when he gunned me down one day. I thought everything was squashed between me and him, Fair and enough. I moved on with my life. Fair enough. No, I, I just I'm yeah. trying to remember Billy Joe Barber. You were with him, correct? That yeah, he's a former colleague of mine. That's correct. And I, I, I could have sworn. I could have sworn. I turn around so I can yeah, you, you could even put your hands down. Yeah, y'all can put your hands up. You're good. Right. I, just, I could have sworn that. Uh, I thought it was Bernie the Butcher that threatened to cut my uncle's tongue out. My uncle, I, my uncle told me that uh, that you apologized for it. So I was trying to remember. I mean, it, I, I'm not. I, I don't remember saying that. It's quite possible. I've. I've had a, uh, I've had a lot, a lot of shit happen in the last few months. So I, I might, I don't, I don't remember saying it, but I mean, it sounds like something I could have said. So, yeah, I mean, it's, it's possible. I, I just can't remember saying it. Did anything happen or did you get injured or you just can't remember? Like you have bad memory. I have bad memory at, uh comes with the age. The reason why I haven't robbed him is because he was selling his mining stuff yeah, old. to the general store no, and didn't right. have a chance to bank it. It's not fair. 52. The fuck? <laughs> God damn, he's old. Yeah. But you could see how I might you he's know, got a ring hearing that name face. and whatnot. Sure. Especially oh. when from what the last memory I ever have of you is you threatening to cut out my uncle's tongue who's now deaf. Yeah, sure. I understand. And you know what? If if I was in your position, I'd be asking the same questions. But you don't remember. I honestly do not remember. I got an idea. He's gonna play with the coins. What's Flip coins off. Oh, I know John so well on Javas. Oh, uh, no, uh, never, never flipped a coin. Does that make him decide his fate based on a coin flip? Oh man, you got a coin. Yeah, 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 I do. Tell you what. Call the coin flip. All right. Tails. Just like that. You don't even know what you're betting for. Move the step away. Um, doesn't matter. I'm about to find out. Yeah, I fell with the blue shirt and ever step away as well, too. Come this way. Come here, Phil. 
Saying right in front of me. Final call, tails, correct. Tails. See yeah, if it's tails. balls or not. Let fate decide. Let's see. Hey, oh. <laughs> Alright. Well, if you don't remember, then you don't remember. But I don't take people threatening Sam Bass lightly. Come on, not me, guys. Don't worry about it. I actually just shutting the fuck up. Alright. Holy shit! <laughs> Alright, settle. Hate and blood. You get, your, you get your friend medical. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Take care, gentlemen. I told you, my coin's cursed. <laughs> Becky, you still want me to ride, or...? Uh, I can get my horse. I got my horse too. I wish I can ride with you now. You guys want to right. check the other games before we head out? We can check out the rigs if you like. Yeah, Law was show for Valentine. Rigs. Yeah, that's probably good. Really. Fish, you gotta, you gotta get a better horse than this. What? This horse ain't bad. It's the same rig as my horse. No, no, absolute no, shit. No, no. No, I forgot stairs again. My horse costs 2000 What do you mean? Yeah, you're getting fucking scammed. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> what? What kind of horse do you want me to get? Fast truck. Best horse in the crossing. No, it's not. Nah, I was just testing you. It's a normal. I can tell. I see a shit horse. I can tell it is. No, oh, for Crowstars. Bob is the best horse of the cross he's ever seen, okay? There's no equivalent. Fox Trotters are best, yes, right, I agree. Thank you so much. I'll, I'll happily get one. Let, Bob let's for me. Let's find the mine again. Which one? Yeah, I got some food. I, I got plenty of food, yeah. June's been cooking Somebody like mad. Somebody threatened to cut my uncle's tongue out and see what happens. Damn. Fuck around, find out. That fella don't even remember that's how old Let me it is. see if I can reach out to you. Yeah, yeah, that, as long you. as you do, though. Damn, dude. Man got chopped up big time. Holy shit. Shut up, you're thirsty. You know that Bernie guy? He's now Bernie the Butchered. Yeah, he was. Really? <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> Winsmore said he hasn't had a coin flip land on heads in two weeks. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he flips it every day. It was meant to be. I, my coin's cursed, so it was given to me by God. <laughs> it's weighted on the one side. Which mine? You wanna go back to the Big Valley mine? At which mod do you want to change your base? Your base. I'm assuming it's a big valley, so I'm gonna go this way. Yeah. Alright, uh, just follow me, I'm gonna take this there, right? Wait, we're checking Mount Shan? Is that what you said? I said big valley, and then Mount Shan. Oh, guy. Yeah, I got that. I got that. She's following me. You actually want to know what that what that mine is called in Big Valley? You know, just I. What did you, what was that? Do you want to know what it's what's the, the Sirens Cave or something, right? No, it's no, it's not. Who told you that? I don't fucking know. It's, it's called. I shit you not. You're gonna think it's a stupid fucking name, mm -hmm. but it's called the Devil's Throat. Devil's throat. You know, People call it Sirens Cave because when you're furthest in and you stand at a specific point and you're quiet, you can almost hear it singing like a siren calling you to the depths of the mine. Damn. Wait, is there really? Yeah. Yep. I didn't know. Oh, yeah, uh, well, there you go. That's why people call it Devil's Throat. That's why people call it Siren's Cave. 
A siren had got nothing to do with a pentagram. A siren is the fucking ocean, man. <laughs> That's why we call it a cave. Take it from a Oh my. Those were Peter and I would be funny. Yeah, I'm a fisherman. Once, uh... I'm a fisherman. First of all, I I I I'm pulling rank. I'm pulling rank as a master biter, man. I'm telling hey, you. Hey, have you caught a legendary fish before? <laughs> Oh, I caught one in 30 seconds, by the way. How? First cast of the day. Legendary fish. Uh, uh, That's how I roll. I bet you you're using my fishing rod. Nope. I was using Aurora's. That you probably got from me. Nope. How do you know that? You can you say for certain? I can say for certain. Okay, okay. Alright. I believe you. Thank also, you this ain't this ain't the way. Yes, it is. I'm surprised. I'm surprised he used Aurora's rod and Aurora didn't use his rod. <laughs> I made three thousand dollars. So, sorry. You can use my rod if you like. <laughs> Yeah, let's go fishing later. Hey, you don't tell me twice. Wait, do you think that's what he was doing when he went fishing with Fiverr? <laughs> yeah, probably. You uh, you want to rob a strawberry? I'm I'm going to Big Valley. I'm going to Big Valley. Yeah, I'm enjoying nature. Okay. I'm in a good mood. So I'm enjoying nature. That's all it is. I'm also um when I take us in these kind of routes, I want to see how my horse does off road for any like pursuits or shit like that. So I know when to um you know gallop, when to canter. Right. Get better horsemanship, that's all it is. I'm not even riding. How else will I know the crossing very well, right? So I gotta come on. See how fast? Look, look how fast my horse is for yours, right, Ebert? Uh huh. Terribly fast. <laughs> yeah, terrible. Fast. That's great, man. Your horse. Because I'm not going as fast as I can, Philip. <laughs> yeah, he's he's just being nice to you guys. Rob, I'm yeah, going the same making speed. you feel included. Listen, there's no faster horse than this horse, and he's got two people on this horse. Okay. Exactly. <laughs> Except uh, Rebecca is light as a feather, but you know. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold down, hold on. Thanks for making me feel good about myself. Of course. I just wanted to fucking hack his head off because he said he fucking did shit for Billy. Okay, I can't say that because Forrest has done that. But I like Forrest. Fuck that guy. Y'all talking about BJB? Fuck yeah, Billy. Yeah. You know what's so funny? You know what he's talking about? Oh, bear. God. So tired of bears. Five in one day. It's a good thing CD killed them all so you didn't have to deal with them ever. Mm -hmm. Y'all want to go inside? Yeah, weird. He always told Boone how he was going to fuck him in the ass all the time. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, man was obsessed with that shit. <laughs> what? They told what? Monty, Monty, Billy Joe Barber told Monty and Boone. 
all the time when they were talking, I thought he was gonna fuck them both. At the end. What? <laughs> the suck his dick. Like, are you, man's obsessed with that shit. He's an addict. Jesus Christ. That was awful. My eyes did not adjust. Can we go to, um... Oh, man. I should, we should stop to Valentine. I should have that, um... What do you want to do? What do you need? I needed a place where I could just, um, customize my navy. Why? What do you want to do? I want to add a larger barrel to it. Uh -huh. I want to extend a barrel. trying has got a short one. I want a long one. You want mine? No, I can do it myself. I just need to go down to the gunsmith. That's all it is. Okay. No, but like if he has one navy, yeah, I, I, I have one. It's already done. yeah. If he's the you? same as yours, but so. longer, is it? I don't believe so. I think it's the same size. Let's compare? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll compare. Hold on. Stand next to each other. Compare sizes. Hold up. Let me measure. Rebecca, don't look. Do you, do you need a, a third party to measure? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same size. I think it is. No, I think Forest is actually bigger. Damn it! Rebecca, you're not supposed to say that! What are y'all doing? They're comparing sizes. No, look, actually, at, look at my uncle. Look at my uncle. Actually, uncle oh, my, uncle's, oh. my uncle's got a bigger one. Put it in your holster. Oh, yeah, yeah that's, that's fair. <laughs> if it sticks out from the holster, it's, it's bigger. Is yours? Mine does. Oh, yeah, no, Forest is definitely bigger. No, but look at my uncle though. It's, it's a lot bigger than yours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, uh, okay. That's true, actually. Hold on, hold on. Show me yours. Turn around. But I wonder if that's because of the gun belt. No, but yeah. See, see, no, 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 no. It's because my uncle's got a bigger, bigger one. That's why. See, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> You're a fucking uh, child. Yeah, yeah. I see. Okay. Yeah. See, see how like, he's got like, a the little, tip is bigger. He's got like an inch longer. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's why. I, that's why I need to increase mine. Wow, oh, fucking inch! Hey, it's a game of inches, of course. One inch could be a difference between life and death. Yeah, sorry, Forrest, he's got an inch on you. At the least. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> We're comparing navies. I'll break the We ain't comparing elephant guns. Alright, well, I'm feeling risky, so follow me. Come this way. One dollar two to catch up. Oh, there's a horse right here. Whoa. Ooh. With a box. It was a box, now it's gone. <laughs> Without a box. <laughs> box made a tactical retreat. <laughs> you know what I don't see? I don't see a lot of folks using like um Parlophone Ranch or the Carrigan Ranch anymore as often. There used to be so many people around these areas back in the day. Because the Carrigan people dead. Yeah, but new folks can always come in. It's just I don't know why people hold on to things for so long. What actually People try and then people go there and go, these are just Kerrigan. Yeah, and yeah. So, like, new folks will come in and say, I, I want to run the farm. Like, no, this is Kerrigan. But the Kerrigans are never around. Yeah. They show up once in a blue moon. I, I think it's care. because they get told you're never going to own that place. <laughs> gives a shit. No, I was referencing back there saying we're never going to own the West. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Right. Neither is. I thought we were going to Sean. Survive that, <laughs> Becca. Becca, you okay? 
Oh, that was the oddest God. thing. I won't fly like I got con it, like lost from a cannon. I should look at all CD. It's fine. Oh, he's. Right. I got I got a bag. I'll pick it up unless you got okay. it. Okay. You pick her up. I'll I'll run a. I'll run a quick uh, test. See if her dogs are still barking. Rebecca, can you hear me? Well, at least she's not bleeding. That's a good sign. She might have passed out. Rebecca, can you hear me? Check her pupils. Oh. Fuck me. What was Why that? Why is Forrest doing this? He's the medical. I don't know what the hell happened, okay? Listen, I should be the one on the ground full of dirt right now, not you. Listen, Only if you saw what happened to me. We're birds, but, like, you didn't have to actually send me flying. I won't fly. I'm with you. Higher. Let's get some of that shit off you. Yeah, thanks. Okay. I'm gonna run uh, a diagnostic on you, Kai. You ready? Okay. What's your name? Rebecca Lang, motherfucker. How old are you? Uh, old. I don't believe it's a motherfucker you know in there, but I think she might be pink. Yes. Class. When's your birthday? Oh, like Santa. Uh, 14th of February. I never knew that. Thank you, Fish. Do you know where you are currently? She said it around the circle yesterday. Uh, yeah, we're kind of, sort of, in Big Valley, sort of. What country are we in? Uh, the fucking crossing. Mexico. <laughs> the crossing's not a country. It is a country, what do you mean? <laughs> okay. Yeah, right. we're in Saints Crossing. America. Saints Cross is not a country, it's just... It's a state. Well, it's not a state in fucking America. <laughs> Is? What you no, it's not. Guys, it's technically not. It's not. Guys, it's technically not. Okay, you're right. I do not recognize President Roosevelt as my president. <laughs> hey, somebody tried to kill the president. Wouldn't have this issue. We're in Guarma right now. Lucky, okay. Yeah. Okay. Then we know. Then we know who runs Guarma. Don't worry. It's gonna, it's gonna get a whole lot better right here. Come, come this way. Come this way. Does anybody actually mind that Mount Chan? Sometimes I have to find out. There's a different side of Mount Shan? There's two, there's two or three miles around here. What oh, the man. fuck? I never knew that. She's taking a real ball in the Yes, I am. Oh! Oh, here we go, just open again. The rocks, okay? Just you, watch your spacing. Watch your spacing. Climb it this way, I'm pretty sure. Where are you going? Where are you going? Up here. Hold on, hold on. Oh, shit. Where are you going? They got hit by a stray rock. What is this route? Fucking boulders started rolling. Come on, y'all. It's a new route I learned. Come on, come up here. Come on, come on. What do you mean you learned? You're oh, guessing. Way. I'm not. What the heck? Rebecca. Rebecca. Okay, when did you learn this rant? Uh, recently. Oh, yeah? With who did you learn this rant? Myself. I get lost in the woods. <laughs> so, you know, it's a straight shot, y'all. Come on. Believe. You gotta believe. Okay. There's a 
horse right here. <gasps> yeah, it's probably because there's somebody here, CD. We didn't believe in me. We did not believe in me, okay? Name yourself right now. I always believe in you. You didn't. Don't say that, Rebecca. You didn't. You're I always believe in you. Mm -mm. I was just you are not a believer was. back there. I was confused what route that was. Oh, hello. Howdy. Who's this? Howdy. This you speak? How you doing? Oh, bringing a Lancaster to mine, and she must be new, y'all. She must be really new. Hey, howdy. Ballsy. Shit, fucking hell. I've got to fucking pee. Come back. Okay, hello. <laughs> howdy. Howdy. How you doing? How you doing hey, today? Howdy, howdy, howdy. What's your name? Hey, howdy. Uh, Roxanne. We met before Roxanne. Uh, I believe we have actually. I believe we met down in um. Wait. Fuck. Well, like, well, Thieves Land. This is Georgie's. Oh. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, work with Julius. Oh, you work with Mr. Bradshaw? Are you yeah. part of his outfit? Yeah. That's uh, that's fine. Good eye, mates. Howdy. How y'all doing? I'd recommend if you're gonna mine, I'd recommend going out to Gap Tooth. You won't get robbed out there. If I do see you here, I'll definitely rob you for sure. Yeah. Oh, no, well, we, we typically rob mate. people out this way just because uh, we, we rob the caves in the east since we're from the west. Ah. Because fuck the east. Right. Yeah, no, it makes sense. Yeah. Well, yeah, I'll give this to one of you. You know, show good faith and whatnot. Okay. Seeing as we're here. Can I buy some of your flint? Yeah, what? all the flint if you want it. Thank you. If you uh, got any more gems you're looking to ever sell, just come on down to Thieves. I just want yeah, six. We'll I just want six pieces. You want six pieces? A yes. flint. I got you. Yeah. Cave is very echoey. It is very echoey. It's very yeah. all of a sudden echoey. It yeah. was not this echoey like five <laughs> minutes ago, nephew. Yeah, no, no, you're getting closer. The darker you go inside, the more echoey it becomes. Oh, ten dollars. Ten dollars for six pieces of flint. <laughs> yeah, you sure? You just take the whole thing here. Yeah, sure. Take the whole thing. Yeah, yeah, take the whole thing. You're welcome. Classy, yeah. your voice really carries. Yeah, it sure does. It's really, sure it's does. Really See, now, now it does not carry no more. Go, 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 Okay, all right. <laughs> all right, well, feel free to bring some more gems. Hi, right, Roseanne. Yeah. I'm really upset Roxanne. I didn't rob you. She's calling Roseanne. Yeah. Lizzie Roseanne or Roxanne. She gave, she gave over some free Roxanne. gems. Roxanne. <laughs> yeah. I'm Roxanne I'm, Stone. I'm, I'm, I've got a diamond now. It's that was fun. worth it. That was worth it. Maybe the maybe the robbery was the that was robbery. That you said no one ever mines in this mine and then we see someone. <laughs> To be fair, when more it is a criminal, so you don't make that happy more. Okay, now we go to things. Well, yeah, let's, let's, let's pass by strawberry, then tall trees to see. Right. If, there's, if we see law horses at, at the sheriff's office, like a lot of them, let's just go around strawberry. But if we don't see many, let's just, we can rob a ranger or something. Right. You want to rob a ranger? How about that? Well, well, the rangers are literally worthless. Um, if even... we see Olya. Yeah. I'd really like her robbed because when CD was having a fist fight with one of the rangers, she decided to point her gun at me. Well, I guess the rangers are getting dangerous, know. okay? I've got all your Litchfield on my back right now. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Versus Litchfield. That's what I'm making Scarlet bad for y'all. Yeah, you did. You did. I don't know why ranger needs such a fancy gun. I, I, I rose gold barrel. By the way, damn, like, that's expensive. Yeah. Very hey. nature oriented. <laughs> 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 they were really sick of me. See anything at the insurance office? 
Let's see, hold on. Slow, 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 slow. Yeah, I can go in there. There's a the horse outside. Come on, horse. No rangers or law. I want to check my telegrams. Yeah, I want to check telegrams too. Well, if we're not going into the snow anymore, change your outfit. All right, well, they'll take your time, old man. There's a few chains right here. Man, yeah, I'm not going to buy anything. Don't worry. Oh? It's a wild horse hitched up. Wild horse, I saw it from a pup. Yeah, but it's hitched up. It is hitched up. That was not a good sound. No. Junior's heading to the user. Oh, perfect. Yeah, I got my cell phone for sure. That's really funny. Oh, do you want me to? You are sadistic. <laughs> <laughs> There's a horse there. Howdy, anybody inside? Side. Haven't you oh, hey. trouble today? Oh, Who's that? Looky, looky. Danny. Howdy, Danny. Almost like fate. We meet again. G'day, guys. Almost so like it's destined. <laughs> All right, Dad. Look, we we've we've already talked to her already once today. Well, Danny, yeah. You you have yourself a lovely rest of your night. All right, everybody, let's uh. Hi, let's Deputy Danny. So you're on the way, battlefield yeah. one day. You are the fucking worst. <laughs> what? You're not the worst. Him, him. I'm talking to him. <laughs> I'm, I'm, she became a deputy. What do you mean? You don't think she wants to revenge her husband? I, I just said, let's go to Valentine, and you just turn off straight to the right. I did not hear that oh, part. To, to, to be fair, I didn't hear the Valentine part either. I mean, Valentine is straight. And yeah, I know, I know, I know, and I know, I know we're trying to throw her off and all, but I mean, I hope. Howdy, fellas. Oh, looky. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I'm there's not putting the gunner away. Y'all are gonna leave. Are you sure about that? We're going into town. Y'all can follow us Sheriff? if you like. There's not any. You, know, you don't got fucking backup. We just came. We are, we are not surrendering to you either. Just put three of us are down. Down. Put your gun away. There's not have to end in any bloodshed here, right? We were just gonna pass uh, by. You you want to fucking pull the gun out and point that fucking gun. You pull the gun. <laughs> you did just two seconds ago, to be fair. Even if it was accident, you still did it. Come on, love. What's this fella's name? Who's this? Schaefer. Schaefer? Schaefer, love. Put your guns away. Not necessary. I don't want to spill the Hey, hey, hey. Got your guns down. Follow suit, love, and Schaefer. I'm all right. How are y'all? All right. Put your gun away, ma'am. Where are y'all heading from? Blackwater? We are indeed. What, are you just heading to Strawberry? Mm -hmm. I know you, I don't think I know the the fella in the middle. Is that, is that love? Schaefer and love. Yes, Caddy. Met over in the west today, correct? I see. Hey. 
gonna rob any of them. I'm good. We're done playing of robbing law. I'm good. I'm not yeah. my code. I'm gonna not. What are y'all left? None of your business. <laughs> I mean, okay, I'm gonna make something very clear. You're not in a position to make a fucking demand, lady. Like it better if it wasn't. Didn't awesome. hear the like yeah. it better part. Out of Danny. Danny. Oh. Oh, another one into the mix. Look at that. Yeah. Perfect. Here to cause more trouble again, are you? You have not done enough today. You can save the you've got your point across. Hey, it's yeah, simply I'm just conversation, it, Danny. Danny. Surely you would know that. We had a long conversation. If it's with a you. conversation, what are we talking about? <laughs> a little bit of this, a little bit of that. My uncle will fill you in. Just getting to it. Okay. Molly is Today sorry. being career day, we all getting caught up to speed on something. You asked me what I was doing. We're just, uh, we're heading out. That's all we were doing. Saw you with the gun. You pulled your gun. I pulled mine. It's that simple. Yo. I ain't gonna rob you. I ain't gonna shoot you. I was close to shooting you though. To be honest. So you heading to Strawberry, and then what are you doing from there, Sheriff? Well, I suppose we'll find out once we get to, uh, Strawberry. Is that so? Mm -hmm. mm. What's the Strawberry? You know what? Uh, here, uh, a yeah, sheriff's yeah, office. As, as a gesture of good faith, you, uh, you might want to head to Valentine. Uh, well, if it's regarding what y'all did up that way, it's already taken care of. I see. What'd you do though? What did we do? Can you remind me? Sorry. Short term memory loss and all. I'm sure your uh, fellow gang members here can inform you. I'd well, like to hear from you, Sheriff. That's all. Uh, you injured a fella. That's the information that I've got. I beat him over what. the head or something. Sheriff, Shot him maybe, stabbed him. Sheriff, I'm the one that did it. It was me. Okay. There what you do go. you want me to do with that information? No, I'm just... You, you said it was everybody. It was just simply me. I did it. Okay, but everybody else was complicit in it, yeah? Nobody tried to stop you? They were there as extra guns, extra support, muscle. I flipped a that coin. That makes them complicit. <laughs> I, was I was ordering something in the general store. <laughs> Either way. <laughs> I'm the main one that did it. Machete them, specifically. Uh, is that about the robbery that took 150 bucks from the fella? That's the same person we're talking about right now. Uh, you need to clear your throat. A lot of bees around you, Phil. A lot of bees in your throat there, buddy. But yeah, machete them. You might want to... If you already got up people on it, then so be it. I was going to say it. We're heading out west. Most likely, at least. Maybe we'll go out east. Maybe we'll go up north. Who knows? Shall we run oh. into each other again, Sheriff? I'm sure we will. You know, you missed the party. We had eight deputies waiting for you down in uh, Armadillo earlier. No, I think you friends. missed a party. You met one of your deputies after you'd left. Patience, that's all it takes. All it is is patience, yeah. A little bit of patience. Or a little deputy rode in all mm. alone into us. We have the rivers. That's her name, man. All alone into us. And guess what? Both of them are insistent. I don't see any of us in our group having ridden into you all alone. Oh, they're friends of yours, though. See? Even the law knows that! <clears throat> Is so, better uh, now? You done with yeah, your speech better. there? You want your speech there, winners? Sure, Forrest. Thanks. I'm done with the speech that I was ne definitely time, having there. Next time that we've got six six of us, and winners, you ain't putting your gun down quicker, you're going to get shot. Uh -oh. oh my head. Oh. And we'd have a headache too as well. <laughs> Server shut down? Wait, what? Look what you did, Javas. Tommy on that was fucking impeccable. It was great. A Tommy on that was great, chat.
All right, sermon's back. Yeah, I cannot believe I streamed six hours on the alt channel, man. Jesus Christ, man. Six, seven hours stream main channel and six, six plus hours stream on the alt channel. Holy cow, okay? God damn. I need to start waking up earlier, though. I don't like the fact that I just keep going to like 4 or 5 a.m. My God, my schedule is messed up. Yeah, I just hate waking up late, that's all. I hate waking up late, man. I'm not a fan. Kicked him in the eye. Yeah. Then. Where's Grandpa? I don't think. He's old. He takes his time. Poor Danny don't even got a horse now. I think there's a stable right there. Okay. So. Jabas, I'm sure you are aware of how heavily you're wanted, right? Very. Okay. How, how, how heavy is it now? Uh, you are looking at well over 1,200 days. Ooh! That's true. Now, Ooh, what about me? Is thing I can talk to you about to uh, maybe give you a few reductions? We could, uh, if you're willing to turn yourself in, and I know that's a stretch. Obviously, uh, I'm not demanding anything. But if you are willing, I would be offering, I'd be willing to offer quite a heavy reduction. I'll tell you what, can I pull you aside from everybody? Cool. Yeah, my word. I'll even put my hands up if you're that worried. You need to explain the Ortega deals got going on. Who'd you end up naming? You said James and somebody else. Who was it? Yeah, what was your name? Scarlet. Hmm. She's speaking, I can't hear her. Yeah, could you speak a little louder, though? Scarlet. Well, the oh, it's the days. Mm -hmm. yeah, they both going away for. How is Scarlet looking? Is she looking uh, a little better or what? Local doctors had to take care of her. Fell Assuming off. gunshot wounds? Uh, no, just her old injuries. Oh, she shot. I don't know. She said I fell off her horse. Oh, okay. Was she shot before? You tell me. I mean... You tell me. Have you been shot before? Have you shot her? We shot at her. She wasn't hurt today. She had... It looked like old injuries to me. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. You say, saying you shot at her? I mean, we were pursuing. Okay, so can I use that same excuse when you... I shoot at you when you're uh, pursuing me? I'm just shooting at you. Scare you off. Not trying to kill you. We told them to stop. That's yeah, fair. That's fair. I'm just saying that uh, you try to What if to claim... we tell you to stop first? <laughs> I'm trying to hear your perspective on things because if you're saying that you're not trying to kill her by shooting toward her, but can I apply the same kind of logic to y'all? Did I say I wasn't trying to kill her? No. So you were trying to kill her. Oh, I was in, in, the, in the front. I was in the back. You ever so whoever was kill? in the front was trying to kill. Mm. Okay. 
conversation going anywhere? I'm asking you. You shoot to kill. I mean, do you shoot to what? Just maim? Why, uh, do you why always answer a question with a question? question. <laughs> <laughs> I'm asking you. Do you shoot to kill? It's a simple yes or no. You can just say no. If it'll make you comfortable, I can tell you my response. I shoot to kill. I shoot to kill all the time. Most of the time, because people's trying to kill me, I give what I get. I can guarantee you right now, any deputy you shoot towards is going to return fire and shoot to kill. Ain't nobody in the department got a distorted view on that. So she shoots to kill. If that's what you're looking for. Yeah, but I'm asking her to be fair. Yeah, I mean, asking her. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Look. We know Schiffer's answer. There you go. It's perfect. Anytime you shoot to your gun, it can kill somebody. So yes, basically yes. Okay, but why go through so many stretches just to get to that point? Why not just answer it right away? Why it take so long? Hesitation why do you need means to, know to my concede. Opinion? Because we got some time to have a conversation, so we're just killing some time. Building rapport, having a nice conversation. I mean, how often do we talk? Probably never, unless there's a hostage in between us. And even then, you guys just shoot to kill, right? Would you I'm... say this is a decent, lovely conversation? I mean, you guys are just going to twist anything I say anyway. Who said that? Uh, it's not very How nice. often do I go around talking about you, though? Just assume, I could be cordial. Stash Chafer here. He's talked to me plenty of times before. You talk to him. Yeah, but we're talking to you, though. That's we're talking point. to you. We're talking to Daniel. We're talking to Schaefer. We're just talking to everybody. That's all it is. But I start with you because you're the closest one. Unless we're not allowed to talk to you. Is it against the law? I mean, you could tell us fuck all. I, honestly, I'd like to hear the honesty. I love honesty. I love it so much. Uh -huh. You could even swear a bit if you want. Swearing is the most sincerest form of honesty. I mean, you can just say fuck you, right? Mm hmm. I mean, we know that's how you're feeling, right? You told yeah, me. You, done. you told me in the Blackwater Sheriff's Office sales that you took the badge because. You want to make that sacrifice and die for it. So why hide anything about how you feel? I ain't hiding nothing. You're acting like it. Hey, pa Maybe part I of that oath talk. that you swore... Uh, can, can you tell me if part of that oath was also okay for y'all to be suddenly shot straight through like Swiss cheese? Our oath is to serve and protect all. By any means fish. necessary? I feel like the by any means necessary is definitely important here because. Because uh, I remember. I, I remember Our having oath is to you. serve and protect all fish. That includes oh. your ass. Danny, can I ask a question? You certainly can, doesn't mean I'm going to answer it. Okay. Well, let's, let's make a, a, a yeah. sort of a. An example. Say five people have one lawman hostage in Blackwater and 13, 14 law show up. Would you, um, would you tell those lawmen to just shoot those five people like fucking dogs in the street? Sounds cross and I know what you're and I wasn't there. Fire! No, I, I'm just asking your opinion. Would you, would you? I mean, considering you serve and protect, right? Serve and protect, yeah. Every woman is different. We all have different values. We come from different forms of life. Just like Thanks. you. you just have an attitude change since the last time we've seen you. I see what you're saying. I was trying to say it's justice spelled out differently for everybody involved. That's good to know that not everyone would do the same, because to be honest, we've seen a lot of it. I'll take you at your word up until it ain't true no more. Just to we let need... you know. The difference between Danny and uh, the person who called her, you know, one used to be an outlaw, one one isn't. Exactly. 
No, I want to be an outlaw with a badge. Where do I get one of those? You guys got applications on you. I'll happily take one. Been needing something new to wipe my ass with. Jesus Christ, fish, come on now. Yeah, it was... Listen, I feel bad for the, for the three of you because, um, you know, you three I've never had any problems with whatsoever, but some of the folks in your department really paint a bad light the rest of you, right? So, it makes it hard to um, get along when you got people in your department trying to kill us. You try to kill us. They started. We're here to finish it. Reactionary force. I wanted to kill Law. If I wanted to target Law, that's a path I can easily take. Anybody can pick up a gun and shoot somebody with it, right? Yeah, and actually, part. that day we were chased by Law over and over, and every time we moved, they kept coming at us again. We weren't trying to do anything. He was what? Law. How, how heavily wanted were y'all? I'm not sure. I didn't get Long. Frankly, I wasn't even that wanted. I know I got up the next day. What it felt like. I want to believe there comes a point in time when somebody becomes too wanted and has sure, high so I get that. Listen. Bystanders. I can tell you, I've been shot down without even fear. being wanted. If you wrecked up a lot of time because you did so much crime, I totally understand. You should expect that type of thing. That should be a given. I'm with you on that. I'm just saying, some people are leading with their emotion. Not their mind. They're not being very clear. Clarity has been something that is not found in the sheriff's office recently. I appreciate well, you much trying like, to Much uh, like Deputy Jackson said, it varies from deputy to deputy, but I will say that emotion, if channeled right, can be quite useful. Thank you, Danny. As long as it don't cloud nobody. Sure. But if I got some bad apples in my group, I'll make sure I talk to them and fix their shit. That's all it is. So maybe hold yourself responsible or others, too. Sheriff Winters, could you telegram me when you get to Strawberry as well, so I have your telegram directly? I do not have your telegram. I'm going to give it to you right now. All right. EJ572. EJ572. <laughs> Some of you are right. Don't come with these landing tomorrow. I'm not trying yeah, to um, nice instigate fully. I'm trying to instigate slightly. All right. Yep. Y'all take care. Stay Be safe. safe. Too. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna get my horse. Okay. I can come with you. We can walk you over there, Danny, if you want. I'm just fine. Appreciate the offer. We got it. No hey, just remember, you're not leaving us. We're leaving you. Yeah. What does that mean? <laughs> Trying to fuck with my song. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> he stuck the land in there. Y'all let him know that we're leaving them, but not leaving us, okay? It's a power move, that's all it is. I'm gonna be honest with you. He just guaranteed me no solitary if I turn sol solitary if I turn myself in right then. Why'd you take it? Uh, why'd you take it? Because I want a conversation with Ortega to try to get it permanent. I don't want it to be just for this trip. How much reduction was you willing to give? He said heavily. Oh, you imply? Okay. Get back to you. I am very, very happy with myself that I have a lot of trigger discipline because I was inches off blowing when I honestly, I was about to make the call. Yeah. I really want to push fate every single time. I swear to God, it's just... It's almost like... Gun down, and then he put his gun down, and honestly, even if Ortega's not there, I actually have faith. He told me that he would try to get Booker to sign something for me not to go to solitary ever again if I gave over the information I offered Ortega. All right, because it, unfortunately, it Big L is out of state right now. The man left Jessica, and it isn't oh, Halloween. What? Yeah. What the fuck? I mean, must I'm, be something I mean, important then. Watch him come back with more uh, torch technique and more walls burn around Siska. Man told me he never leaves Sisica unless he goes out. And the only time he goes out is on Halloween, and that's the only chance we have to kill him. 
So remember, we're leaving you, not leaving us. Exactly. Thank you. Okay. I don't. I wanted to. Uh, yeah. List. It's. It's not that when he put his didn't put his gun down. It was when he like turned around and pointed his gun. Is when I was about yeah, to blow his head I off. Yeah, that's almost did it too. Yeah. Oh, it's like. Fuck. Are we the devil? Is every lawman I try to talk to, they're like, I don't want to talk to you. No, they just hate you. Uh, I met a couple of people in Thieves Landing. I was going down there to get work fine. and things like that. I met your friend Aurora, and these folk were just taking me to sound the knee. Now we're heading right to Thieves Landing right now. How you doing, Vern? I'm doing just Sophia. fine. Hop yourself to best. Doing all right. It's, uh, Sophie, by the way. Sophie, Sophie, sorry. Oh, the Sophie, that girl that wants to kill. There, by the way. Yeah, we're heading down there now. Y'all, everything good? Are y'all good? Yeah, we're just fine. We're just fine. Thanks for asking. Yeah, no problem. All right, well, Vern, uh, next time you telegram me, attach your telegram, would you? Yeah, we will do. we will do. <laughs> Perfect. Rest y'all take care. Y'all take care. Goodbye. Yeah, I care, mate. Au revoir. Oh, it's a... Is she speaking French? Oh. Yeah. Oh, my God. There goes the fish. He and heard I, French, and then he had to go. The, the one with the... Uh, He's the about one, to beat him, but get here pretty soon. The one with the blue bandana reminded yeah. me of blue toes. Say cigar. Oh, you know, you know, some fish you can feed him some bread in the pond. Uh, what? <laughs> what? what <did> you <laughs> oh, never mind, never mind. It doesn't matter. I don't know. I don't know. It does not matter. It matters to me. A really dumb joke. All right. Of jokes, funny is my is my middle name. Sometimes, listen, on listen, special listen. Day. It's just, right, it was listen. funny for a second. I realized that joke is not funny anymore. I tell you, my time. <laughs> okay. Well, you character it yourself is talking about how he's the devil. Poor June. She needs some tough love. Okay. <laughs> she, she's about to go back to John. I'm calling right now. Since James, she's not going back. She's going back to John. No, she's, she's not going back to John. Back no, no, no. Second, John gives her a hint there. of attention. She's going back in. She's not going back there, and I think she's actually going to learn from this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go back. If she goes back there. I'll slap her. Why did I step so late? Why did I step so late? Howdy? You okay? Hello? Okay. Yeah. What's wrong? Nothing. I mean, there's something. June, you couldn't save him. It happens. Jesus, you dropped it on my foot. Watch it. What's inside it? Porn. Good work. Oh, oh. I was gonna get more, but then uh, Uncle James got captured, so I stopped picking. I mean, listen. I know you're trying to help. You're trying to get him out of there, but that's how it is sometimes. <gasps> I'll move this somewhere. What I want you to do, though, is keep working hard until he gets out. So whenever he comes Here, out of Cisco. You'll be ready for him. Yeah, reach for it in my back pocket is payment for getting me the corn, yeah? No. Mm. I don't want it. Thank you, though. Rebecca. Then go get more corn. <laughs> Here, could you take the money from my back pocket and make sure you give it to June? <laughs> yeah. Well, you want the earth for free? I'm gonna ask you to do more things now. Your family. Of course. <laughs> I was in Blackwater.
When was this? Just now. You need a lot of stuff, Blackwater? Me down. What was? Uh, Sheriff Winters was. Yeah, we are. We had a conversation with him. I saw a strawberry. Mm. Well, Varric was there and chased me down. John's in a coma because he decided to dole Nathaniel for some reason. Jamie's a surprise. I treated the fall him. from grace has been so bad for him, huh? Did he at least fucking pay you first? He's unconscious, Andy. Go rob him, anyway. buddy. Let's go I have a rob telegram him. from him where he claims that he did everything he did just to keep you safe. And then he was going to give you the $250. Varric tried to say the same thing. He he cited the fact that, oh, we're loyal. We came to Gorma to keep you safe because Nathan was threatening you guys. And I was like, yeah. And then afterwards, he was told to leave it alone. He said he had no intentions of doing anything. And what did you guys do? You fucking stabbed him. So you ruined it. And then I called him out for not having any kind of loyalty to leadership. He said that... They all ruined every opportunity they had put upon them. Anyway, there's a whole group here. Uh, oh God! <laughs> oh, God. oh, God. Okay? Oh, fuck me. God damn, I fucking hurt. You okay? Yeah, I look like it. Uh, yeah. You want to kiss your boobos? It's fine. I'm going to wash my face. Ow. Oh, he was standing behind that horse for so long. It just missed. 4.34 a.m. and I have classes from 9.30 to 5. Oh my god, man. What are you doing up so late? What are you doing up so late? I'm asking myself the same question. Why did I stream so late? Why? Why am I doing this to myself? What the hell is that? I see a ball action. <laughs> you, is that you? Well, well, well. If it isn't Fiverr. Hello, is he? What are you doing over here? Uh, so I was in the West, right? And I was waking up and I called my horse Salem. And then Salem, for some reason, wasn't coming when I called. So instead of going all the way down to Armadillo, I figured I'd just go here because I have to go meet Mills all the way up in the, uh, near, uh, Wapiti. Hmm. You're going now? So come. Yeah. You want to come? Don't want to come. Okay. But what I want from you is I want to mount money because I'm the reason why you found a gang in the first place. You want you want money? I want five percent of your eternal earning, the rest of your Forever. life. Forever. Forever. Oh, you'll be mighty disappointed. I don't have a lot of money, nor do I make a lot of money. Did well, you rob a train get, today? Get started, Fiverr. You want to become an outlaw? You I wanna tried be... to rob a train today, but the lady was already robbed. To rob her again? She didn't have anything. She was already robbed. And find a train full of, uh, I don't know, high-value targets. Like real rich people, real fancy rich people. Listen, Ivor. Uh huh. Uh huh. I see right through you. Okay, you can't fool me. I wasn't trying to. You have done a good job so far. I must say, I'm really impressed. I'm really impressed. I, when I when I went and brought you back to Thieves Land, I thought to myself, okay, this girl is not gonna last a day. No, I'll give it a day at most. But look at you, my God. I mean, what you got accomplished in a short amount of time is impressive. I don't you know what so? you do. I don't know you that well. But from what I've seen so far, I mean, must be a genius in that mind of yours. Ah, uh, no, I'm not a genius. I make a lot of mistakes. Yeah, 
Somehow people find a way to just grab their food. I don't know. I don't know what it is about you, Fiber. Okay, I'm not what you say or what you do or how you um make yourself appear, but you do an impressive job. You um, um remind me of my good friend Jesse, but more of um a lighthearted version of him. Jesse Gold. That's right. I don't know if that's a positive thing. It's bad. It means you're a schemer. Yeah. I'm not a schemer. It means you're scheming your way into things you want. What am I scheming? Want. What are you? Okay, all right. What am I scheming then? If I'm a schemer, then what am I scheming? <laughs> am I? That's the exactly law? what am a schemer would say. No, no. Honestly, tell me. Same. Everyone always seems to have some sort of deep mistrust, and I'm not sure why. Maybe it's because you know. Because someone. Because you can't you trust people that you. fast. You can't just Fair bring enough. people into the whole thing and trust them that fast. It takes time, right? And you don't it's truly like... know somebody till they show their true colors. And once they've done that, that is the person you should know forever, right? Fair. Too nice. You're too, you think nice I'm too nice. And you're hiding something. What am I hiding? You don't know. Ask me any question. I'll answer it honestly. I give you my word. And I give my word. I don't break it. See, Fiber. You're not my problem no more. The second you left Thebes Landon and went to run with Mills, he's all yours. I don't have to worry Positive. about that. I'm trying to be a problem. I'm just trying to be open and honest. I'm not saying you're a problem. You're going to become a problem pretty soon, though. Why? Why am I going to be a problem? Well, let's see. There is um, a fellow by the name of Fish that runs with us. And there's a girl that goes by the name of Fire that runs with Mills. A mm -hmm. fish, and fiber, they're good friends, but their friendship is, uh, I don't know, a bit shaky right now due to the fact that males and Javas believe it's not very beneficial for both sides to have fish and fiber see each other. Actually, CD, Mills doesn't give a shit who I hang out with or spend my time with. He said to me, I don't fucking care if you spend time you sure with fish. Are you sure about that? Are you sure about that? I'm very sure. I spoke to him. Honestly and openly, and I don't lie to him, and he doesn't lie to me. I said, why can't I spend time with fish? He goes, Jabas wants me to tell you not to spend time with fish. And I said, okay, Mills, since your friendship with Jabas is very important to you, and I respect you so much, Mills, I will honor that request. And I will not speak to or hang out with fish if that is what you want. How does he goes, that make I you don't feel? Care. You don't care. No, he said, I don't care if you hang out okay. with fish. It doesn't feel good. I like being friends with fish, but... Mills and Alice are far more important to me than a friendship with fish. No offense to fish. I like fish a lot. I enjoy spending time with fish. But I'm not going to lose the people who've had my back. And I'm going to show them why they should keep me around. And I'm not going to let any fucking You're trying take them to from prove me. yourself. Yes. Why? Why does it matter? Because I don't want to lose them. See, do you want to lose your family? No, but eventually everything comes to an end. All good things in life come to an end. And I'm ready sure. to, um... I'm ready when things come to an end. I, I fully accept my fate and where I am today. I'm not bothered by the fact or the future or how things are going to change. Because I fully accept it, right? If you don't, then you're going to feel like you're never in control. Suppose so. So you're telling me that Mills has no issue whatsoever with my uncle as a problem. Yep. Essentially, I think Alice obviously doesn't like fish at all, and I'll respect her wishes as well. But Mills told me, Jabas said, he doesn't want us talking to each other, fish and I. And I said, if that's what you want, I will honor that respect that you have and that history you have with Mr. Jabas. And I won't go against your request because you came to me and asked me not to. Even though you said it wasn't because you wanted me to or not, it's because you wanted, because Jabas wanted me to not. Hmm, I see. What if Mills using my uncle as an excuse to tell you that? Mills wouldn't lie to me like that. How do you know? I believe Mills. I trust Mills. I love Mills. Hmm. You know, as long as you're happy, I honestly don't care. I'm glad I brought you back to Thieves. That way you met the people of the West. Too. However... There's something about you that I never got to fully understand. Maybe I'll never because we don't spend a lot of time together. And honestly, we can not... change that. No. I don't think you want to spend time with me because um, if you do, 
I'll probably put you in difficult situations where you gotta choose between riding with me or other people. And then I don't want to deal with the responsibility. If you get hurt, I have to answer to an angry mob of people out west. See, I don't want to deal with that. That's too much politics. I can understand that, but if I decided to go off and do something with you and other people one day, that would be my own responsibility, not anybody I, And I else's. wish the people that are protecting you would feel that way, but they don't. I tell them. I tell them that then. I'm not a child. That's the problem. You get treated as such. I'm not trying to. Come on, to. think about it, right? Think about it. Mills and Alice, they're like what? Father, mother figure to you, right? Um, they I suppose more like teachers than mother, father. Mentors, teachers. I mean, yeah, that's mentors, how it starts, yeah. right? I mean, parents are supposed to teach. I guess. I'm just letting you know, father. Okay. I see, uh, I see a lot of Jesse inside of you. Or, I really wish you didn't, but I can't change that, I guess, until time passes and you no longer feel that way. Right. And um, obviously, um, you know, you have your own thing going on. I got my stuff going on, Thieves. Maybe if our path cross together and we spend time and I get to know you, it's sure my opinions will change. And I'm sure you'll feel the same way about me, but... I'm just focused I don't on have anything that's concerning about you with me. You're very open. You're very honest, I suppose, if you could say that. You're very accepting of who you are and what you do. But it seems like you think there's something completely different going on with me. And honestly, that sounds like something you need to sort out. Because I know who I am and I know what I want to do. Mm. And if you don't know that, then I'm offering you, I'm extending a hand. So you can learn if you want, but that's all I knew. Well, I mean, the only thing that makes me suspicious is the fact you're too nice. That's all. So, uh, because I'm too nice, I, I can't fucking lonely, yes. be trusted. Not trusted. It's too hot or something. What am I hiding? I wish people would tell me so I could fucking I don't know. know. That's the problem. If I knew, I would tell you. If, if I had the answer to my question, what are they telling you that? Then ride around with me or let me ride around with you. For a day, not officially. Out of your back. Well, um, I know, the, I know you got some folks waiting for you. We'll uh, continue the channel at time. Just remember what I said. And um, do as you please. Best of luck to you. All right. Well, hands out there, CD. Whoops, sorry. If you want to take it, that's up to you. Be safe. Ride well. Bye. You okay? No, I'm not okay. What's wrong? I'm so dis... I feel so disgusted. Don't tell me Fish and June are going at it. No, no, it's worse. Grandpa? Mm. Ever? <sighs> Uncle. I'm, I'm about to throw up all my food. Hold on. I just feel so sick. Hey, Snoozy, chill. So, Forrest what gave um, Jabas his pipe back after modifying it. <laughs> You know what his pipe looks like, right? A pussy? Uh, yeah, it's like a naked lady and he like sucks the pussy, right? Yes, yes, yes. Uh-huh. He put a fucking red corset on it. At least it wasn't a pink one. Mm. What? Maybe he's a vampire. No, he's trying to make you look like Aurora. I feel physically ill. I thought something bad happened. You got me scared, Rebecca. Jesus. Uh, trust me, that was so, bad. So, hear this? I had a conversation with Fiber. Yeah. I told Fiber straight to her face. I think she's a schemer. I said that to her. Okay. I, don't, I don't care. If, Is that why she wants to spend a day with you? Yeah. Yeah, because I'll fucking kill her. I mean, I want to I wanna get to know her because I, I do think she's definitely hiding something. Nobody's that nice. Nobody's that... I don't know how to explain it. Okay, sure, but someone's chaperoning. Sure, I mean, Rebecca. Because I don't trust her. I trust you. I trust her. Listen, she's saying to me that Mills and Alice are an issue with fish. It's my uncle that's saying no to it. Yeah, it is your uncle saying no to it. Why? Well, I just had a conversation with him. 
And he said that he's uh, not said no forever. He just think it, that because it's still fresh and because Alice doesn't like first, that he's given it a little bit before he uh, allows it again. Um, I think it's probably best if you could just like, takes your hands off this. What do you mean? Like don't meddle in it. Maybe I want to. Why? I don't know, because if I was in the same position as a fish, I wouldn't take this as an answer. Okay, but you're not fish. Right, but I see a I problem mean, on the surface level. Yeah, and do you know what I did when I saw that problem? Mm -hmm. I went to Jabas and I said, hey, is this really the right thing to do? And gave I already him talked to him. I already, I already talked to my uncle, though. And I even love fish okay. and him to talk, so... Yeah, and I suggested... That Fish and Fiverr, Mills and Alice and Jabas all sit down and have a conversation and try to solve whatever issue they're having. And Jabas told me it's him that has an issue and not the others. What do you mean it's him? Yeah, that is Jabas that's not allowing it. And he's thinking about it for a couple of days. Okay. This is what it is then. I mean, I haven't done anything. I just... I've spoken the truth. Like I've always so, had. Why do you think she's a schemer? I mean, I don't trust her for a second, don't get me wrong. Nobody comes to Thieves Landing. Nobody comes down to Thieves Landing and is able to just run with males like that so easily. I don't know. I don't know Mills, but maybe he's got a soft spot for young, sweet, innocent girls. I mean, a lot of people do in the crossing. Is that Aurora? Yeah. See now why I feel disgusted that he's sucking tobacco out of something that looks like her. I mean, we've done worse. Mm. Yeah, but <laughs> now he's doing it in public. It's definitely got to be out of your eye socket, man. <laughs> howdy, howdy, howdy. <laughs> why does Grandpa look like Everett? <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have a fucking stroke. <laughs> so, uh, what's going on? Uh, oh, you know, Jabas uh, is just celebrating his brand new pop. Mm -hmm. or, well, it's well, the same. It's the now. Same you one. were talking about making a pipe out of me. <laughs> <sighs> I mean, you know, eventually done a pipe, right, Uncle? Okay. It's true. Listen, okay, I'm gonna be honest. Okay. If you two want to fuck each other's brains out, by all means, go ahead. But please don't oh. do it in front of us. So if you want to suck your pipe and suck her vagina, please don't do it in front oh of me. Oh my he made Jesus a naked Christ. Pipe stop, stop, stop. Already. I just asked for a red corset on it because I thought yeah, it'd be funny. Yeah, but now it looks like her, and now I can't look at her. Hey, it doesn't have blonde hair. Offer to put Come on, Rebecca, we're all grown ass people. It's fine. Listen. Now y'all pin like you're 12. Her vagina. I requested a Japussy pipe. Or Japussy. Am I okay to smoke my cat? I mean, I don't, you easy, please, Uncle. I don't give a shit. Or is you pussy? got two. Two? <laughs> I can't even look at Aurora right now. I don't even have the pipe out. It's you get to have fault. two pussy pops. Wait, Aurora, do we have the same pants? <laughs> okay, that was pretty <laughs> funny. What? I got the joke. I got the joke. What? Hold on. I'm not have to dye my hair blonde. In a war corset. No! Y'all, y'all. Y'all have the same belt, too. Ooh. A couple more clothing and we should be good. Oh, God. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> All mm, right. So now you just have to get it different. I, I, I was going to say, you know, I mean, I'm, gold, and then you get I, I, I mean, I'm taking commissions right now. I'm currently making one for James. I'm making I'm good. I only smoke cigarettes, so I'm good. Yeah, I, I like a cat pipe. I, that way I can smoke my cat when I'm around Thieves Landing. Can you mean me like a lawman pipe so I can be smoking that law? <laughs> 
Whoosh. I, I, I can make you a lollipop. What? I would give it to Maple. <laughs> and Kramer. You should make one for yourself. That looks like a fishing hook. I was actually thinking of fish head. Fish head would be nice. Mm, I guess. You were going to smoke a fish? Yeah. Mm. I fish in a barrel. Yeah, I would like a, I would I would definitely like a cat pipe. That was going to be my next request. <laughs> what are you going to do with all these pipes? Well, I'm just I'm going to only have two. Well, the one's going to James. <laughs> Which one's going to James? The dog, the dog. pipe. I, I'm, a, I'm actually... <laughs> the so, doggy pipe. So, so I want your idea because you told me, you told me, um, you know, a, a, any kind of dog that you think would resemble James. And I've been, I've been having a, a hard time thinking of one. And I don't know why, but the first thing that came to mind was a wiener dog. <laughs> <laughs> but I feel like that'd be terrible. Come on, I need advice. What 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 dog do you think James would like? I was thinking like a cocker spaniel, a retriever. What? No, a retriever is too much like a like a command kind of dog. Ooh, like you tell it what the, to do. You we need like a dog that's like free. Or a, pit, a pit bull. Mm, what about the really? Not a bad choice. Is there any dogs in Australia? Doberman. Yeah, oh, sheep dogs. Sheep dogs. Dog. Dog. Sheep dog. <laughs> sheep dog. <laughs> yeah. I can see James. Uh, Charlie and Bulldog. Is there a type of dog that has Muppet in the name? Oh. I don't know. Is there a pup Muppet? A pup Muppet. A pup Muppet. Hey, listen, the storm is coming, so I'm gonna take shelter and yell good night. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow, okay? All right. Don't get caught by the law, night. please. All right. Be safe. Good night. What about that? Rebecca, I'm going to bed. Good night, June. Oh, shit. Good night, June. Love you. She upset. She was unable to help James. Ooh -hoo. She wasn't there when they were getting caught. But she wanted to help us, and so she feels guilty. Oh, she's learning now. Told you, give her time. Let her experience these on her own, and she'll be all right. She'll get sad. She'll uh, bicker and vent, but she'll learn from it grow stronger, right? Yeah. Just wish I could take that sadness away. Yeah. No, I know. Did you hear that John apparently dueled Nathaniel Green? Yeah, I heard so. I don't know. Fucking idiot. Man, he's really following the footsteps of Zip pretty well, huh? Yeah, he is. Real idiot. Oh, look at that. Prom kind of cancel each other out with him in green. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Why wow, you really got ready? Good night, Rebecca. Good night. Oh, chat. I am tired, man. Good night. Love you guys. Thank you for watching the stream. I need to charge my phone, lay my head down. I love you, child. Thank you so much for watching. Be back in the main channel tomorrow.